Today is the final day. This is it. This is all that we have left. One day to finish this game, which honestly we're not that far away from, but I still have my work cut out for me here. We're adding an entire new room to the Rage game today. We're adding music, sound effects, and everything like that. I also have to sneeze now. <coughs> Excuse me. Bad start, but it's fine, because that doesn't matter. What matters is we're going to get started right away. We're not going to waste any time. We're literally not going to waste any time at all. I Well, okay, we're going to waste a little bit of time because I messed this up, but that's besides the point. We're just going to let the music play. A lot of viewers skip ahead. You guys know the deal. Let's just get this in position. That's better. There we go. Let's head over here. We're not wasting any time. All right. Let me show you guys what I've done because some of you guys have not even seen what happened yesterday. What happened yesterday... Uh, make her good try. <laughs> what happened yesterday after stream changed a lot of things, all right? So yesterday you guys saw the first build, the build 0 0.69, which hilarious. I know you guys are so funny. Um, but you guys didn't see what happened after stream unless you went to Andre's stream. Then you know exactly what I'm going to show you here in a second. I added more to a few sections. First of all, pipes has been extended Pipes is now much more than Pipes was before, but the more important extension was the lasagna floor room, which I guess we're calling it that now. This was stopping right here. It stopped right here before. Now it's got this entire section as well. So I have extended everything out even further. Laser room's the same, but, well actually laser room's not entirely the same because now there's this chaos right here. Uh, after this ending, which is then going to lead us into our final room here, which this is the part that I haven't shown anyone yet. We go into the final room here, which up at the top is the ending pod. That is how I decided we're going to end things out in this game. Uh, where did it put me? It put me down here. Right. So, of course, I took an allergy pill before this, and then I start and I immediately sneeze. I'm a professional game developer. Okay, so the ending is going to be you enter the pod and something. I don't know what it's going to be exactly, but you're going to get sucked up into the pod. Also, you can spam jump here, and it's hilarious. Uh, and that's it. That, that's where we're going to end. But that'll be six, seven rooms? I don't know how you want to count it. Let's, let, let, let's actually count it, because I think now there's a good point. Like, checkpoints count it. So, this can technically be room one, but I think this is more room one. Then this would be room two, pipes. Then this would be room three. Then this first half would be room four. The top would be room five. And then this ending would be room six. I guess. Even though that would technically still be part of room five. I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Count it however you want to count it. I gotta blow my nose. Give me a second. All right, now we've been caught up. Hello, fellow game dev. Also currently uh, game deving. Well, don't watch me then, because it'll be very distracting, I'm sure. That looks like an Iron Maiden. No, it does not. It looks like a random sci-fi pod. This does not look... I mean, okay, it kind of looks like an Iron Maiden. But no, it doesn't look like an Iron Maiden. <laughs> Vi beaning, yes. Welcome in, Flavius. Tutorial and room one through six simple. Yeah, kind of Played rage game yesterday and got sad. You know, that's the most accurate reaction you could possibly have. So here's the ending uh, Of the previous section my nose is just really not happy with me right now. Hold on a second Hopefully that doesn't last too long. Okay. You're now at 50.3k. Jesus Christ. You've messed up the collisions for bullets in your game. Um, well, uh, good luck. Because that is a nightmare. Why am I red? Why am I, like, super pink? Hello? Excuse me? Camera? What is- why? Why am I- Why? What? It's this? This piece of music is so pink. Oh my god. Oh, my light's not on. Oh, that solves the problem. Hold on. The 
the lighting looked so weirdly normal at first that I forgot about my light. What's on my wrist? This is a, uh, it's a little slider thing for my wrist so I don't get carpal tunnel. Uh, it's actually extremely helpful. It took a while to get used to having something wrapped around my wrist like this, but I now can't use my mouse without it, so my mouse just kind of glides around easier. I did not apply sunscreen, yeah. That was it. I got sunburned in my own house. Orange void. <laughs> More like pink void, but I'll take it. Alright. Anyways, back to it. Now. Alright. So, here's uh, here's what we're going to focus on today. Okay, wait, no, I was going to show you the ending. Where did, what is, what did I grab? Why did I put it over here? Hello? That's not what I was trying to do. So, this is the ending of that previous section. You make it to here after the lasers and it's chaos. Um, and I get zapped by that laser. Uh, and then you have to jump down here and there's a homing laser and there's a lot of spikes. Uh, is this just too much chaos? Probably. But, I mean, you can. It is possible. I did it last night. I just don't remember what the method... That works. Oh, well, not for long because that homing laser is right there. Oh, it's, it's looking up at its max. I think if you jump on the camera, it kind of helps... Nope, that's a lie. How did I do this? Because there's no save there. I guess you could like jump to the most open area, which would be here. There's two lasers. No, there's the, uh, this might be too much. This this is the end of this next section. The reason I wanted to do this is because this area is kind of easy up to this point, and I want there to be another save in that next room. So yeah, there now I'm in. So then there could be a save here. I don't know. That could be a lot. That could be too much. Also, I forgot to do things. Man, I am just a professional streamer, guys. I am such a professional. My nose is also getting going again. Thought they were a bracelet with a small pair of glasses. Yeah, 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 exactly. I mean, you could you could see it like that for sure. Natural vitamin D blasphemy. If you think I'm not super deficient in vitamin D, uh, you don't know me. <laughs> Hop in every now and again and claim my free points. Alright, thanks for being here, Spoon. Appreciate you. Alright. Uh, so, okay, let's let's test this in... Co okay, also, let's, let's actually start with something else. We're going to pause the music. Okay, let's start with something else. I did this, I was doing this before stream and I didn't get to finish it. I have a lot of assets and this is going to help with this. I have Ultimate Music Bundle, which is a lot of music and I'm, I bet you I could find a piece of music in here that we could use for this project. I'm also adding sound effects, like these sound effects, into this project. I guess I can leave the music for now. We're not, we're not there yet. We're almost there. Uh, there's other sound effects. I'm just, this is how we're going to do this. I'm not going to spend the time to write music or make sound effects and all that. We don't, we just don't have time. We have one day. This is the last day. I'm not going to try to do that. For the full game, I will absolutely, I will bring my piano back in here. We will do that, maybe for a stream even, where we will just write music for the game. And then we'll do all kinds of sound effects if we need to and that kind of thing. But for this project, I'm just going to do this. This is absolutely necessary here. The same thing I did for Lixian game too. Lixian game I used this one, which you can't see. Uh, it's this one right here. And then Bean game I used a lot of free music that I found online outside of these. So I always do that with these projects just because it's so much easier and I don't want to spend the time to make my own music. I could. It also probably wouldn't be up to the same quality, but you know, I did for Bark. That's the one exception. I did make music for Bark. All right, once okay, that's that's in, that's in. Was this cube collider not want to scale? Don't don't flip the table yet, because if you flip the table, then you can't scale the cube anymore. <laughs> Bark reference. All right, let's let, let's move these over now into assets, and then we will go from there. I'm hoping that I can find a piece of music fairly easily. I wanted to do. I forget what it's called. I guess just layering. Layering music where like every time you reach a new checkpoint, another layer of the music gets added on top. But 
I don't know, that's highly unlikely that we get to do that this time. Which is fine. It's not super necessary. I want to have one that is like uh, like a piece of a mu piece of music that is good but also super annoying kind of not too annoying cuz we're all going to get annoyed if that's the case but annoying in the sense that first we'll get sick of it really quickly but it won't be too bad to where everybody will get sick of it you know you know you know what I mean you know what I'm going for hope that makes sense cuz it's going to be hard to do I'm not saying it's going to be an easy task but I'm going to try Using a cube collider for a spherical bullet. Yeah, why wouldn't you just use a sphere collider? That, I just, I, I don't see the point in that, but, I mean, if that works, go for it. Why is this so slow? We're off to a great start when we're, we're starting stream by loading folders. That's great. It's fine. Thank you, Discord. Oh my god, that, that logo, so, or, or that notification icon. So I just went to notifications in the Discord, and the live notification is just my face looking so stoic and and like glaring deeply into your soul. I don't know why it chose that image. All right, this is just gonna take its sweet time, I guess. Bullet transform is in a weird shapes because that's one of the main features. The spherical collider can just transform uniformly. Huh. Okay, I I mean I don't I don't know what the I goal is for the game, but I would imagine that may that would make more sense. Just have a universal cube instead of a sphere. I would just use like the collision of the object, whatever the shape is, but I guess you can't necessarily do that in Godot. I don't know how to, Godot works at all. You play game once it's done, let me know and I'll I'll give it a go. I love waiting for the folders to 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 load. Man, this is this is great content right here, guys. I'm also I'm 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 glugging down some dubby because I'm exhausted and I need energy right now. Which means maybe coffee was the uh, was the idea or what w was the way to go, but I didn't do it this time. So the first fully playable prototype in a few hours. Okay, jeez. Well, it's not gonna happen today because we got to do this today, but um. Maybe tomorrow, because I don't know what we're doing. To no, tomorrow is this with first. So maybe Monday. I don't know what we're doing Monday yet. So hopefully by then it'll be out of prototype too. I don't know. I don't know how this is going to work. I don't know how this is going to go. But I will I will definitely check out the, uh, the game when it's done. Man, it's just taking its sweet time here loading. This is wonderful. It's gonna have to be, uh, because this, this is for a game jam and the submission deadline is in three days. That makes sense. That makes sense. Well, hurry up. Stop chatting. <laughs> stop texting and, or stop, stop typing and get back to work. What are you doing? We plan to make it a full release on Steam. Okay. Well, let me know where it goes, and we will we will definitely check it out. Man, it is just it is just taking its sweet time. Is there anything else I can add? No. I have that one in there. I don't need that one. Probably don't need that one. Okay, that should be enough. That should be fine. Thankfully, we were able to fix the huge bug yesterday, the export bug yesterday. It's just as simple as I moved things around and my computer didn't like that. Majority of voice lines will be none other than Appleseed. That's actually, that's wonderful. With Apple's new mic and all, that's wonderful. See, who, who would have thought that we're now creating games as a community? The voice lines are so amazing. I don't even. It, it's a bullet hell game. What voice lines are there? I 
What are these markers on the... Do you guys see... Okay, if you guys scroll down and you see the sub goal, what are the little white dots? Are those just like progression points where it's like 25%, 50%, 75%? Or they're... Like, I don't think those mean anything. That's so weird. I've never noticed that before. I have no idea what that means. Okay, cool. Stuff moved. Let's go. Alright, now we can pause. The music. Because we're going to go into the music bundle. And we're going to check out music. Let's just see. <laughs> oh my god. Jesus Christ. I had a feeling it would be loud, but I didn't think it would be that loud. Alright, can we do this, please? There we go. That's better. Okay, so these are like cyberpunk tracks? That's interesting. I don't know if that's the way to go, but I don't want to spoil it. This does not fit. Can I go to loops? I mean, this kind of fits the later sections, I'll say that much right now. I don't know how long it is, but... Okay, Energy 2. I'm gonna move over music into one area so we can get, like, a good idea of what music might fit. So... Uh... That's Energy Loopable... Okay, so I guess it would just be this one. So this is a potential one. Then, let's see, what are the other ones? Uh, no. No, nope, that's the same one. It's almost too calm. Yeah, no, I don't like that one. Hmm. We'll run a vote at the end, I'm sure, just to see what you guys think. No, no, these don't fit. Okay, Cyberpunk isn't the way to go. Action music, all right. That's, that's really, that's really aggressive, like, that, that's, that, that might be a little bit much for this prototype game. Now, this sounds epic. Virus. Well, that's kind of accurate. Hmm. Because the idea I want, I want to go for like mysterious and also rage. Like, I don't know how to, I don't know, I don't know what the best prompt for that would be. This one was alright. Let's see. This one I think is just funny. Because this, I mean, we could also switch music as we, as you progress. I don't know. That's just a drone so far. Huh. It's almost too calm. It's also kind of good for the intro bit here. No, probably not. These are all really calm. If I learn to make music and do 3D models properly, I'll become an unstoppable game making machine. I think that goes for literally anybody. Literally anybody who can do all of those, you are unstoppable, you will be rich because you'll never have to spend money on a game. Good so far. 
So I like how these are, these fall under the action category, but it's not really action. This is not an action game. That one's good so far. Now the thing is, I do have to export any music that we use, and and th this might not even make it into the VOD. This might all get cut out of the VOD. Um, and upload it to YouTube to see if it'll get copy striked on YouTube. Because it might. That's too much. That does not fit. Okay, we got through those. Okay. Um, exclusives. What does that even mean? Get up, anime. What? Yeah, no, this is literally, that is the most anime sound I've ever heard. Okay. Then there's red and blue chip. <laughs> that does not fit this game. Too cheerful. Way too cheerful. Uh, too sad. <laughs> Definitely not fitting. No, that's beautiful for this game. That's perfect. No, the, the, none of those fit. Okay. Because I definitely want to go like sci-fi is the vibe that I think when I see this. It's too calm. Nope. Finding music is definitely going to be the hardest part of this. Hardest part of this. All of these sound so similar. What is that? That's kind of good. Doesn't fit for this at all. Maybe for the menu. Hmm. It's not like mine. This could be Minecraft music. This is horror music right there. No. It's like a shop. Okay. Midlands Fantasy RPG, definitely not. What is what is OST Pro? What does that even mean? That's not a genre of music. These feel like video game or movie trailer music ideas so definitely not for this real pianos no apocalypse jesus christ yeah that's fitting there we go this is what we want for this coming home hello what are these? What are these? I, I don't know what these are. Can I just do like full tracks, please? Jesus Christ. Now that is epic music for this. Not at all fitting, but man. What if, what if you hear this? Oh, it doesn't, it doesn't play. Okay, we're going to bring this in. What if you just, you're, you're playing this. This is so fitting. <laughs> This fits this vibe so well. You're just like, oh, yeah, I gotta avoid the lasers. I gotta fight back against the machine. That doesn't, no, no. <laughs> Welcome in, Kate. Uh, yeah, that's incredible, but absolutely not. <laughs> Jesus. Are these all just like rock? Okay, metal music. Why didn't I read that? Okay, metal might be a bit too aggressive for this. Maybe, maybe not. Retro music golden age. What does that mean? Oh, I used this. What is this? What, is, what did I use this in? Oh, I used this in a project I didn't even release. Right. I did a thing. I did a video that I never released. 
that I won't talk about because I'm going to do a different version of that video that I, I used this piece of music for. I forgot about that. This is a great piece of music, though. Does it fit this? Probably not. I need the player to start at regular spawn. It doesn't loop, un like, it loops a lot. It doesn't, um, it doesn't, it's not long enough to be, like, the full song. It is, oh, 256 seconds. That's more than I thought. What is that? 256 seconds, two minutes. Is four and a half, really? This is a four minute song? I think it just loops once, though. Huh. Could change the music depending on what area you're in. That's what I'm thinking about doing. I just don't know if I want to do that yet. Okay, so that just loops there. I do kind of like this 8-bit style idea, though. I don't know. Some of, that sounds, some of this sounds like uh, FNAF world music. This is a play on this idea. Huh. No. So if anything, these two. Then, okay. There's more... There's also ultimate casual music. I have a feeling this isn't going to fit. Can we get the loops, please? Uh, never mind. Yeah, that's definitely not going to fit. Okay. Then uh, ultimate piano music and dragons music pack. What does that mean? Nobody make that. Nobody make them dragon joke. I feel like these are too epic. These are too like final boss epic type music. Hmm. Okay, let's I think let, let's go with what we have so far. And let's just try them each individually. Let me first asset actions uh Edit via proxy matrix. Uh, sound looping on. Thank you. Save that. Cool. And now let's just drop them each in individually. So this is the first one. It kind of, it does fit. It, it throws me off because like I said, I used this for a different project. I don't like using the same music in two different projects. Not really that fitting to me for this. Not really super fitting. Not unfitting necessarily, but not super fitting. This just sounds too epic, almost, but also extremely accurate to the scenario you're in. because I tried to wobble whoops this definitely fits like the lava aesthetic this kind of reminds me of the music that I used for the floor is lava in the other bean game it's very similar might be a little too aggressive though weirdly fitting but also kind of too, I don't know, too like retro e, or too like, not retro e, too like final, like this is the finale e, you know? Like this, this is a great sound, this is a great song, but I don't know, this sounds too like final boss or final area-esque. What's this one? Yeah, it should sound prototypey, but I don't know how to I don't know what that means necessarily.
That's kind of fitting for what's going on here. Never mind. Definitely not fitting at all. No. That one just doesn't work. Well, there goes that one. Okay, now it's going to load indefinitely. There we go. That's the one I just tried. Okay, so this one. I think these are too, like, bassy. Once again, this sounds very, like, castle-esque. Like, this is the finale type sound. Also, this may, if you guys weren't watching Andre's stream last night, this may be the first time you see this area. After this. So I also added a couple spikes in here. Well, I died, so maybe you won't get to see it. Okay, this music still doesn't really fit. Music is always the hardest part in any project. It really is trying to get, like, something fitting. Okay, let's try this one. Let's put the player at the next area so you guys can see the next area at least. It's kind of fitting, so far. I like this one best, I think, so far. Ooh, that's actually really good, because it's kind of mysterious. Alright, so this is the this is the new area, right there. So I, I extended... I extended? I expanded pipes to be a bit... A, a bit longer, because Andres flew through it. Not that I think first will, but also we're going to be doing this for four hours, so I need four hours of content to fill here. And a lot of it's going to be him doing the same thing over and over and over again. Unless I can just assume that he'll beat it in two, and then we'll just have a shorter stream when that happens. Which honestly is kind of the, the hope that I have, because I don't want to have to edit down four hours of footage. This is definitely the most fitting so far. So yeah, this is the new area right here. And then we do this jump to get to here. And now this area is also new because it's this from before, but there's more to it now. Oh, and that's really fitting here, too. This is all the same. Okay, well, I messed that up. So far, I definitely like this one the most. What do you guys think? I messed that up. It's very ominous, very mysterious kind of castle or like escape the facility type sound which is kind of what I'm going for this is kind of the idea of like escape the facility I keep messing that jump up that is definitely one of the hardest jumps I will definitely be making my own music for the full release if this does get a full release assuming it does but for now. So here's the thing. This would be looping for two to four hours during first stream. I'm sure he'll get sick of it and turn on something else in the background. Alright, so this is the new stuff. So now we get to here, and now it's this. Okay, well I messed it up. Andres was stuck here for like an hour, I think. Wasn't an hour? No, almost. No, it was like 30 minutes. But still, long time. Which is good, because that's exactly what I want. He got through the new pipes section really quickly. But that's also kind of like tutorial area part two, so... That's fine. But this section is the first, like, really difficult platforming section, because it takes speed and skill, and just, like, a lot of practice as well. Okay. So now we... Uh, I literally just jumped into it. <laughs> I'm a genius. I will get through this part. This is actually good because so far the music is fitting so well that I'm not even really noticing it. I'm just kind of talking over it the same way I would any other game. So that's a good thing. It is getting kind of repetitive though. So I think I will want to split this up into one piece of music per section. This feels like a good piece for this type area. I don't know. Wow, I'm bad at that. I don't know, I think I will have to split up the music though. Otherwise it's just gonna get really repetitive and annoying, and I don't want that. As much as I do want that, like I said earlier, I want that because that, that'll add to the rage. It's just like I'm getting so sick of hearing the same music over and over and over again. 
but I don't necessarily want that because then it'll just be annoying for you guys as well watching. Okay, I think we're gonna skip this area because uh, you can you can actually do a skip here if you just do that and then you wait for it. Yep, that's a nice easy skip to do if you can manage to get on it. And then you can just skip those stupid extra jumps. These freak out. They don't actually get you though. Oh, pfft. and then those fly. That one's to scare him. Yeah, so this is a nice skip to do if you can figure out how to do it. It's not even a skip cuz it, well, it's a skip of it, like so you don't die a billion times. Unless you do that. Unless you miss the skip. Then it's not really a skip. But it's... Did I just go the wrong way? Why did that happen? I don't know why that happens. I feel like that's only ever happened to me and I'm just being stupid. So who knows at this point. I keep messing up that. Hey, Waffle Mutt! Welcome in. You guys are sometimes the same color as each other, so I don't... I, I didn't recognize that Waffle Mutt popped in. Because for me... Waffle Nut and Maker are the same are the same color in chat. So that they almost blend in. That sounds kind of racist, I realize that, but not the not 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 on purpose. Okay, the music is definitely fitting. Tell me like I'm gonna play through this section and I'm gonna be I'm gonna beat it. So tell me when the music starts to get old and annoying for you guys. Because that's really the the only thing I care about. I don't care if first gets sick of it. I care if you guys start getting sick of it. There we go. Okay. Now we're here. This, he will be here for a long time. Like I said, Andres, who has seen most of this game and played it once, was here for a half an hour before he beat this. This is definitely the probably the, the hardest section of the game, which is weird because it's not the last section. So I think the last section we're going to have to make a combination of everything. We're also going to add the freeze lasers and possibly the invisi spikes today as well, courtesy of Andre's suggestions. Oh. Yeah, he was stuck here for a while and I, I completely get it. That's the whole point. I did it again. I feel like I'm not doing that. I feel like the game is doing that, so I, I feel like I'm going forward and then I'm going right. I don't know if that's me doing that or if there's some bug, but Andres didn't point it out, Jacob didn't point it out, so I'm the only one who's experienced it yet, so maybe I'm just stupid and suck at my own game. I don't know, but it feels weird. All right. Also, I can't help but notice that these, these like, three vertical spike, uh, Platforms or not platforms like poles look kind of like traffic lights, and that's all I've ever seen when I look at them They kind of look like traffic lights, and I'm sorry that now I forced that into your guys brains I am NOT reading chat much because it's very hard to look away while you're doing this chaos Yeah, that one spike is so horrible Yeah, that spike is definitely the most mean. Alright. There we go. The jump arounds, I mean, this is, if anything, this is going to teach first how to be a god tier platformer. Okay, this is when things get really mean. I, I was really mean here. It goes off the grid here, and then you have to do this. It is so mean. And then these fly at you. Yeah, but there we go. Now I got through it. Okay. Now, this music definitely fits the laser section really well, because it's kind of, like, mysterious. I feel like if, if we do end up making the music change based on the section, this music is definitely the laser section music. Keep jumping on the laser. Really want to try this game? Uh, you can, you can download the, uh, version 7 version 0.7 or whatever, uh, which has this, except it does have the Andre skip, which I deleted now, the Andre skip part two, which has been fully removed now. 
Uh, but feel free to try it. It should run on basically any PC unless you're Waffles, which I'm very sorry about, Waffles. It's in the, uh, which channel is it? The announcements? Did I put it in announcements? I think I did. So yeah, feel free, please, guys. Try it out and give me your feedback. Let me know how long it takes you to beat, if you can beat it, or if you rage quit. Uh, or, like, if you find bugs or skips or anything like that, let me know. Okay. Yeah, so the, the cameras I moved down, so now you absolutely can't skip that area. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, this laser section sucks, but it's not as bad as the other section. It's just a little bit more RNG. Even though it's not RNG at all, there are patterns that you can follow. There's just so many together that it's like you'll, you'll never actually do that. Right. Whoop. There we go. No, I missed. I jumped too early. That was dumb of me. Also, I like that in this section you don't necessarily have to start over every time you fall. Because unless you unless you die on a spike, you don't have to start all the way over. This section definitely fits the lasers way better than the other sections. Whoa, okay, that was too close. Whoop. Okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. Okay, then this is just mean because there's a laser that comes through and everything. But then, and I missed. Oh, I missed my last jump, basically. After that, it's, you're, you're basically free. There's nothing new here other than the fix of the skip. Uh, other than the ending that I already showed you guys at the beginning, but whatever. Man. This game is not easy. So, you know it's a hard game when the developer who knows exactly where to go and how to play struggles every time. And I will add a death counter, that's one of the things on my list today. Add a death counter, we got music sound effects, I do need to add sound effects, we'll add sound effects after we figure out the music. Then we'll add the last section. And then, from there, it's just a matter of, like, polishing things up, and being done. Welcome in, Lunar Energy and all the rats! How you guys doing? I should ask each of the rats individually how they do, how, how they're doing every day. Every time they hop in, it's like, all right, rat number one, rat number two, rat number 69, nice. I don't remember how many rats there are. I don't think there were 69. That would have been funny, though. This is definitely like Escape the Laser Facility type music, which is great for lasers. And I fell. <laughs> Hello there, rat. Hello there, rat. Hello, rat. Hello, rat. Hey, rat. How you doing, rat? Hey, buddy. What's up? Oh, you look sad. Let's let's fix that with a controlled shock. There we go. Whoop. Okay. Probably could have made that as a skip there, but whatever. I am so sorry to first who is going to play this it's very soon. Forty-five rats. Oh, so close. You gotta adopt some more rats so you can get uh, get to sixty-nine. Funny number, you know. Okay. <laughs> Sag, easy fix, introducing cheese. Like, the food or the streamer? And I'm dead. This laser section is not easy. I still think that even though this is difficult because of the amount of lasers and their weird patterns, I still think that the lava section before is harder. I knew that once I jumped I could tell already yeah I still think that the previous section is the hardest section in the game this is more just like trial and error because of all these lasers that are just annoying and in your face at all times and sometimes hit you out of nowhere which like I said it's not random they don't just come out of nowhere they do have patterns that you can learn theoretically but when you're raging in a rage game you don't want to learn the patterns you just kind of want to go so you just keep running until until you either win or just die so many times that you rage quit. I missed. Of course I did. I feel like I should know the coyote jumping better than anybody, being that I'm the developer and I've played this a million times now. 
but I still, like it's, like I said, it's not a full coyote jump, so I still don't have it down. Can I skip to that? If I were methodical enough, I don't think I'm methodical enough, but I could try it. I don't want to, though. It's a risky one. Oh, seven rats. Oh, I, why did I go for that? What was wrong with me there? So the good thing about this is I will just rage quit before I actually start to rage because I made the game. I've beaten this several times. I don't need to do it again, you know? But in this case, I kind of do need to do it again, and I died. Because I have more stuff to show you guys, and I want to prove to you guys that I am a skilled gamer. The only thing that I would say would potentially stop lower-end PCs from running this is the fact that it was made with Unreal. But also, like I said multiple times, the graphic settings are so low, and there's so little going on, that it should be fine, theoretically. I missed that. That was terrible. Uh, on any PC. And worst case, just turn down everything except for the post-process settings, and it'll look exactly the same and run better. Because that's the thing, literally the only thing that changes anything right now, as far as I know, is the post-process settings. I don't even think the other settings do a single thing, other than like limiting frame rate and stuff like that. Like all the other graphics settings, I don't think it actually does anything. This is dangerous. This is dangerous. Yep, that was very dangerous. He's going to be stuck here for a while. I just, I just know it. I can tell. He's going to be stuck on that. He may not even get to this area. Laser. Thank you. Okay. I definitely, I think we're going to need to change the music up. Different pieces for different sections. I think that's like a no-brainer at this point. Because this fits, but I am getting sick of it. Slightly. I don't know about you guys. Maybe it's different because I've been talking the whole time. Yeah, Maker, I can't wait to see your 16 second speedrun of this. There we go. Okay. Okay. Okay, there we go. Checkpoint. Nice. Alright. Now from here, this is where any new stuff comes in. These jumps are way harder than I thought I made them, by the way. Why don't you leave it uh, for the lasers then? Just something else for the other room? That's what I'm going to do, probably. I think this one is going to be the laser room music. And then the previous room, I'll figure something else out. Alright, then this. <laughs> and then that killed me, of all things. And then you're back here. Okay, so maybe that ne maybe that ending area is a bit mean. But then again, the idea is for these to be progressively difficult. But also, Andres did struggle here for a bit. Kate, do you remember about how long he was here? Because this was after he stopped the timer. I think you were there the whole time. I'm, I don't, I'm not sure. Or was it Rose? I don't know. I don't know. You guys, you, sometimes you guys are in and out. I'm not sure. But if anybody remembers, if anybody was watching last night, Andres' stream, do you guys remember how long he was stuck here? Because he had stopped the timer. So he started here... No, because he, he's, he did the skip and then he stopped the timer. Not sure how long, but he was stuck. Yeah, he was stuck here for a while. I would say probably another 30 minutes or so. But that also includes him getting back to this point. So I don't think he was right here for 30 minutes. I think this room, just in general, he was here for like 30 minutes. That jump is way harder than I thought it was. I think it's because of the spikes. It's gotta be because of the spikes now. Okay. So if we just get like, if you let yourself fall off the edge slightly and then jump, it's fine. Okay, laser, come on. Don't do this to me. No, I tried to speed run it. That was dumb. Yeah, I think that next area is definitely too mean. So I'll definitely have, like, room triggers, and that'll be what'll separate the rooms, so the checkpoints won't dictate the rooms. Okay. 
Whoop. Okay. Whoop. Oh my god, I did it. <laughs> oh, I'm a god gamer. Okay, so there we go. That's it. And then this room is going to be the last room where we're going to introduce the freeze lasers and potentially invisible spikes. I may even extend it back a little further, depending. But there we go. I definitely think that last bit is a little too mean, though. All right, let's find the other music. So let's assume that the music that I'm currently playing... Where am I spawning, actually? I'm spawning in here at Pipes. Okay, so the music I'm currently playing is great for the end area. So let's line them up in... Like this. So that'll be the end... Uh, the second to end area, I guess. Okay, then what's this one? Actually, I can't line them up. Okay, let's just rename this. Okay, this is going to be... Laser Room... Let's place this and let's go through these. Okay. Is this going to be too aggressive? Ooh, this might be good for like the final room. Or maybe this is good for the uh, the lava room. Let's see. Let me put myself in the lava room. Be four, three. I think three. Yes. Okay. This might be really good for the lava room. It's kind of fitting. I don't know about you guys. Sounds kind of fitting to me. Whoops. Whoa, I got stuck on the wall. This is kind of fitting. I like this. Keep doing that. I feel like this is, it's fitting, but it's also a little extra intense. Oops. It's also a little repetitive to me. Let's try, let's try a different one. Let's see what happens. Where am I? Hello? Okay. Let's see. That definitely doesn't fit that room. That might be kind of fitting. Maybe that's too aggressive, but... That's also kind of fitting. So the other thing is, worst case, I bring in the Floor is Lava music from Actual Bean Game and just use that for this. But I'd rather not do that. This one's kind of like epic. Like, oh, like really extra epic. Wow, I just nailed that. Well, until there. The beat, the beats work so well with the jumps. If you can time them. Oh. What is this? Also kind of epic. This feels like Final Boss-esque again, though. Maybe this, this is too much, isn't it? I was not expecting it to become, like, orchestral. Yeah, that's just too much in general. That might be, like, final room type music. And then there's this one. Which just doesn't fit here at all. Mm. 
neither of those really fit. If and if at all, they kind of fit in here. Whoops, wrong room. I forgot to change my spawn point. Let's put me in here. Yeah, if anything, it kind of fits in this room. Because it's like the start of the adventure or whatever. But even then, not really. Hmm. No, it just doesn't fit. It's good that we found one. This one might fit the ending room. So I'll, I'll put this one as ending room for now. Or was it this one? I think it was this one. What was this one? This one might be good for the lava room, maybe? I think this one will be our best lava room one for now. And then this will be our best ending room for now. And then these two I don't think I want to use at all. Okay, what are these? We need one for pipes as well, because I don't really have an idea of pipes. These, these dragon type music doesn't work. Okay, let's go back to this. Nope, not at all. This one could work elsewhere if I just do like the full one. All right, Maker, I knew it was gonna happen eventually. Ooh, what's this one? Ooh, that's nice. It's very cyberpunk. Well, okay, well that kind of ruins it. Now it's just 100% cyberpunk. That sucks, because the beginning was good. That's too much. Really slow start. Also kind of final boss-esque. Yeah, no. This one's the only one that could. From the cyberpunk ones. Hmm. It's just the beat doesn't really work. That type of beat doesn't work for this, unfortunately. Okay, um, we can go back to the action one, see which ones we skipped over. Okay, that's that one. Very calm start. Hmm. Nothing. We tried this one, that one definitely won't work. Too calm. This one might be too aggressive. Okay, never mind, it's just it's also too calm. No. Already have that one. Action music might just be too epic for this game. Hmm. Three more weeks of school and I'm finally free E? Free E? doesn't fit. Definitely doesn't fit. 
Yeah, E for epic. Nope. We might have to pull out my secret weapon of additional other music. I think we're gonna... It's a huge file, and I was gonna try to avoid this, but... Here it goes. Alright. This is the pack that I used some music for, uh... For Bark. I made some of the music for Bark, and I used some of this music for Bark. All the ambience and all that, though, that was me. But I did a couple pieces of music for it, and then for, like, all the extra game modes that I just didn't know what to do for, I used this pack. That is gonna take forever to add now, because it's huge. And I think I got it for free a long time ago. I don't even know which one's playing anymore. Okay, so we've got... Let's set up the mechanics for changing music. So it'll just be a trigger that once we enter a certain room, then it'll do that. So let's create a blueprint. BP music trigger. None of the other music worked well. It just, yeah. It, it, there's a lot of great music in that pack. It just, it's very specific. All right, box collision at 50, 50, 50, and 50, 50, 50. Let's make this like 25. No, that's too much. 10. Uh, and this will be blue or something, or green. I don't know. Green is a color I haven't used yet. Cool. Uh, and then... Oh, we need two, don't we? Yeah. So we'll have two triggers. This will be... Next music. And then we'll have a duplicate of this, which is gonna be previous music. And it would be on the X, so I would do... Like that. Actually, no. I wouldn't do it. What am I doing? This would just be... Uh... Trigger. <laughs> I can just do two of them. What am, I, what am I trying to do there? No. So this will be... Music. It's gonna be... Uh, what is this? Sound? Sound bass? Sound bass, that's what it is. And then on begin overlap... We're gonna cast to player. And then we're going to set music, which I will do through the game instance. So we'll have one custom event, which is going to be set music, which is going to have two things. Current music. Actually, I think it'll just have one. This will be sound bass. I think it'll be sound bass. Maybe this is going to be sound cue. I don't know. So we're going to... Play sound 2D? Yes. This is going to be new music. New music and then fade time. It'll be a float. It'll be, let's just say, five seconds? Sure. Okay. So, we're going to not play sound. So, we're going to... Right. I need to delay, re-triggerable re delay. And then we're going to fade in. No, we're going to add... Com what is it? Uh, Fade in sound. I don't know. I don't remember the node name. It's annoying. Okay. 
This is play sound 2D, so we would need to add a sound component. Add component by class. No. What is it? Alright, I gotta pull up another project because I don't remember what it is. Let's go to the Thankmas game or Lixian game or something. Let's just go into the Thankmas game. Because I've done this multiple times recently. I just have to figure out how to do it again. Alright, come on, open up. Okay, the music's been added, right? Yeah, okay, cool. So then, what we're gonna do is, in here, we're gonna get game instance, and set music. Whenever we hit this trigger, with the new music, which is going to be the music that we have attached to this. And the fade time will be 5, sure, why not. Okay, in here, what do I have? in the game instance. Because I have a few different versions of it, I think. Event graph, please. Yeah, create sounds, and then... Okay, spawn sound 2D, that's what it is. Got it. So we will spawn sound 2D. Which is going to be whatever sound we have here. And we're going to create this. This is going to be current music, which um, is being used. Okay. Nope. Delete that. And then this will be current music. It's a component. Cool. And then before we do this, we're going to check. Uh, actually, I can just validate to get this. Is it valid? If it is, then we will do something else. If it's not, then we'll create it and set it. If it is valid, then we're going to set current music. I can't. Uh, I need to set sound or fade in. Okay, no. I need to set it and then fade it in. Set sound. So I need to fade it out, set the sound, fade it back in. So fade out uh, with a duration, uh, so actually this doesn't need to happen. Yeah, the duration is going to be this, so we're going to fade out duration, level zero, uh, sine curve. Then we're going to, then once this is done, okay, so we're going to delay, we are going to delay, re-triggerable, no, this will just be a delay. Delay, thank you. And then set the sound to the new sound. And then fade in this new sound over the same duration. Actually, I should have two. Fade previous and then fade new. Which will both be five by default, but whatever so then we're going to delay actually not delay we're just gonna fade it in fade in duration there it is start time zero sign curve actually the start time will be its current percent so that's where the other thing comes in because there's no so the, one of the most annoying things in unreal is like I want to get the current position of the currently playing music, right? I want to find out, are we five seconds into the current playing music? There's no node for that. You have to do this garbage. It's so stupid. So, bind event to audio playback percent. Jesus Christ. So, whenever we set the sound, we have to... Uh, okay, at the end here, bind to uh, percent audio playback percent whenever this is the only time so this is going to be custom event current music playback that's a problem there's going to be a problem with this I have a feeling and it's 
times duration. Get duration percent times duration. That makes sense. And this will be the current playback percent. Current music. Current music play. Current current music time. There. And then the start time would be the current music time, but if we set sound, then it starts it at... I don't know, man. I don't know. We'll just do that. We'll, we'll do that and we'll see what happens. So if I set music... So let's... This is tough. Okay. So if I take... Because I think that's going to be wrong, but we'll try it. Music trigger, right here. And it will trigger in this room. Whenever we hit the trigger in this room. Uh, and then it'll re-trigger once we get back into this room. So this will be whatever the current room is, and then... Let's just, let's just set this to test this. So this would be... Let's say... This one, and then this would be the, I don't know, laser room. Uh, the other thing I need to do when I do this is check if the new music is the current music. So, current music, get sound, is this equal to this? So if it is, then we're not going to do anything. If it's not, then we will change to the new music okay let's find out there's no music yet oh well that's a weird bit of silence here I could have just put my start test uh, position over there but I didn't do that so you know, here we are I guess we're just gonna have to do this in silence which you know I'm skilled enough at this area to be able to one-shot this in silence that's fine I played the wrong- oh, because it's not- it wasn't currently active. Okay, now it's fading to the new one. Cool. So it did work. And now it should fade me back. I don't like that it has a delay. I think it should do both at the same time. Yeah, because it waits until the current one's fully faded and it brings the new one in. Is there a crossfade now? Oh, what happened? Oh, because it's not validated. Whoopsies. Okay. So, this needs to be validated get first. Convert to validated get. There we go. If it is valid, then this. If it's not valid, then just this. There we go. Same thing. Cool. Okay, but there's a problem because of this. But if I don't do that, then that might just break entirely. It sh it'll just snap, as far as I understand. Okay, well, now we're doing this again in silence. Hey, guys, I hope you enjoy the silence here. Hope my voice is uh, a nice, nice enough music to your ears to where this isn't uh, boring now because there's no sound going on other than my soft, subtle voice. That's... I hate that. Oh, yep. Yep. Not what I wanted. There's no fade time. That's a problem. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do it differently. Great. Uh, but I could- I should just be able to do this in two. So if I do this... Then I could make one that is like fade... Like, this'll be... Set music, which is gonna do two things. Current music, and then we'll have another one for new music. New music, so this way we can crossfade. So if we have current music, if it's not valid, then it's just gonna do this. Um, but then if we do have this, then it's gonna fade out current, and while it's doing that, we're gonna have a new one spawn. Unless, okay, this is where it gets complicated. Okay, so, 
Does new music... Is it valid? If new music is valid, then we'll just fade it in. If it's an art, we'll, we'll set the music and then we'll fade it in. If not, then we're going to do this again. Jesus Christ. It's going to be a mess. Okay. So it's not... So we do this, and then we spawn in the new music. Oh, God. Oh, my brain. Okay. Okay. All right, we're gonna. This is gonna. This is gonna take all of my brain power. So you're gonna have to give me a moment. Okay, we're gonna get the new music. Or okay, when we set music, we're gonna check. Does is the current music equal to the new music? If it is, we're not gonna do anything. If it's not, then we're going to uh, fade out the current music. While that's happening, we're gonna check: is the new music valid? If the new music is not valid. Then we're going to spawn in new music with this new sound. Okay. And then this will be bind. Wait, that's current music. This is new music set. And then bind. Whoops. Uh, oh, this will be custom events. This will be new music playback. Which is going to flip between the- that's so annoying. Okay. It always sounded complicated. Yeah, I'm activating my god mode, uh, dev right now, dev mindset, which is not going to help. I promise you that. <laughs> okay, and then this will be another one, which is going to be new music time. It's new music time! Woo! Okay. Then, after that, we can set sound of the new music we can set the sound to the new sound and fade it in okay if it is valid then we're just gonna do that anyway we can skip that part okay the problem is now that's permanently considered new music so when the next time comes around what did I, okay yeah this can close now Okay, I need to turn off the music for a second. When we set music, is the current music equal to this new music? If it is, then it would need to do the inverse, I think. Oh, that's frustrating. Okay, because then at this point, once it fades in, I guess I could just delay and then set... No, that's not going to work. This ain't even complicated stuff. Yes, it is, Maker, actually. This part is the com the most simple things. The things that you think are the most simple are the most complicated in game dev. That is just how it is. It's com- Like, if you- If you attribute a mess of wires and spaghetti code to being complicated, that's not true. A mess of wires and spaghetti code and just a, a super complicated, like, 500,000 lines of code- that could be the easiest, most basic baseline code ever. But then you have this one small chunk of like this, what I'm doing right now, just feed in certain audio at the right time, and it becomes the most annoying, complicated mess, even though it's just this tiny section. So usually it does, like, you can't judge a book by its cover in that case when it comes to, like, how complicated a, a mess is. Because I would, I would attribute what I did before with the camera system to one of those and it's not that much there's not that much going on this same thing there's not that much going on here but it's so stupidly complicated okay we okay if the new music okay right now we're setting the music is the current music equal to the new music if it is then can we just check it the I mean I guess we could just do it the other way that's dumb but it would work. Okay, so in this case, current music, it spawns the current music. And then it would need to... I guess do this. So that way here we're doing current music. Target would be this. New sound would be... No. That's wrong. It would be this. And then the new sound would be this. And then we fade it in. Like this. Okay. 
fade in duration would be the new. Oh boy. And then new music time. No, it'd be current music time. This one would be new music time. That's not right. That's not going to work. I don't think that's going to work. Can I put myself closer, please? This is this is the nightmare because th this is so simple. It's just stupid. Okay, let me put myself here. We haven't even gotten to the fun part yet. Oh, I didn't tell myself to go there. Okay. It's playing both. Why is it? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, we're going to redo this. We're going to redo this. We're going to redo this. Okay, I need this to go... The problem is we have two different sounds playing at the same time. Okay, we need... It would be so easy if it just snapped. If I could just snap the music, that would be so easy. Is there a crossfade node? Didn't think so. Okay. This is easier if I do it the way that I do it for all my other games, but I really want this to be dynamic for later on, so I'm not going to do it that way. Okay, we're going to set music, which is going to... Check if the current music is equal to... What is that attaching to? Okay, that. It's checking if the current music sound is the same as the sound that we're trying to play. If it is the same, then we're not going to do anything. Even though new music... Current music and the new music... Okay, that's fine. If they are not the same, the current playing music is not... Okay, if it is the same, then we need to check another one. Because we need to check if the new music, the current... Which, the, okay, so current music and current music 2. That's what it needs to be. Current music 2. Because that's really what it is. It's less about new music, more about current music 2. Okay. This, I'm going to validate it. And then we're going to do the exact same check of just, okay, so if the first one isn't, then is the second one. Because if the second one is, then same thing. But if it's still not after that, then we can move... No, that'll do something else. Oh, my God. Okay. If it still is this... Okay. No, if this one's the same, then is this one not the same? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then if that's the... Then, okay, done. Then here... Okay. It'll do this. And this is not going to happen. This is just going to do its thing here. This is separate. This is separate. This is its own thing here. It doesn't matter. Down here is what matters, because here is where the delay comes in, or not the delay, because we're doing this, it would be this, okay, so that's fade out the current music, and then fade in the new music. So we set sound and we fade in, so we won't set sound, we'll just fade in the new music, which means we do need to do this part. Which is checking, okay, so that is necessary, oh my god, okay, so if we fade out the music, okay, we fade out the current music, now we have to check, is the second music valid, if it's not, then we spawn this, okay, and when we spawn this, we set sound and we fade in the other way, yes, okay. Is that not what I just did? Because then at the end we're going to check. We're going to start the check here. Yes. Okay, in theory. That'll work. I think. It's a mess of wires, but I think that'll work. What is it fading out? It's fading in that one, that's why. It needs to be fading in. I need to disconnect so many wires here. Good god. How did this happen so quickly? Okay, fade in music two. 
after we set sound of music two. Okay. Whew. Love programming. This is pain. Okay. Mm-hmm. Then down here, this is current. Okay. And then this is current. Okay. Good. I can do I can deal with that. That's fine. Let's find out. There we go. That worked. Okay. It stopped the current one immediately, though. That's still a problem. But at least it's doing that correctly now. It's just not fading out the current music appropriately. Okay, that's fine. So, in this case, we're fading out current music if it's valid. If current music is not this, then we'll fade out the current music. And then this one, if... Oh, I'm not doing it up here. That's why. We're not even doing it here. It needs to be done here. Fade out there. Wait. No? That's connected to the wrong thing now. What did I, okay, wait, 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 wait. Let's, let's make these look the same. Okay, I'm... This one here, I'm going to go to a validated get, and then if it fails, it's going to do that. If it succeeds, then it's going to fade out, if it is valid, which I think is wrong in this case. I don't even know what these are connected to anymore. This is, oh my god, this is a nightmare. Honestly, honestly seems more complicated than that. It's not. It's exactly, the, it's equally as complicated. It's just less, like, the syntax is different. That's the only difference. It's equally as complicated as writing traditional code. It's It can be a, a serious nightmare sometimes. All right. And that's not for the drinking game. All right. Current music. So this would be solved if there was a crossfade node. If there was a crossfade music node, this would be so easy. Oh boy. All right. This is the finishing touches that I hate about trying to finish a game quickly. It's things like this. The things you don't consider normally. Okay. We set the music. The new music. Is, in fact, we just need to cut out. The, the, just have one fade. Just have one fade. That'll be it. Let's see what this does. If I just use one fade node, or one fade time, let's see what that does. It shouldn't, it won't change anything actually, because it's literally the same. This should, this will do nothing differently. Fades that in. Okay, it faded out. It, it successfully faded it in and out. And that was it. That's all it did. That's all it did. Great. Love that. Okay. Not what I was... Oh, because it didn't do this then. No, so that's why. So... If current music is valid, we fade that out and then we do... Oh my god. It's because... Oh, that's worse. Almost, I think. That's worse. Okay, so we do this. And then if this, oh my god, oh my brain, switch the category to software and game development, that's a category now? That wasn't a category before. Software and game development, that's a new category. Interesting. I didn't know about that one. Thank you, Maker. Appreciate it. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. Thanks to Pirate Software. Oh, okay, cool. Sweet. All right. Why is this so complicated? Okay, is, let me look up. Is how to crossfade music UE4. Let's see if anybody's done that. Has anybody done crossfading? 
Custom event for your audio change. Create another trigger like we did before. Well, okay, whatever. Yeah, I know that part. Oh, you can do it in a queue. Wait, that's so much easier. Oh my god, that's so much easier. Okay, this is not happening. No. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, Alright. So, we will have, instead of new music... Oh, well, that's kind of annoying, though, because then I can't... I don't have full control over it. It would be easier to do... Because it's by parameter. What's the parameter? Not looping, not... I, for you guys, you play okay, whatever, whatever, whatever. What is the parameter? Use this cross. Parameter is intensity, and then it's just... Oh, no, that's just info about it. How do I switch between the two? That's just an integer array. Well, that's not preferable. It's way easier that way, but that's not preferable. So I'm not going to do it that way. In fact, we're just going to start it over. Okay, new music. We're going to... I am going to save these bits, though, because otherwise it's going to be really frustrating. Everything else is going to go. I just want to keep... Excuse me. I just want to keep this part of it. Okay. New music playback, and this will be new music playback, this will be current music playback, and then current music playback 2. Alright, so, we get new music, we're going to check, is this equal to either of the current ones that we have? We also need a boolean that's going to say current music switch. Okay, this boolean is going to tell me which one we're using. Um, or in fact, this will be using music 1. And I'll call this current music 1. That'll work. Alright. So we're going to check... Actually, okay. By default, using music 1 is going to be on. Actually... Yeah, by default, that'll be on. Okay. So, we're going to check, are we using music one? Actually, it's going to be off by default then, in this case. So, it won't be true by default. Are we using music one? If we are using music one, then we're going to we're gonna flip-flop it, basically. So, if we are, now we're not. If we aren't, now we are. Okay. And we're going to check, okay, if we're using music one, then we're going to get current music one... And we're going to, okay, if we're using music one, then we need to check if this one is equal to this one. And if we're using music two, then it's going to be, okay, this is, this is going to work. This, I know this will work now. This, this is fine. Because then we can swap this way. If we weren't currently using music one, then is music two currently equal to the music that we're trying to play? If it's not, then we're going to carry on from there. So if it's not, we're going to fade out over the duration there with a sine curve. Okay, that works. Then if we fade out here, it would be the exact same thing, exactly the same thing. You have 500 lines of code for the character script. I feel like that's not that insane. Am I crazy? I feel like that's not too insane. And then fade out duration. This will be cross, cr cross fade time. Okay. Then, if it's not valid, okay, that, so then after that, it doesn't, okay, that doesn't matter. If it's not valid, we're going to create it. But it doesn't need to be created here. So then, here, we will check... Is current music 2 valid at the end? If it's not, then we're going to create a sound 2D. And this will be the new sound. And we're going to set this to current music 2. And then we're going to fade in. Fade in. Over the same duration. Okay. 
in level and start time is going to be the current music start time. And then we'll have current music to start time. Hate leaf blower. Leaf blowers, I, I can't tell if you're talking about hating the action of using a leaf blower or the noise that they make, but I agree to both. All right. It isn't insane, but it is for you. Okay, that that, that that's fair. That's that's reasonable. Okay, and then this, I can actually just do this and then attach it to Current Music 2. That works. Okay, and we're going to do the exact same thing here, just flipped. All right. That should work. There's no world where this doesn't work. Okay. Nope, that's fine. That's fine. This just need to be flipped now. So this is now current music one. Current music one. Current music one. Okay, there's absolutely a world where this doesn't work, but we're about to find out. Noise, but also like why a broom and a rake works just as well and it's silent. Yeah, but that takes way more time. It did nothing. <laughs> oh, it did nothing because I didn't uh, connect these when they're created. So that's the other problem, too, is if they're not created yet. So this is Current Music 1 is not valid. If it's not valid, then we will... Which one are we fading out here? Fading out 1. Okay, so if it's not valid, then we're going to skip that step and do this. So we'll skip this step and do this. That should work, theoretically. Okay, it just starts. Okay, crossfaded, so that's correct. Okay, what is wrong with it fading in then? Oh, the fade duration, that's... Okay, well, easy enough. There we go. Thank you very much! Okay, never mind. Good God. Is it because it's in the middle of fading? So if I do this, and I let it fade fully, Now I go back. Okay. No, it just cuts out. Why? That doesn't make any sense. Is there an event taken here? No. Of course not. Okay. So, that's annoying. It's so annoying. Okay, if this is true, then do I do this? If this is true, do I do this? I don't think so, but... Okay, that faded that in. Faded that out. I faded the wrong one in. Fades it. I don't know what it's doing anymore. It's backwards now. It flipped. Okay, I know why it flipped. It flipped because I didn't do this. But that might actually be the solution then? That's weird. Okay, it's fading. Nice. Cross fades. And it cuts. Oh, I don't get it. Oh, I don't get it. I hate it. I don't get it. It's so stupid. Oh, my God. Okay. I could so easily just do this in a sound cue, but I'm stubborn, and now I want to do it my way because I like my way better. And this did nothing for me, apparently. Great. Thanks. 
cool. So if we're using music one, this is flipping between the two, that's fine. We're getting this current music, fading it out. Okay, volume level. It's because of the fade out that it just it does it the opposite. I don't know. I don't get it. One neighbor has a silent leaf leaf blower, and I appreciate it so much. The one outside right now is the loudest one I've ever heard. Lawn work is so annoying to listen to. I mean, any noise that's not the normal neighborhood noise is just annoying. But go on your neighbor having a silent leaf blower. I didn't even know those existed. I've never even heard of a silent leaf blower. They're always noisy. Okay, what is what is happening here? It's got to be. Well, I know what's. I know what it's doing. Or I think I know what it's doing. Is if I do this, this fades in fine, and then this cross fades correctly, and then it hits here, and it fades it in. And now it's backwards. It's backwards again. It halts it. Okay, so it's starting... I know what it's doing. Okay. It is starting... The old music again. Which doesn't make sense. So I need to wait these out. These need to wait until it happens to change this setting. Okay. That's correct. That's correct. Nope. It did the same thing. So that doesn't matter. Okay. It's using music one, which means now it's not mu using music one. So when it gets called again, then it is checking his current music one the same. I think this is it. If it is, then we'll check if this is the same. And then if it is, if it's not, if it is still, then whatever. But if it's not, then we'll do this. Oh my god, that's that's a mess. That's a mess right there. I love airplanes going over. It's great. Okay, hold on, Maker. All right, hold on, Maker. Give me a second. Um, this and then this and then this and then this. Oh, I don't. Know. That's a complex mess of wires right there. That worked. That worked. And it does it again. It's doing it no matter what. That makes no sense. So it's not, it has nothing to do with this failing. All right. Cheers, everybody. Got the help bar working, nice. Comes in with a robe and a pink, f and pink fluffy slippers and coffee. All right, grandma, welcome in. Uh, that is gonna help us here because we are in chaos right now. There's no music playing because of the chaos that we're en enduring right now. Welcome in, Andres. <laughs> okay, what is wrong with this? Okay, so it works when neither of them are valid. But then when this... When it is valid... Okay, it's gotta be one of these. One of these is, is causing the problem. This will be music to to currently no uh, cur uh, same music two same this will be music one same okay works the first time because it doesn't exist yet works the second time because it doesn't exist yet it's not failing it's not failing it's just wrong <laughs> What? Okay. This is music two. Music one. Music two, music one. Music two, music one. So it, it's this. 
Am I supposed to be? Okay, what am I fading out? I'm fading out music one. Am I? I'm not setting the sound. I'm an idiot. I think. That doesn't change this fact, though. The only time this works is when it does this, creating the sound. That's why. Okay. So we set the sound here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. We... It is valid, so we set sound to the new sound. And then we go. I didn't do that step. That's dumb of me. But this should still work overall. Now. This, and then this. Works the first time, of course. Works the second time, of course. At least it's playing the right sound now. It's still just stopping the music, though, is the problem. Okay, hold on. Let's start with just, like, this. Okay, so now it's playing the first- this is music one. Now it's not gonna start it again. Oh, it is! Oh, it is- are you kidding me? So this isn't even working. We start out, it's set using music one. Oh my god, it's backwards. Well, that doesn't help. I mean, it doesn't matter. This doesn't change anything, really. It just doesn't help with my brain. If we are using music one, if we're not using, if we're using music one there, I had it flipped, of course. Does that change anything? I don't think that changes anything for me. Okay. Now I hit it again. And it faded out anyway. So it's not detecting that it's the same. Yep, that's why. Okay, wait, no. Well, okay, so this can't happen yet. This does this. This does this. And that only happens if this succeeds. Okay, that's important. That's crucial information right there. That I skipped over. There, okay. I missed it. I missed the trigger. Okay. Starts the music. Oh, it shouldn't start it again. It started it again. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? It's not music one. Music one is not the same. So now we're using music one. That's the problem. This does not need to exist. So... The only time... Okay, so it's going to do this. The only time would be this. And then this. I think. Okay, let's try that. So if I hit this, starts the music. I, d I don't... I don't... I don't get it. I don't get it. Why? The new music... Is the current music we are setting it? That is the sound. Also, this is flipped now. I'm so confused. So, if it's not the same, then we're gonna fade out. But it is the same. How is it? So, it's this one then. I just, I think I have it backwards. Oh my god, this is so confusing. Starting over. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. When we set music, we are going to... Oh, Jesus Christ. Why is this so confusing? Why is this the hardest thing I've done so far? Also, why is my camera offset? Is my camera... Like, no, it's not. I'm just sitting weirdly. Okay, never mind. Hold on, I need I need some W for refreshments. Refresh my brain power. Okay. 
and we set the music to whatever this new music is we're gonna have two times um, previous fade out so we're gonna have three times All right, well previous fade delay before next and new fade Okay, it's going to be, let's just say, three seconds, five seconds, too long. Three seconds, one second, three seconds. There. Okay. <sighs> Doing this again. <laughs> Since I'm streaming now, am I streaming tonight too? I'm I'm not going to do, like, gaming tonight. I'm literally just going to stream the development of this game until it's done. So if that takes me through, the, to, through tonight, then yes. If not, then no, we'll end when I'm done here. But whenever this, this stream is done, that's going to be today's stream. I'm not streaming tonight with first or anything. All right, let's But I will this will most likely take me the whole day. So I don't see myself stopping early or anything. Especially since we've been here for 2 hours and I'm still trying to get the music to fade, <laughs> which is not a good sign for what's to come. Uh, okay, okay, okay. We're going to get the we need to crossfade these. Why is crossfade not a node? Why is there no crossfade node? It's so stupid. Okay. We're going to get the current music. If it exists. Does the current music exist? If it does, let's just start by assuming that it does exist. If the current music does exist, then we're going to... When we set new music, then we're going to fade out our current music over duration of previous and then we're going to create no we're going to check is our current music 2 valid if it is if it is then we're going to set sound to the new sound and we're going to fade in over duration like this but we're gonna also add the delay in between delay before next there we go okay that's the baseline of it that is that that should be it then if new music sorry if current music one is not valid okay so this is where we have to determine when do we do when do we flip it I guess it would just be a flip-flop node but also that wouldn't make any sense there will only ever be two music active at once that part I know for sure so music one Oh, my brain. Oh, my brain hurts doing this. Okay. Current music one, we fade out. If it's valid. If it's not valid, then we do nothing. We just skip that. And then we delay, and then we do this. Current music two is not valid, then we create current music two. Create sound. This is the sound. And this becomes our current music two. And then current music two is what we set the sound and we fade in with. Okay, that's fine because then we're gonna loop back around and do this. Then we're gonna do the same thing another time, just the opposite. So music two and then music one, music one, music one, and then connect these up. Okay, that's fine. That's not so bad. So then we have the fade duration from the previous, the fade between, and then the fade out, or fade in of the new one. Okay, that's all fine. Now, when to do which is the big question here. Okay, so we're... We set music. Now... Okay, that's fine. Let's try this. Let's just try this as is. Let's see. Okay, that's correct. Good. Didn't fade out. I think I don't have it set to do... No, I do. What? 
fade duration, delay, fade duration, excuse me? Because this one doesn't exist no matter what. Right. Okay. Oh boy. Wouldn't be a sequence node. It would be a flip. So, oh my god. Okay, so this is when we have to check if the current one is valid, and then if it ex- oh my god. Okay. Oh boy, alright. We're gonna start by checking, is current music one valid? If it is, then is it equal to the new music? Because that's the one that we're gonna fade out. So if it's equal to the new music, then we don't want to fade it out. But if it's not, we can continue. If it is the same, then we don't want to do anything because that wouldn't do it. But then here is only if it's not valid. Right? No. It would be off the true. If it's not valid, we want to create it. And this is music one. We'd want to do this. So I would literally just skip to here where I do this. And then this same thing, check if this is valid. If it's not, and okay, so then this will do this. And then if it's not, we'll do this. Oh my god, that's equally as messed up. Dog barking, don't mind that. Okay. It didn't fade. It did fade? It's not fading the previous one. That's the closest we've been, though. Oh my god, okay. It, oh, it's because this. I'm an idiot. There we go. Okay, fades in. Nope. It's not fading out that one. Now it did. Oh, it's so broken. Oh, it's so broken. Oh, why is it so broken? Why is it so broken? Oh my god. That's worse. Oh, I don't get it. I don't get why that's an issue. Okay, let's do this again. That works. Fades in. just overlapped it. It literally is only overlapping it. So it can't be this then. This is part of it, but that can't be all of it. So we need to determine which one is currently active. So that's where the using one comes in, because in this case, we're now using music one. No, okay, here we're not using music one. Music one has been faded out. Here, we are using music one because music two has been faded out. Okay. So then here we're going to check at the beginning which one we're checking for. So are we using music one currently? If we are, then we're going to see if it's the same and if it's not, then there we go. Otherwise, we're going to do this. That should work as far as my brain can understand it. Okay, music one comes in. We're using music one right now. Fade out music one, fade in music two. Thank you. I'm using music two right now. Fade out, fade in music one. 
Okay. I did it. Oh my god. Not worth it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, there we go. We did it. Look at this mess. Look at this slop right here. Just to fade in one piece of music and have another one. And also, it's not doing this because I forgot to do that step. Okay, let's do that now. Uh, which is when we create music. This is music one. It would be at the bottom. Okay. There we go. And then music two up at the top. And then it'll do the same thing. Oh, well, now I'm out of space. Okay. Let's move all this off to the side. And now that's all attached. Great. Can I not do that, please? Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. There we go. Nice. Okay. Uh, what? Oh, really? Music two, music one, and now we can use music two time when we fade it in. No, music one time here to fade in, maybe? Or maybe I want to do this the other way. I don't know. Let's see. Okay. It's going to start music one a little later now. Yeah, I want to do it the other way, though, I think. I think it's better the other way. Two, music one. Okay. Now, music one will start at zero, as far as I know. Okay. Now, music two should start later. Yeah, okay. Okay, that works. That's really not necessary, but it works. It's better in this case, uh, where you may be flipping back and forth between multiple zones. Okay, cool. God, that was not worth it. All right, but we did it. Jesus, remember to stretch, gamers. Remember to hydrate. You guys know the deal. Cheers, everybody. Now, back on our hunt for music pieces. Also, we need to... Uh, move this into the assets folder, which is gonna take its time. So now we just vibe for a bit. Hello, guys. How are you guys doing this fine Friday afternoon or whatever time it is for you, wherever you are in the world? Because I'm exhausted already. <laughs> we've done like nothing. We've. What have we done so far? We've literally play tested with music, and that's it. And we've only found two pieces of music, and I need like five. So that's concerning. And this is going to take a sweet time loading, which is great. Okay. Well then. Hopefully I can find music in here. There's almost no way I don't find music in this pack. And then we need to do sound effects, and then we need to build that last level. And then, Andres, you're getting your freeze laser and possibly your invisa spikes. We'll see. Um, and, uh, you know, I may force you to play test again. Because you're bringing the pain upon first... Oh, jeez. Well, I mean, I'm d I'm the one bringing the pain because I'm the one developing it, but uh, I'm partially blaming you for your suggestions, at least. But You know how it is. Alright. I wish this didn't take so long. Why does this have to take so long? I heard bad things are happening. Yeah, that's just this game, in general. It's... It, it, we blame... Hashtag blame Andres. That's the new hashtag. I don't think, yeah, I don't really have much else to add. Yeah. Oh, now we just wait for it to go through the process. Jesus. Oh, everybody's starting their streams now. All the big streamers are starting their streams now. Great. Cool. Take away all my viewers. It's fine. <laughs> there you go, Andres. Eat a chip. Trying to fill my affiliate information. Hey, don't blame me. All right, well, I mean, the freeze laser and the and the invisible spikes are gonna be your fault. That is, that is 100% your fault. <laughs> and more chips. 
Andres, uh, go eat, uh, go eat chips, but also finish your affiliate forms. It's more important, but also eat because that's also important. But okay, you guys, <laughs> he, I don't even think he has any chips with him right now. I love how that's a redemption on my stream. I think we remove it from my stream after you've set up your affiliate stuff, and then we just add it to your stream. Just to make you feel better from knowing you're going to have to play this more. Yeah, we're giving you preemptive snacks for later. Save the snacks for later. Just like write down how many chips you have to do for later when you inevitably have to play this again. <laughs> Which I will not force this upon you, but... If you just so happen to volunteer, then there's a possibility. <laughs> Andres, if I had chips, I would eat chips out of solidarity, but I have Cheez-Its and they're almost gone and I don't want to waste them, so. The four Andres is in full effect there. I got you, but also I, I literally don't got you, but I got you in spirit, and that's all that matters. <laughs> Does anybody see... So, okay, when we scroll, when you scroll down on Twitch and you see the, uh, the sub goal, do you guys see the three dots? Are those just, like, random markers to show 25%, 50%, and 75%? Because I, like, I'm hovering over on them, I'm clicking them, and they're doing nothing. So I think those are just random markers as, like, incentives. But, like... I didn't add those. Are they incentives? Can I add incentives? I didn't know that was a thing. I would just I would join you, but I just sat down and the chips are all the way over on the fridge. They're so far, Andres. They're so far. See them? Would seem that they're just random markers. Yeah, it wasn't there before. It wasn't there like a week ago. But now it is. Oh, excuse me. If I go to like, where do I even see my goals? It's like manage goals? Is that, where is that? Manage goals. Yeah, there's markers on them. But I can't do anything with them. I can't customize them. There, there's nothing I can do about it. That's That's so dumb. Plus program? What is this? I have no idea what that is. Okay. Plus points. I don't know what that is. Okay. No thanks. That's fine. I don't know what's up with that. That's weird. Oh, I didn't set a new uh, follower goal. I should do that. What's our next follower goal? 400? Probably 400. No, 420. There we go. The plus program ups your pay from Twitch to to a sixty forty. Really? Uh, really? Okay, let me read this out loud. Enabling sharing shows plus points you earned this month to your viewers on your channel page. You can use this to share your progress towards plus program eligibility and encourage community support. So if I enable this, what does that do? Uh, okay, I enabled it. That did nothing. <laughs> At, enabling it did nothing. Great. Cool. Epic. Hmm. Okay. Whatever. Hey, would you look at that? We're 75% we're of the way to our, our funny number goal. Okay. Well. Cool. Whatever. There's also bits goals, but I don't really care about bits. If you guys like to donate bits, that's cool, but we don't get that many bit donations. Maybe I should have a bits goal. Maybe I'll do a bits goal for when I like want to do funding for like a uh, backrooms game or something like that, like we were talking about before. Okay, is it finished? Oh, it's still going. It just moved the loading screen to my other monitor. Whoops. Level 1, achieve 100 plus points or more for 3 consecutive months to qualify. This level provides a 60-40 net revenue share on subscriptions. Level 2, achieve 300 points. That's weird. Okay. But how do you get plus points? 
a funding for what I was considering. So we beat uh, Escape the Backrooms, and it was like, oh, this is cool. We I really enjoyed this, even though it was kind of a garbage game at times, but also it was a great game at times. So I was like, maybe I, I feel like I could make a good Backrooms game, but environments for Backrooms type stuff is expensive because I'm not a modeler. So I would be paying upwards of probably at least 500 bucks to make that project happen. So I was like, you know what, I would probably want to raise uh, like at least a thousand dollars for funding for the Backrooms game to uh, to make that happen, if you guys would want that in the first place. So it's something to consider in the future, but I don't think we're there yet. That's going to be a long project. And I don't even know if I want to do that. It might be, we might want to do funding for something else at some point. I don't know, we'll see. Let me look up, while well, this is still loading, how to get plus points on Twitch. Partner plus points are accumulated from paid recurring subscriptions. Your channel must maintain 350 or more partner plus points for three consecutive months. Okay, so we're nowhere even close to that. Jesus Christ. Uh, you need, I think that means you need an, a, like you need to consistently get 350 subs a month at least. Which I think just means... Like, where would I even see that? Where would I even see how many plus points I currently have? Would I see that anywhere? Because I enabled it. You guys should be able to see how many plus points I have. If any. Oh, there it is. Okay. Eight. I have eight plus points. Let's go. <laughs> so, refresh, gamers. Apparently. Because that's the thing now. If you scroll down, you can see May. Help me reach plus eligibility. Interesting. That's really stupid that they lock my better pay behind a wall like that. That's dumb, but I, it also makes sense. Interesting. Okay. Oh, so that's where the sub points come in. Okay, so if you, if you sub at tier 3, it gives me 6 points. If you sub at tier 1, it gives me 1. Right, so that's that makes more sense now. Interesting. Remember to use your prime subs, gamers, if you have them available. All right. Anyways, yeah. So that's apparently a thing. I want to help. If you, I mean, so we, we might end up doing that at some point, but it's it's a long ways away. But if you want to help with that, that'd be cool. I might set up like a Discord thing for that, where in the Discord, if you guys have models and stuff, you guys can share that and whatever. It would be a very long running process though. Is it still loading? Oh my god, it's still loading. Okay. Not been claiming my bonuses. I'm at 50.8k. Spooner, are you just going to update me every time you pop into stream? Are you just going to update how many points you have? <laughs> oh yeah, because you're trying to get to 75k right now, aren't you? Right. Alright, it's still loading. Once it's done loading, we can finally carry on <laughs> and make progress here. <clears throat> All right. Uh, Andres, I, I know you're doing other stuff, but when you get a second, uh, I want your honest feedback on the game based on what you played last night in terms of how difficult it was uh, and how difficult you think it will be for first. Take your time. I know you're doing other stuff. So close to mod. I will spend 75k on hydrates when I get mod. Uh, never mind, Spoon. You now have to get 125k to get uh, to get mod. That's the new requirement. I need my inhaler. Give me a moment. Oh, I can kind of breathe again. That's nice. Fun asthma times. We love asthma. It's beautiful. Oh, welcome in, Rose. Oh my god, is it done loading? Oh, thank god. Okay, well, it still has issues. Okay, there we go. Now I can fix up. And now it's going to load more. Never mind. Nope, it's still... Never mind, it is. Okay, well, there we go. Now if I do this, I can delete this, and it's not deleting. Okay, cool. Love when that happens. Makes no sense when that happens. Don't know why that happens, but it happens. Okay. Can I go to the bean fracture, please? Just open file location. Thank you. 
Bean challenge, content, delete that. There we go. Perfect, okay. Average Vano's living are, average Vano's living are health conditions. What are you talking about, Spoon? It's pretty difficult. I think first I'll have a hard time, but I definitely think that last trim should be added to be the last nail on the head. Yeah, so that's it for sure. Uh, you, I don't think you've seen the thing that we added, uh, that I added at the end. I'll show you that in a bit, but yeah, it's definitely, it's definitely difficult. I'm worried because I don't know his skill as a platformer. Living area health. I have no idea what you're talking about, Spoon. I, I can't, I couldn't tell you. Fish! Why are we screaming fish? Welcome in, Gax. Gax? Gax. Love that. Having a chaotic IRL day. Uh, came here to de-stress for a bit. I have a feeling that's not going to happen. I, I have a feeling it's going to become more chaotic, but best of luck anyway. <laughs> Gax is a great little name. I know it's hybrid Gax, but still, Gax is just great. Okay. Now it's done. Now we can actually finally get back to. Okay, we gotta find music. We gotta we gotta make this work. Okay. Action combat. Okay, there's a lot. As you can see, there's a lot more music in here, but also a lot of this is very generic music. So. Oh, I need to remember which ones I used for bark because I did use a couple of these in bark, and I don't want to double up on that. That's kind of fitting for this. These might work better. For the, okay, so here, let me let me move these over. Okay, these are going to be empty right now. Both of these are going to be reset to none. We're going to move this over and we're going to showcase the music that I found for these areas right here. Okay, so here... We discovered a couple good pieces. Although I don't know if I'm set on this room's piece yet, so maybe that'll be different. This one is going to be also a little bit different because we haven't uh, landed on that one yet perfectly. So that one I'll leave empty. This one right here. Wait. No, this is... Oh, it's going to be kind of annoying. Well, we can't go backwards, so this one doesn't matter as much. But, okay, there. This is going to be the lava room right now, which is probably going to change. Uh, and then I'll copy this over here. And right here is going to be the lava room again. Okay. And then we'll have another one inside of this room now, right here, for the laser room. Okay, so now I can do, I can put my player there, and then we can go from there. Player, go to spawn three. Here we go. This is the laser room music that we have so far. Want to make an ex uh, experience system for your game? Should I double the experience requirement for each level or like add a set amount for each? I wouldn't double it. I would make it exponential. Alright, so this is the music for the, uh, the lava room right now, which is kind of fitting. It's a little extra epic, which I don't necessarily see being the best for this. Oh, it restart. Why did it do- wait, why did it do that? That's not right. It shouldn't have done that, because it's the same music. Okay, now I have to fix the- I literally just did this, and now I have to do this again. I, I literally just did this, now I have to fix it. Great. Oh, hi, dog. Okay. That one it does not like anybody right there, for sure. Okay, I need to fix that. That's so annoying. Why is that- it's starting it over. And it's causing problems. So like, yes, yes, exactly like that maker, exactly. Okay, what is happening? It's, we, it's valid, it's the same music. It's because this, of course. So if the trigger that we hit, oh God. Oh, come on, man. That's... That breaks the whole... That breaks it all. That was working, and now it's not... Okay. So we tell it that we're no longer using Music 1. So then when we determine this, it's like, oh, wait, nope, it's still that. Uh, 
that's so stupid. Okay. Great. So, because of this, now the problem is when we hit it, it needs to check both. If the new music is the same as the one that we're hitting, then it needs to not do anything, no matter what, for both of them. So maybe we do this. And then we check here. Oh my god. Oh my brain. Okay. If it is, then we check this. And then if it's not, then we do this check here. Which is going to be this check here. If we're using music one, now we're not. If we're not. Okay, that maybe will work. Oh god, I hope so. Okay, it'll start it. Now I leave the area. What is happening? What is happening? Why? It's because of this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. That's useless then. So this is exactly what I did before and this wasn't working. And then it fades it out and brings it back in. Oh my god, okay. Jesus Christ. And it's because they can't both be... Oh, that's such a problem. That's such a terrible problem. This is a broken system. This system isn't going to work. This system just flat out isn't going to work. Unless I'd make the... The only way this would work is if I made the sound trigger fill the full room. Which is also annoying in case I have a, a room that's not a perfect shape. Which is the case in some of these rooms. We'll be back in a bit. Time to record. Alright, see you, Kate. Thanks for being here. Appreciate you. I have no idea what's happening. This is a problem. I'm really racking my brain right now, guys. Alright, let's bring some music in. Oh, that's really frustrating because this was fine and now it's not. How did that even- how did that happen? I'm gonna undo this back to here. Okay, that's f there. Fine. Fine. Now... Put the player back at this point, and let's see if that was happening at all, and I just was an idiot and didn't test it. Oh, I got rid of the music. Yeah, 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 I get it. Okay. How far back do I have to go? Oh, Jesus. Okay, fine. Whatever. Doesn't matter. This one is going to be, let's just say, this one and... This one is going to be this one. It's fine. Why did it put me here? No. Put me. No. This. Put me here. Thank you. Starts the music. And it does. It restarts it if I hit it. I didn't consider that. But everything else works, right? So I do this. Everything else works. Until I hit it again, in which case... Great. Oh, that's so stupid. Okay. So, I... I set the music... It's this that's causing the problem. If I can just eradicate this... But I can't. 
I need to have one that's current music playing. So we have current music. We need an actual current music. It's going to be current music. Okay, current music is going to be set to... Okay, not like that. Like this. Current music. This will this will solve it right here. Every time when we do this, we are setting current music here, and then we're gonna do the same thing here. Whenever that happens, we're setting current music. Okay. And then we're gonna check the beginning. Is current music? It's validated at first. If it's not valid, it doesn't matter. If it is valid, then we're going to check, is this equal to this? Not that. If it is, then we're not going to do this. If it's not, then we will. There. Oh, that's dumb, but it'll, it should work. Right? Let's find out. Okay. Thank you. There we go, okay. Oh, it didn't reset it to here. Wait, what? Oh, God. And it did it again. No, because I guess I hit the other one. Oh, God. So what I'm going to have to do is... Whenever we hit the save... We also need to tell uh, get game instance, get music, current music, and then we're going to set a new variable in here. This is going to be current music. So that way when we respawn, it'll try. So in player, this will this, this will fix the error that I had a second ago. So... Actually, it won't in this case, but it will in general. Uh, when we respawn and we take the spawn point, we're going to get current music and then we're going to set music. So get game instance set music to the new music like normal. Okay, at the very end. Actually, I guess not at the very end, just like here. It's fine, it's going to be a mess, but whatever. Actually, no, not like that. Like this, because it only works if this is valid. So, there. Okay. There. Which doesn't matter okay oh Jesus Christ all right anyways now that that's taken care of we can go back to where we just were trying to be which is here god all right so now it sets this music cool and now if we die here it's still fading it maybe not maybe it's not Okay, it's not. It's not fading it. Never mind. So this is the music that we have for this area right now. Okay. Let's see if I can beat this first try. Which, I mean, it's already not first try, but you get the point. Alright, so those jiggle, and then we do that, and then there we go. This part is just mean, I'm aware. I'm aware that this part is just mean. It's so finicky and touchy. Yep, and I'm dead. Okay, not first try, but whatever. This this area is just ridiculously mean. 
I have a feeling he'll be stuck here for a long time because he his pinky cramps easily and you you have to sprint in this game. Oops. And you kind of need to swap between sprinting and not sprinting all the time. And he's not really used to that yet. So if anything, this is going to be sprint training simulator for him. Him being first, of course. So we're going to add a few things. We're going to add a death counter, and we're going to add a time in-game counter as well. Because there's no save system. So whenever you start up the game, that, that should be easy to do. Wow, I'm messing up there. That's an easy one. Yeah, I like how Andres was completely ignoring my advice last night. Which, you know, I, I, I get it. I understand. Uh, but I will say, it is much easier to do things when you're looking down, just saying. When you're looking from a top-down perspective, a lot easier. Just saying. Kind of necessary for some of these areas, too. <laughs> Nuh-uh, lies, uh-huh. Which part's the lie? The fact that you weren't listening to me or the fact that it's easier top-down? Because uh, w both of those are very, very much truths. This is a very intense setup. See, it did the thing again where I went backwards. I was looking up, I pressed forward, and I went backwards. That's only happening to me. Did that happen to anybody else? I don't think so. Wow, I'm just really cutting that corner too sharp. And yeah, you can skip this little area, but it's not too bad. He's going to hate me after this, for sure. And I'm dead. Yeah, let's see if I can just do the skip. I'll just do the skip. Yeah. It's worth it in some ways, as long as you can actually make it, which sometimes you don't make it there. There we go. And I tied at those. Great. That happens might be because my camera is going too far forward when you move it all the way up. Yeah, I know, but it shouldn't. That shouldn't be possible. It is literally locked before that, and it's the default Unreal Engine setting. So if that's a problem, then it's Unreal Engine's fault. Because, yeah, that was, that's what I thought it would be, but there's no reason that that would happen. I'm just going to do the skip. Nope. I was too far off. I know you guys are screaming over there about chips. I, I am not engaging because I have no idea what I missed. Lunar and the army of rats is uh, redeeming chips. From Hushed from a distance, of course. And I'm dead. <laughs> At least that's better than having to do the other part, but I should probably just keep doing the other part. Because I'm, I'm expecting him to do the other part. If he can find a way to cheese it, then good for him, but I doubt it. Oh, well. He will try every way other than beating it normally, though. I guarantee it. He will try to find ways to cheese it. He just won't stick to, like, trying to figure it out. He'll, he'll give up before- he'll give up the cheating before he gives up on the game. You see, he's not good with persistence, so if anything, this is gonna train him to be more persistent. And I messed that up horribly. What is flickering over there? There's something that's, like, overlapping it over there, and I don't know what it is. Wait, I do know what it is. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, hold on. We got What? Really? Why did that fail? You serious? What? What's wrong with that? Oh, Jesus Christ. Is valid. God, I hate this.
I hate things like that. It's so stupid. Okay, if it's not valid, then don't do anything. If it is valid, then do it. So stupid. It's gonna there's gonna be a few of those, I'm sure. Whatever. Okay. Still. I'm gonna have the experience be 2x every level because exponential would also mean I have to exponentially increase the difficulty by adding more enemies. That would be the idea, but if that's not gonna be the case, then just double it. That's fine. It's also a game jam, so you know how to train your first. Uh, yeah, that's gotta be. I don't know. Whatever. Okay. Oh wait, no, I paused because I was gonna do another thing. So this, yeah, that's going through that right there. So that's why that looks glitchy from a distance. Which is stupid. But if I do this, it's going to look dumb. That was not what I meant. Uh, I want to go into edit mode, please. There we go. So I could do this. But then that, one, once again, looks stupid. Yeah, whatever. I'll just deal with it being kind of glitchy there. I don't care. That's fine. Or, no, no I was going to say I can make it a little smaller, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Nope. And it did, it did the thing. Wait a second. No. Why? No, no, no. Why is that happening? It fades out. Why? Why is this so broken? I'm about to just do it the other way. I'm about to say screw it and do it the other way. That's so frustrating. It, it 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 oh my god are you kidding me are you kidding me that makes no sense there's no reason for that oh boy i'm i'm getting filled with hate at this at this game not at the game the, the game isn't the frustrating part Welcome in, Joe. Sorry, I didn't notice you popped in. Welcome in. Uh, the only chaos allowed here is mine. I should time you out for that. <laughs> the chaos allowed here is mine. I am the chaos. Why is this broken? Why does this suck so much? We'll undo my time out if you do. That's alright, I'll just time you out and, uh, as well. <laughs> See, that's the chaos right there. Super chaos. Okay, we need to... Let's try this the other way. Let's just try this this way. Sounds, sound cue, music. And then... Let's have... Just... These three pieces here, in fact, we'll have all of them, which we're, we're, we're going to find more eventually. We haven't even gotten to that part yet because we have, keep having problems with the stupid audio system. Oh, I will undo the Rose timeout. Maker, I can just demod you. People have been requesting it, so. Uh, okay, cross fade by parameter. Parameter name is going to be... Well, that's annoying. Um... Uh... The fade... I ju just... Uh, room. I don't know. Sure. Okay, and then I could just have a million of these, couldn't I? 
because the parameter is just an integer as far as I know. So let's just say lava room, laser room, and then this. That'll be it, just for testing sake. Please tell me I can remove that. Thank you. And output. Crossfade between them. I have no idea how the crossfade works. I, I genuinely don't know. Make chat do a competition and winner gets your mod status. No. <laughs> that's too much work. Spoon should take your place. Yeah, that's that's reasonable. Uh, okay. Let me just, for testing's sake, add sound cue or no, what is it? Audio audio not multiple assets literally just this one audio cue music there we go uh, and then instead of everything that we're currently doing which I will literally just disconnect so it doesn't actually do anything uh, whenever we hit a music trigger instead of doing this we're just going to get music cue and we're going to set parameter float parameter no not float parameter integer parameter set parameter integer parameter room to and we'll make a public variable for this it's gonna be room so I will make can we start back here please uh, let's test this put you here so this will be room zero. This will be room one. Let's see how this works. I don't know if that did it. Jesus Christ. I think it was playing all of them at the same time. Ah, uh, <laughs> Jesus Christ! Uh, yeah, that happens. Let's let's learn how this works. Why don't we? Okay, let's learn real quick. Okay, great. Okay, audio component, flow parameter, okay, 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 how do I select which one it crossfades to? Crossfade by parameter settings. Make sure that your audio file is looping. Otherwise, crossfade by parameter. Okay. Yeah, I know. Have fade in start and fade in end values. I decided to set. The okay. What does this have to do with anything? The audio file to fade out maximum. Okay. So crossfade is not doing what I thought it did. Or it is, I don't, I uh, know. So that's not gonna work then. Okay, what? Well, I don't know, man, I, this is stupid. Okay, so that's not gonna work. Go, figure that out, great, cool, awesome, epic. Glad that happened, all right that was a waste so it is gonna have to be done this way this whole thing about how I thought it was gonna be easy yeah no turns out nope <laughs> oh Jesus not gonna be easy not gonna be easy all right because I could switch between them I'm not properly awake good good yeah I did that just for you guys on purpose of course
is this supposed to work? How am I supposed to make this work? I could literally just put the... I, I could do this the easy way and figure this out later. Why am I doing this? I want to make the system work easily right now. That's why I'm doing this. I want it to be straightforward the way that it should be. But it's not working like that. God. Delete that. Whatever. Oh my god. Okay, so we set music. And when we do... We are checking if the current music is equal to the new music. And if it's not, then every time we actually end up fading in the new music, we set the current music. So that way it doesn't restart itself. This should be working. But it's not. And I don't know why. That's fine. It's working now. It's literally working now. I have an idea. I have an idea of why it might be this. It literally might be this. Okay, it might be this. Because it's working otherwise. It might be that. Uh, if it is that, then that's a fairly easy fix. Okay, so if I make myself not move to here and just go back to where we were before. Okay, this. Fades in the music. It's doing that because it's trying to... What? Yeah, shut up. Watch. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. I know. It's. I know. It's struggling. It's fine. So here... This needs to be... Can I convert this to a validated git? Oh, I can. Oh, cool. I didn't know you could do that with that. Sweet. Okay. Then I could do this. So, if it is valid, then we set music. If it's not valid, then we skip it. Um, and then here... When we save it... So, when we go to the checkpoint, when we save it, we're getting current music... Get current music. Okay, so that's correct. And then this needs to be validated get. Okay. Only if it's valid. There. Okay. Now that might fix it. Let's go. Oh, thank God. Okay, now we can finally finish testing what we were testing here. Jesus Christ. Okay. Why does my sensitivity feel extra high now? That's weird. I didn't change it. It's fine. Okay, it fixed itself. Weird. I am a god programmer. You know, we talk about being a god gamer all the time, but I am a god programmer. I made Bean Game. And this is Bean Game 2. This is a hard Bean Game. This is Tic Tac Game. I did. Focus levels have never been so high. What do we think about this music, by the way, for this area? It's very dramatic. Oh, this part sucks. Okay, and then this one's easy. Okay, now we're here. New music. Laser room. Yeah! Nice. Okay. Now here's a real test of the music. If we go this way, it should set it back. Yep, it sets it back. What music is it? What? what? Oh, that's the dramatic music in this room. Maybe that music's too dramatic. Okay, now it should set it back. It didn't. What? So that didn't work. Oh, because that. Wait, no, what? What? 
Okay. Oh, that's confusing. That's dumb. What? So, did I just not... No, that's... I don't know why that did that. Okay, but that's the right music for the laser section. But then here... Puts us back in the epic music zone. And then I respawn, it should put us back in the laser section. Oh, now it does. I don't think it did that a second ago. Am I crazy? I don't know. Yeah, right there we have a YouTuber, the wild... It's right in the face area, and judging the sounds it's making, can you... You can tell it's angry. I have no idea what you just tried to say, Manger. If you worship the flying spaghetti monster, then the spaghetti man would also technically be a god. That is that is correct. Your dad may disagree. I don't think your dad would disagree, because here's the thing about programming. No matter how sloppy it looks, if it works, that's what matters. That's all that matters. In the words of Lixian, as long as it works, that's what matters. Yeah, so this is a much better soundtrack for the uh, laser zone. It just changed it back. No, it's flip-flopping. Why? Literally, this one. Why is that flip-flopping? There's no reason for that. It's because it wasn't when we saved. Oh, God, no. So that's not going to work. Okay. It's fine. You know what? That's fine. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. We don't have to do that when we respawn. Instead, we're going to do it differently. This doesn't matter. This, we're just going to skip. That's fine. Instead, we're just going to have this trigger happen every single time we land in this zone. There we go. That's it. Easy as that. Okay. That's fine. I'm fine with that. That's good. Perfectly fine. Yes. Good. Okay. That should work. Let's try it. So it's ominous music. Nothing will happen. We'll die. Respawn. Nothing happens. Music stays the same. Okay, good. And we do this. We get through this section. I feel like this music might be a bit too ominous and intense. I don't know. That was dumb. I don't know why I'm trying to do the skip. Let's just get through this so I can figure out if the music's even working correctly. Okay. Halfway. Nice. Why didn't I get it? Okay, that was dumb of me. I don't know why I tried to go sideways like that. I hope this doesn't kill the bitrate. I know it killed Andre's bitrate last night, but it, I looked back on the YouTube video VODs of this on my stream and it didn't kill the bitrate too much. Is the bitrate dying for you guys? It, honestly, it probably should. Well, that was dumb of me. fine for you. Okay, cool. Maybe affiliates just get better bit rates. That's weird. It makes sense, but it's weird. I'm sure partners get perfect bit rates and I'm okay. Serious sucks. Yeah, you guys are very right about this being 3D geometry dash. Very accurate. The good thing about this is the music doesn't really get old, but it still is might be a little too epic for this. And wow, that was dumb of me. Wow, that was terrible. God, I'm I suck at this.
Okay, wow. I should just jump that. I think you can literally just jump over that. Maybe not. That was terrible. You do get worse. The more you play an area, the worse you get at the easy parts because you start trying to skip ahead. is done. Okay, we'll now manage all the details, uh, all the little details of my stream soon. Yeah, see, now you're gonna start caring, because now the money opportunity is there, so now you're gonna start caring about all the little things you're gonna go crazy like I did. Um, but also, if you scroll down on my Twitch channel right now, you'll see that it really doesn't matter. Like, I hand drew all those in Photoshop for fun, and, uh, people like them better now. Be unique, stand out, be different. That's our mantra around here. Okay, here we go. Okay, <laughs> alright, that's mean a bit. I think the goal of mine for the stream with first should be to spend two hours rather than four hours because maybe four hours was a bit of like a, a stretch um, of desire of like I want to make a game in one week that is so hard that first won't be able to beat it in four hours so maybe two hours is a better way to go but also Jacob was really struggling with it so I don't know we might adapt midway okay this is I literally just want to test this I literally just want to test to make sure well, I'm not giving up. I literally just want to test if the music is working. That's the whole point of this, and now I'm just struggling with this. I want to do the skip. That's how you know this part sucks. Like, when you can't even do it for testing sake. Welcome in, Waffles. Oh, that sucks. That skip is not an easy skip. It's a nice skip. It's a very satisfying skip, but it is not an e it is not a nice easy skip. I don't know if there's a better way to do that skip either. I think there might be. Oh, wasn't even paying attention. There might be an easier way to do the skip too. It's like maybe something from up there. I don't know. My thought process would be, right, get over here, jump over this. Well, that was dumb. I should just jump straight to the other platform. Jump around this. Jump over this. Yeah, I did two. Done with me. Jump over this. And then maybe... I don't think you can reach it from there. Let's try it. Let's find out. Nope. Maybe if you curved around the corner, but that's harder. It's easier to just do that. Oh my god, that's close. Yeah. That's more reasonable for that skip. <laughs> and I'm dead. Jesus Christ. Yeah, this section is by far the worst. I might just be able to double jump over that. That might be way easier. Yeah, <laughs> well, not easier, but looks cooler. Looks epic. Wow, I don't know why I'm doing that. I literally just want to test this next area. That's how dumb this section is. At least it sounds epic. I don't know if we'll keep this music, though. It does kind of fit. It sounds kind of Final Boss-esque, though, which is a problem. Because it's not. This is not the Final Boss. This is the Final Boss before the Final Boss. Yeah, that spike sucks. I'm so sorry about that. To anybody who ever plays this, for whatever reason, if you ever choose to play this, I am so sorry.
Okay, we're skipping because I literally just want to test if the music is even working. Please, just let me... Because I don't want to go through all of this and the music doesn't even work. Plus, we need to move on. This is not playtest time. Oh my god, can I please? Thank you. Literally, just let me test. And, you know, I'll even start here. I'll, I'll still go through half of it, but just let me let me test. It's... Okay, it doesn't want me to test. It really doesn't want me to test. There. Oh, there's no music this time. I was... You saw that. You guys saw that, right? I was going backwards that time. It did. It flipped my controls. What is causing that? Okay. That just wouldn't go. Cool. Well, we have no music now. This is not nearly as intense anymore. Oh, okay. Well, this is going well. Hope you guys are enjoying the uh, podcast that this has become. Well, yeah, first is going to hate me. No doubt. No doubt going to hate me. Well, no oh, we're not going to know if the music works now because the music is broken. Oh, my God. Uh, this is this is this is stupid. All right. We're going to beat it. We're going to beat it because that's the only way we're going to find out. I, Jesus Christ. For the record, I've already beaten this section, what, three times today? And now I have to do it again? That spike is the worst. I hope this music isn't copyright. It shouldn't be. But man, that would really suck if this whole VOD is going to get copyrighted now because of this. Because of the testing that we're doing. Wow. Wow, I just did that horribly wrong at a Lego break apart sound effect. We'll do sound effects after the music, but we do have to add some sort of breaking sound effect. I don't think I can use like a Lego break sound effect because I'm pretty sure those are copyrighted. But we'll definitely add some sort of like brick breaking or something. Wow, that was terrible. Where are you getting your music anyway? Uh, this, these are just asset packs that I paid for a while ago. None of these should be copyrighted, but I have to make sure every time, because sometimes some of them, even when they say they aren't, some copyright holder somewhere decides to snatch it, even if they're wrong about it. I just don't want to use music like that, because then it's a risk for anybody who plays the game and wants to upload it to YouTube. like uh, Lixian game. There was a piece of music I paid for, and yet some copyright holder on YouTube decided to copyright it, even though they're wrong, and that's illegal, and they need to be that needs to be taken down for that. Um, I'm not going to put other creators at risk of that. Even though that music is available, and, and that person, that copyright claim is wrong, I'm not going to put other creators at risk for that. It sucks, but it's an additional thing that I have to worry about now whenever I add music that's not my own to games. And even then, I have that risk because there are people who will find, like, segments of music that you make, and they're like, oh, that, that's copyright, I own that. And it's like, no, you don't. But they'll copyright it anyway. It sucks. It's just so hard to catch that YouTube <laughs> doesn't even bother for the most part when people falsely claim... Jesus Christ. Oh my god. I'm getting worse. I am getting worse at this. 
At least the music is fitting enough to not get annoying. But I have a feeling that won't la I have to pee. <laughs> Just in enjoy the music. I enjoy the music and, and look at my broken corpse. Alright, I'll be back. Alright, did the music get annoying and old while I was gone? Why did my viewership go up when I left? <laughs> Cheers. Alright. Now, with the power of having peed, I can beat this. Even though I literally made it I know how to beat it. I've done it multiple times. Let's boost the music. I literally... Why is this only happened when I want to test it? When I want to learn... I want to figure out if something is working or not. Then bugs happen. Or then I fail. Bugs don't happen. But I fail. Wow, that was terrible. How am I this bad at my own game? Why? Why does that suck so much? This is how I hope first ends up feeling. That's like the goal. Even though I don't know why I'm doing this to him. I just needed an excuse to make a rage game. I wonder, can you just skip this section? Can you just wait? You absolutely can. Oh my god. Ah, oh, and I died. I- ugh. Okay, now I know though. You can literally skip that section. I figured as much. I just hadn't tested it yet. That's a good skip, if you can land it. Okay, but I literally just want to test this. Please. See if I can do that again. Please let me do that. No! Okay. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. If you don't hit the... If, if you don't land it, though, you're screwed immediately. I don't know why this is suddenly difficult. Like I said, beating this several times, literally twice today, or maybe even three times today already. How is this suddenly a challenge? Oh my god. And I expanded this room because the checkpoint was too close. Same with pipes. But pipes is significantly easier than this section, which I messed up there and could have very easily avoided that.
See, this is where, so there's something, I, I, I've talked about this a few times. This section is 100% just I want to be the guy in 3D. Uh, if you guys haven't seen or heard that game, it's, it's kind of a hidden gem in my opinion. It's a rage game. But uh, I just recently watched MatPat play it because apparently he likes that game as much as I do, even though it's a rage game. And I think he likes it, I think he talked about this, he likes it because it's a challenge. It's extremely difficult and it's kind of a reminder of those like early retro platformers that were very unforgiving. Um, and so this is just the embodiment of that without the retro music and retro graphics and everything in 3D. And it did it again. It did it again. So sometimes... Yeah, it, okay, so the camera is messed up. Okay, we have a break now to fix this because the camera is messed up. I don't think it's clamped. I think that's the problem. It should be clamped, but it's not. Where's the rotation of the camera? <sighs> Spring arm control. Target arm length. No, because it's only doing that. How is that even remotely an issue? It's because of the lag, isn't it? How do I lock? I don't remember how to do that. I think it's just on, be on begin play. I can lock the player. Hold on, I'll figure this out in a second. Get player, no, oh my god, get player camera manager maybe? Then set max pitch is the only one. And then set min pitch too, right? Set min pitch. Yeah. Okay, so it'll be negative 90. It'll be like negative 80, not, no, it needs to be 90 though. So negative 90 and 90. I don't know why it's allowing it to go further than that. It shouldn't be. Oh, it also didn't spawn me correctly. Whoopsies. Forgot that step. There we go. Whoops. Still have the other music going. Yeah, now that's perma-locked. It's perma-locked right there. It cannot... Could not possibly go further than that. Okay, that should be fine. I don't know why that was an issue. It still may be an issue, so it's a weird one. It did it again. It just did it again. You guys saw that. I went backwards, and I was trying to go forward. What? What happens if I go negative 89? 89. You can't look directly down anymore, but, I mean, it's close enough. not close enough it's throwing me off just slightly I need to not clamp that it needs to clamp the that's so annoying oh my god why is that an issue there's no reason this should be able to flip me like that so it's got to be in here something in here setting the target arm length and that is it that is all I'm doing also, this needs to go back to 150. Is letting me clip through the wall too much. <sighs> okay, if I get world rotation, can I break this? No, break. No. Oh my god, break that! I'm losing my mind now because these are simple issues that shouldn't be issues in the first place. Set rotation, world rotation to its current rotation okay except rolls fine the yaws fine this is clamped map range clamped wait no not my remote clamp. just clamp it please just regular clamp clamp angle it's fine between negative 90 and 90 it should never exceed that for any reason. There's no reason why it should exceed that. Gotta head to a place where you can make money and cry a little. Alright, thanks for stopping by, Joe Kez. Appreciate you. I'll see you later. I 
I can't tell if that's fully top down or not. I think it is. It feels different now. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Who knows? Jesus Christ. Oh, God. can't just run around in a circle for that. You should be able to, but I normally can't. I don't know why. Yeah, you can. You just have to do it early. Okay, there we go. Literally just here to test if the music works in the next area. Like I did a few minutes ago. Okay. Wow, that was terrible. I'm getting worse. <laughs> I swear, I'm absolutely getting worse. This music really does and doesn't fit this area at the same time. It seems very, like, epic final boss, like most of these songs do. I literally just want to get to the next area. For testing sake. That's what today is going to be. It's going to be finishing the game and a lot of testing. Okay, there we go. Wow. <laughs> Just get good waffles, get a better PC, and then prove to me that you're good enough to even say that. Wow, that sucks. You know what? No, we're moving on. I don't- I'm not gonna keep doing this. We have to move on. We have other things to do. Alright. Assume I have a PC to begin with. A laptop counts as a PC, okay. Alright, we have... This is the lava room for now. I'm okay with the music for now. I'd rather it not be that. This is the laser room. Music. Let's just move to the laser room. Why don't we? Nope, that's the wrong one. There we go. Okay. Laser room. Nice. Very fitting for this. Look, emote. Nice! The Andres emote, let's go! Alright. This is good for the laser room. I like this music for the laser room. This is kind of perfect for this. It's very mysterious. Very... Escape the facility. We were talking about this earlier. I'm dead. <laughs> but it doesn't really follow up the previous area that well. So the previous area might need, might need to change. Then there's this, which I'm thinking for the next room, but that doesn't really fit the vibe of the next room, because <clears throat> this feels kind of like timer-esque, you know? I don't know. The only one that I'm set on right now is the laser room. All right, but now we have other music we can look at. Let's, let's go listen to the other music. So we have here... 8-bit action loops. I think this is what I was listening to. No. I don't think I'm using this one. So I could use this if I wanted to. This music also just in general kind of fits better. This feels very like end of I want to be the guy. I liked it at first, I don't like it as much now. Take you going to the store, and uh, uh, you'll stop, you'll be back later. Alright, see ya Rose, thanks for stopping by, I appreciate you. Bring back some milk. How long am I streaming for? Until the game's done. 
so probably all day. This one I'm using. Okay, so none from there, probably. Abstract music. This is very aggressive. It's very... I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. It's a lot. Okay, that's just looped. Okay, that definitely doesn't fit. Um... Maybe I'll put it in here for now. Come back to that. Action combat percussion. No, it's just percussion. Action game soundtrack. Are these looped? I don't know if you know. Oh, okay, so okay, they have looped versions. No. Okay, I'm using that one, so no. Using that one as well. Nope. No. No. Not really fitting. Using that one as well. None of those. Okay. Uh, action powerful energy. No. They, they're they're good pieces, but they don't fit the vibe at all so far That kind of does in, in terms of the intensity No, none of those though Battle music Yeah, there's no actual battles, though. Bonus combat music tracks. No. Casual arcade funny. I think I'm using some of these. Yep. Yeah, I'm using a couple of those, so not gonna work. Uh, Casual, cinematic, inspirational, Cosmo music. There we go, we're getting closer. Not as much as I thought. This is the one I'm using for the lava section in Bean Game. It's just slowed down a bit. Which I don't want to use again here. Maybe, but probably not. What's this one? Maybe, but probably not again. I guess I'll keep it here in, just in case. No, I don't like that one. Give you PTSD. <laughs> Maybe to that one. I don't know. Okay, there's a, there's gonna be other sci-fi stuff as well. It's this action cinematic music. Okay, those aren't looped. This one's the looped one. Ooh. How insane would it be to try to make a boss battle in the end in the next 12 hours? How insane of me would that be? Because this sounds great. 
won't do this. It's I'll, I'll keep it in the in the back of my brain, maybe. I don't think I'm going to because I don't have a boss that I could set up. All right, whatever. Um, electronic abstract. Please don't. I want to die of a heart attack before first blaze it. These aren't looped, are they? These are looped. Maybe? Kind of nice, but not really. Okay, I gotta visualize this music with, like, the areas that we're in. No. 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 That sounds like the beginning to a, a, a rap beat right there. Never mind. Not anymore. Like someone was going to freestyle over that previous one. What's that? It's like lo fi. Not the vibe I'm going for. Interesting. Interesting start. Not great. Maybe pipes. Maybe for pipes. So I'll keep it. Electronic industrial music. What does that even mean? Jesus Christ. What is this music? The only one would be maybe this one. This sounds like a geometry dash level right here. Weirdly fitting though. Is it gonna go anywhere? It's a little too epic, but I'll keep it anyway, and I'm gonna try it with this first area, and we'll see what happens. And I'll definitely try the other song that I said kind of sounds like maybe for pipes in the pipes section. So let's see. If I do this one here, and then, which one did I say was good for pipes? Not that one. Oh, Jesus. Can I please just grab this? No. This. Grab it. Grab it. Thank you. Jesus Christ. No. Nope. 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 Nope, I've forgotten which one. Was it this one? Maybe it was that one? I don't remember now. I've completely forgotten. I think it had to have been that one. That one's kind of weird. Alright, let's see at the beginning section what this sounds like. Let's spawn one. Here we go. Music? Hello? There we go. Welcome in, Vano Moon. Welcome back.
does this fit this area? Because, I don't know. Feels a bit too high stakes. A bit too intense for the starting zone. I don't know how I feel about this. It's been a while since the moon's been in here. Yeah, this feels too, like, heavily action-y. Lunar keeps getting, uh, give, giving Andreas chips. It's beautiful. Man, I just want to test the. See, this keeps happening. I just want to test the music in these sections, and now I suck at my own game all of a sudden. I definitely don't like this music as the first area, though. It's too repetitive, and does not fit the vibe really. Okay, well that doesn't matter then, because I'm not ready to test that yet. Okay, uh, what's next? Hard rock, that's gonna work for this. Maybe, that's the most fitting thing so far. It's like grave violence, of course. This might be great for the ending section, actually. Pretty good. Less good. Not as good. Not as good. No idea where this is trying to go. Weirdly enough, all like really aggressive hard rock fits for this game and also doesn't fit at the same time. Am I using this one? I might be using that one. It's too fast paced. Remasters. Interesting. Okay. Um, then Epic Battle Trailers. That's not going to work. Um, Epic rock track, heart of what? Just one track, okay. I like the epic rock style, but it does not at all fit. Epic track, last stand. No. Funny cartoon music, here we go. Oh, that's fitting. It's very fitting. That's what we need. Okay. Heavy riffs. Oh boy. Now that's aggressive for this game. Too much. Way too much. There's more, though. Okay, not quite. <laughs> yep, E. That would have been very fitting during that uh, music there. All right, we're Eing now. Uh, I'll skip the heavy riffs. Logos pack, no. Lyric, voices. Oh boy, powerful, brutal rock music. Oh, that's gonna fit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 
They're too fast paced. Doesn't work. Doesn't fit. There's so much rock. Real rock? Okay. What is what, what the other stuff's fake rock? Alright, sure. Welcome back, Kate. It's not rock. <laughs> Among Us! Among Us reference! Heroes Among Us! Among Us! Well, these are terrible. How is that real rock? That's not real rock. None of these really work. Oh, great. I'm running out of options here. Space Adventure. There we go. This is what I was looking for. Maybe not. That's really disappointing. There was not that much here. Just compose my own music. Uh, Waffles, I want you to realize that I have, let's just say 12 hours, max, to do what I have left. I'm not going to make my own music for this demo version of this game that I'm making in one week. For the full release, I will absolutely make my own music, because I love to do that. Not right now. <laughs> Space Journey Pack. Oh, it's a different thing. Okay. Get Suiko too. You do realize that I would be asking somebody else who is not at all involved in the project to suddenly grasp a full understanding of the project and compose five separate pieces that are loopable and long lasting to make music for me for free in this game. No, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> Sorry, but it's not gonna happen. Can this not loop? Because it's a, it doesn't say looped, but this one sounds good. This one could be one, potentially. Maybe not. It's hard to tell like, if it would fit or not. We, yeah, we have music for one room, maybe two rooms, but I still need to find the rest. I can hum some tunes for you. Yes, of course. It's too aggressive. Space threat action cinematic music. Pff, Jesus Christ. That's a slow version. It's all the same. Okay, there's an energetic version. This one looped. Yeah. Dramatic version. Nope, none of those really work. Alright, great. So now we're just gonna have to kind of go with what we have and hope it works enough. This will be Space Discoveries looped? Which one was it? This one. This one. Let's try it with this. Also, I gotta put myself here. There we go. Okay. I don't know if this fits. This really doesn't fit. Music in the first section is going to be the hardest to find, for sure. This really doesn't fit. Not the first section, at least. 
Maybe I just have some, like, ambience in the first section, and I add music later. That could work. And that's kind of what I was thinking with, like, the layering idea. Potentially. That jump sucks. <laughs> Lunar, why are you spending all of your points on chips for Andres? Have, you've been saving up. You haven't spent, like, any points. And then in the past, like, week, all you've done is spend points on chips for Andres. That's amazing. I like how Andres takes it as, as a bad thing. We're literally telling you to eat food. At some point, we'll change it to chips for chat. And then chat has to go get chips. All of chat. Everybody in chat. <laughs> go broke with your chat. Okay, well, here's the thing, Andres. It's one chip. It's not like every redeem is a bag of chips. Oh, Jesus. Also, we require video evidence every single time you eat a chip. You have to post it in the Discord. Also, the music didn't loop. I just realized that. Okay, I would really like to not make that, have that happen. Can I make all of these loop, please? Uh, where is it? Asset actions, bulk edit via proxy matrix. Sound, looping. Cool. This music just doesn't work, though. So that needs to change anyway. Okay. What song? Maybe this one? Let's try this one and see. Maybe I'll try the ambience though in a second if it doesn't work. Hmm. It's too weirdly sharp. I'd really like to get out of this area to test the music. Why does this happen every single time? Man, this is terrible. Wow. What's wrong with me? I've gotten significantly worse at my own game. I'm going too early on that. I'm so stupid. I've worn myself out on the platforming here. I've done it so many times that now I can't do it anymore. Yeah, that this music does not fit at all. I need to change that. That's not gonna work. No. 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 I don't think I have any ambience, though. I think I yawned through my entire recording, and now no more yawns. How does that even happen? That's me when I stream with my nose. My nose gives me problems the entire stream. Like, you'll see me do this all the time, because it's just itchy, and it's causing problems. And then at the end of stream, no problems anymore. It's all gone. Perfectly fine. Okay, in here, do I have any ambience? Abstract game music, maybe in this. No. Different music. I didn't. I didn't check this one. Nope. Nope. No. Nope. Nope. Okay, none of those work. Action combat percussion loops. I feel like the first area could be percussion only. Or like only a drone sound or something. Do I 
have this one in here? Oh, it's this one. Never mind. That's the one I was currently using. Yeah, this is literally Bean Game Lava soundtrack. Right there. It's just faster, so I slowed it down. What the? Hi, dog. Oh, thank you. Air came on. So weird. I did not think we would be looking for music and trying to make music work for four hours. have any drones okay let's see if I have no that's fantasy music and then <sighs> I don't have just random ambience do I have this I guess we can maybe work with this let's see um, I have no idea at this point we need to move on very quickly here because I have to make that last section before we move anything, let's see and see if there's anything good in here. I used this for something. What did I use this for? Maybe I haven't used it yet. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't fit here. It's good for a horror game, not for this. Not fitting at all. Maybe for the menu. Yeah, that's weirdly fitting for like the menu music. Never mind. Well, kind of. I'm think for now I'm thinking that's good for like menu music. But that's it. That's all that I can get from that. Hello? What did I just do? Oh, Jesus. The menu music. I don't know. Sure. But now this can be deleted because no. I'm getting very hungry. I did not expect to get hungry this quickly. I ate before stream. I didn't eat much, but I ate. Uh, it's the struggle of trying to find music. Okay, what's in here? Are there, is there music in here? There is music in here. No, those are just stingers. Not great music. Not, nope, okay. I, I realize that now. There's no way I don't find something in here. Right? There's no way. Because I don't have time to go searching elsewhere. Using that already. Using that. Doesn't fit. Sounds like a dance party. Maybe for later. Probably not though. Using that. No. Why is it so hard to find this? Why is it so hard to find music that fits? Okay, let's skip the first room. 
let's skip the first room and let's let's start at the second room and just so we can hopefully make some sort of progress spawn two okay this is pipes kind of fitting so far All of a sudden, I'm significantly worse at my own game. I don't get it. I'm playing the way I think first is gonna play. Which is bad. Fitting, but not, you know? That's bad. Kind of fitting, but kind of not, you know? Because you need to take a tiny break. That is so. Yes, that's that's usually how it works for me. Is I, usually I sleep it off, right? If I get really bad, the next day I'm really good all of a sudden. But for me right now, I just need to lock in. I'm. It's because I'm stressing. It's less because I need a break right now, and because I'm stressing to, because we need to get this thing done. So I'm like trying to go faster than I should, and that's messing me up. I'm also hungry now, which is not helping. But this is also good because this is helping us with the testing of the music, because if he's going to be stuck here for a while, which I imagine he is, this is what he would be listening to. I don't like this that much. I'm not enjoying this as much as I thought I would. It's like half good for this area. Oh, don't fall. There we go. Okay. Then he leaves the area. Now new music. Now he's here. I think this music is just kind of best for this area. Because it is kind of like ominous, threatening, orchestral, weirdly. I think that works. Pipes didn't work though. It did, but it didn't. No. That's not the one we're using for pipes right now, is it? That might be better for pipes. Oh, it is. It, it's literally the same. I'm stupid. <laughs> Maybe I won't really care for it that much though. It just mostly sounds weird. No. Uh God, I don't want to end up spending money on more music though too. I'm gonna, ch I'm gonna take a look at something real quick. 
because there was something I meant to get a, a while ago, or I was going to get, and then I changed my mind on it. And it's layering music. Let's see. There's dynamic music layering. Interesting. Adaptive music. Yeah, see, these are the interesting things. They're not ridiculously expensive, but they're not cheap. Hey guys, nope, Jack that's and that. Today I'm gonna show you how just, just give, let me hear it. You have these overlap volumes like this, and a little thing over here. And when I click play, there's no music playing yet, but as I enter these volumes, more and more layers of music. Yeah, I get, I get it. That's one, and then as I go through the next one, we've got the drums. Okay, but is the music any good? Is the concern? Now the melody. Not really. And then finally. Okay, that's just an asset to do that. Now I want like these. Let's see. I need to make sure. Let's let's see. Does this have anything about YouTube policy? Nope. Okay, that means I'm going to assume that I can use this on YouTube. It's good music, but does it fit? Probably not. Cyberware, Volume 2, what is this? This is a teaser, this is a 30 second video teaser. This is dumb, no. There's Chiptune, 16 bit adventures, what? That's fitting. No. No. Ooh, hold on a second. I just remembered something I might have. Okay, we're going to check this out, and then we're going to see... Hold on. We're going to see if I'm a gen I may have been a genius before stream like a couple weeks ago and I forgot about it. Hold on. Hold on. Please, please say this is actually correct. No. 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 It's down here further than I guess. I don't know how long ago this was. Wrong music. <laughs> okay. Nope. Nope. Here. I didn't realize I had more. This could be great for the intro room. That's just the first track. Not as fitting. <laughs> also not as fitting. Also not fitting.
Okay. These are all about two minute-ish loops. I think there's only one I can take from this, but still, better than nothing. What just happened? I don't know what just happened. Why is it so quiet? Why is it so quiet? What? No. No. Why was that so quiet? Hello? It's just really quiet. I don't know why that's so quiet, but okay, there. Fine, whatever. So let's let, let's try that in this room. And also, I have to test this. Oh, you guys can't see what I'm doing. Okay, let's test this in here, and let's see what happens. Okay, so this is that room, but then there's this room. Kind of fitting. Put me back there. Okay, let's start at the beginning, please. Also, worst case, we just use one piece of music. I don't know. This is kind of fitting. But really not that much. I don't know, we're running out of time. I might just want to say screw it and use that one like laser room music throughout the whole game. <sighs> this is okay. It's not bad. Yeah, because the transitions don't really work between sections. I don't think I don't think this is gonna work out, guys. I think we're just gonna do one piece of music. I think we're gonna do one piece of music. We're gonna move all these triggers off to the side. Like that. And we are just going to play one piece. Not one piece. We're gonna play one piece of music on loop throughout the whole thing. Because this is just the most fitting piece of music for the entire thing. It just is. It's most fitting in the laser room, but it fits best everywhere. Because it is really just like that escape the facility type sound. It's been five hours of music. Waffles, if you think that's bad, you don't want to know how much time I spend on music normally. It's just the most fitting. It just is. I'm sure it's gonna get really annoying played on loop forever, but I mean, first can also just bring in his own music if he wants to. But I need to stop caring. We need to move on. <laughs> we have to move on. I think that's gonna be it. It's just gonna be that song. Whole time. Menu and everything. That's it. <sighs> Alright. Jesus Christ. Uh, 
Okay. All right, fine. We're moving on. We need sound effects now. I said I was going to do music and then sound effects, and it's been four hours. We have done music, and we ended up landing on one piece of music, and that's it. All right. Can we just, uh... Let's just, uh, let's, let's do this. Different, different song. Okay. Brick exploded sound effects. I will, I will look for that. In fact, that should probably be one of the first sound effects we get. Um, brick, ex well, brick breaking sound effect. Okay, hold on. Let's find some interesting sounds. Because I could do the Lego breaking, and I might do the Lego breaking. No. Uh, what are these? Dropping rocks. That's a lot. Really? Okay. Jesus. Let's do Lego explosion. Nope. Nope, th th these don't have anything to do with Legos. Let's find out if the Lego breaking is copyrighted, which I highly doubt it is. That's not a good enough sound. That's a funny sound effect. It does 2 million views, Jesus Christ. It's, it, it's, it's great and all. It's not, it's not thumpy enough. We could edit it to make it thumpy. But... Nope. Let's go brick break. Brick break. Those are the same sound effects. They're not the same. Never mind. That's a lot. Bricks falling. I don't know. Just make it the wee bowling sound. Uh, plastic. Plastic crumble. Hey, chip sounds. Rock crumble. I think what we'll do is go back to the Lego brick, this one, and just base it. Just beyond base. We might be able to work with that. I don't know. We'll see. Alright, let's drop this into Audacity and go from there. But it says Lego SFX are copyrighted. Well, they can't be because they're sound effects. It's really hard to copyright a sound effect because how are they going to prove that I didn't use my own Legos? Maybe that's my own sound effect that I already recorded. So probably the meme sound, but not something like this that's edited too. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's... Bring this down to no, let's just do this and then let's affect change pitch 25% and then bass and treble 
Five base, negative 20 treble. Pretty good. More, though. Not that much. Um, let's change pitch again, actually. Again. Negative uh, 50. Too much. Still too much treble. Uh, base of leave the base as is. Negative ten treble. Kinda. I don't know. What do we think? This should be at zero, but that sounds okay. Let's bring up the base more up the treble a little bit it sounds too low okay back up 50 mm -mm. so we could do this and then just more bass and treble Sounds too slow. Oh, okay. I can read. Learn to read. Waffles, I should ban you. Uh, I'll try it. Fifteen. Good, but less trouble now. No base change. Less base, more trouble. God, that's hard to do. Negative five, five. Less base again. It needs to just be all trouble. I'm realizing now. Negative 15, five trouble. Now it needs to be louder again. And then remove noise. Noise reduction. Get noise profile. Noise reduction. Let's try it. No. Eh, that's rough. I don't know. Let's apply a bit more bass. And then we'll go from there. Five, zero treble. More bass. Ten. That's better. Now... Is it better? I don't know. It's hard. It's really hard to tell. Welcome back, Chernobyl. Congratulations. You've returned. They've apologized. I will have the ban hammer in my pocket, though. No, I would say have it out and ready. Um, what was the other thing I was going to... Click removal, that's the one. That's better. Uh, we could probably do it again, too. Mm, no. That last one is kind of fuzzy now, but that's fine. Uh, the other thing is to speed it up. Speed of 1.5. Except now the pitch is off. Okay. Can I can I do that? I literally change speed and pitch to 1.5 with no change to pitch. Okay, so no, just change speed. Where's the change speed? It's pitch on its own, and then there's... Did they change this? Oh, it's different now. Okay, well, whatever. I can do that and then apply pitch change to negative 50. Apply. Mm -mm. I think it's fine. We could even cut this last one out and just do this. Okay, it would need to, it would stop there. 
we can fade out like this. Yeah. Okay, maybe we just end it here and we fade out the last little glitchy ones. Nope. Let's come back a little bit at least. That's good. I'm good with that. Cool. Okay, not that bad. And then this needs to go into... Hello? Grab, please? Thank you. Wherever it is. Bean challenge. Source. This is gonna be... Break. SFX. Okay, cool. Sweet. Now, in... not here. In here... Uh, SFX. And let's add that one. Cool. Now, uh, let's go back to there. Wherever that is. Hello. There it is. Source and import break SFX. Cool. Okay. How quiet is that? Is it fine? It's really quiet. Three. Why is that so quiet? Oh, it's I made it looping. Whoops. I meant to loop. Not meant to loop. Stop looping. <laughs> oh, I just no. Okay, I didn't. I didn't close the project. Okay, we're gonna normalize it. File this normalization to zero. Apply. Ooh, okay. No. Uh, normalize. Just normal, normal, normalize. There we go. Jesus Christ. Okay, that's more what I'm talking about. God, ow. All right, export that correctly. There we go. Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, here. Export it. Yes. Re-import this. Let's get ready to turn that down to just one. Okay. Why is it still so quiet? I guess it's not actually that quiet. It's just I have my volume turned down. Okay. Now, whenever we die, we're going to play that sound effect. Play sound at location. Location is the player's location. So here... Actually, just get actor location. Get actor location. And then we're going to play that sound effect right there. All right, so now this is what will happen. Here we go. Music is playing. It's a little delayed. It's really delayed. And it's not. It's not that delayed. It does go on for too long, I think, though. Go back to this. It does have a slight delay at the beginning, which we can get rid of. Uh, and I think it just needs to fade out like here. That's fine. I'm fine with that. Yes. And then back in. Re-import. Save. That's better. It's not delayed anymore. It is still... It's, it feels kind of delayed. It feels kind... Why was that... Wait, why did that glitch out my audio there? That wasn't good. You just play while the animation runs. That's what's happening, Waffles. <laughs> that is what's happening. Any delay is in the audio itself. It plays after. It does not play after. It doesn't. Here's the thing. Waffles. Waffles. There's... Let's, let's take a look at this. Look. Look. This is all happening at the same time. This is being run at the same time. 
There's no delay. <laughs> These are happening at the same time. That's it. It does it does look like it plays after, but it's not because of that. It's it's because of the sound itself. If it starts there, it'll probably sound better. But it's not because it's not playing with the animation. It is playing at the exact same time as the animation. This just isn't the sound effect makes it sound like it's not. So if I reimport this, also, there's another thing in here that I need to do that'll help. That is, what is it? There's a thing called, there's a thing in here somewhere. I don't remember what it's called, but there's one that's like preemptively, like prepare it. No. Because the first time it plays, it will be delayed no matter what, unless I enable this thing that I don't remember what it's called. No. Bring the music back, I guess. While I look for this. Loading. Prime on load. There we go. Not the drink. Okay. That was still delayed. Now it's not. Now that the second the second time isn't delayed. That's better. It's really quiet. Why is it so quiet? Hello? That's better. Now if I go full volume... It kind of breaks your ears. Oh, the music is extra loud. That's part of it. So we can turn this down to two, probably. And then the music that we're using... Laser room is, it's like peaking slightly. So if I make that like 0.9, does that fix it? Why is it peaking? There we go. That works. Cool. I am good with that. Okay, uh, actually, I do want to make it a cue, though, because then I can change pitch and stuff. Uh, so in here, we make a cue, create cue, and then in here, we're going to have a modulator, I believe? Yes, with a minimum pitch of 0.8 and 1.2 is the max, and then volume will be 1 and 1 no matter what. Oh, I'm not playing that one. Whoops. Well, actually, let's hear it. Better. So that way there's a little bit of variation each time. Okay. Cool. Now I need jumping sound effects and, and maybe moving sound effects as well. I don't know. It does go on a little longer, still. Uh, that's rough. Let's see. It could stop there, honestly. So we could cut this last bit and just have it fade, like, there. All of this is, like, a secondary. Maybe I'll have both. So this will be break SFX 2. And then we'll import that one as well. Break us of X2. Yes. And then in here, I'll bring in break us of X2. And we'll have it randomly pick between which one we want to use. Random.
That's better. More variety. Sometimes it breaks quickly, sometimes it adds more to it. That's great. Okay, a spring sound effect for jump. We might do that. We might do like the pop sound effect again that I used for bean game. But let's take a look at what we have. We have retro sound effects too that we could use maybe jumping. Let's see. Mm, that'll get annoying. That's good. Let's just try these. Let's let, let's try these and see what happens. When we jump, we're also going to play sound at location. This is the one that I'll do for now. It's just going to be get actor location. Let's see. That's actually pretty good. It's a little loud. Okay, well, it doesn't no matter what, <laughs> which is a problem, so I'll have to fix that. Also, I just realized that this is showing, so it's delaying a little bit. That doesn't sound that bad. Interesting that you can just spam it like that. All right. Some of these are bad. Some of those are just terrible impacts. Let's see. I could also play that kind of sound when you die as well. That'll be interesting. So let's see. Because we also could play that when we die. Let's try that and see what that sounds like. It'll be a combo of both. Hello? There we go. Eh. No, it doesn't need both. Stop this madness. I think you guys are a little behind. I don't know why you're all so behind. Refresh, gamers. Teleport. Ew. Menu beeps? No, no, bad, bad. Most of these suck. Okay, power power ups. Jesus Christ. God. What even are these? Okay, let's go back. Let's go to a different one. Let's go to these. No, not that. Wait, are there sounds in this? Okay. That could be part of the the breaking sound right there. I didn't realize that we had one of those to work with already. Let's try that. Combine the two. Does that do anything? I don't think that's doing anything. I could leave it, but let's see what happens without. Does it feel like it's missing something now? No. It did sound... Well, that's weird, because it did kind of sound better with it. I guess I'll bring that one over. Why not? Cool. That one's there now. Uh, okay, then there's... There's the current jump, which I am okay with. But I'm not super for it. Okay, this is where I got like the bean jump sound effects before. That's where like these sound effects came from. Jesus. These all have like echoes on them. Jesus. Which is not great. Why? There we go. Those are the same pop sound effects that I used for Bean Game and for uh, Thankmas Game. Which I would not be against using again in this.
It doesn't really fit the aesthetic, though. Why are you guys freaking out about this? Actually, no, sorry. It's only Chernobyl freaking out about this. Chernobyl, why? <laughs> Yeah, well, okay. Let's try it. Let's try it with this one. See what it seems like. Let's try it. It just kind of fits with the bean. We would have to make variety of them. It's way too loud in this case. You have sensory issues, you can't handle the sounds that annoy you. Okay, maybe you might not want to watch this part of stream. You might not want to watch this part of stream. Because this is all about sound effects right now that are going to annoy you, guaranteed. Let's go back the other way and see the difference. Yeah, that's better. It's softer. It needs some variety, but it's better. We can make the variety pretty easily. Let's go to it. Copy it. Paste it. Uh, and that's fine. Also, it needs to be exported and edited slightly. Unless... I might be able to do something else. Let's, uh, let's make a queue. Create a queue out of this. And do the exact same thing. There we go. Okay. And... Then when I go to play it in here, we can add a start time adjustment of like 0.1. That might be too much. Whoa. It just went up like crazy. Okay, that's too much. So 0 0.9, 1.1. 1 .1. There we go. Uh, I also realize now that in here, it sets it to 0.75. No, it doesn't. Never mind. I'm a liar. Okay, I don't know what I'm talking about. This does. There we go. I did know what I was talking about. Never mind. Yeah, it's starting it too late, but it can start it earlier. Start time... 0 0.05. I don't know. Nope. Still a huge delay. 0 0.1 would work. Nope. Point one's too late. Okay, never mind then. We're gonna just export it and do it that way. God, there's so many things open right now. Just close everything that I'm not currently working on. There we go. Set this to zero. And let's export that audio and re-import it. Alright. Export to my desktop real quick. And let's open that in Audacity. Okay. Jesus. So if I started it like here. Nope. It needs to start like here. There we go. And this can fade in. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Maybe. Yes. Eh. Maybe. Let's try it. Yep. This will be jump. Okay. And here, drag that in, jump, there we go, yes, and then in here, we'll drag in jump, cool, like that, let's see, did that do it? I think it did, why is it so quiet? Okay, it's not that quiet, never mind. It's actually a little loud and kind of annoying, so maybe it'll be a little quieter. Okay. 
good so far. Doing pretty well in terms of sounds. I like that. Okay, I need to fix the jumping though. So when we're, how do I check that? Because there's the jump settings for a player is weird. So I guess just is in air. Is that it? In air. Is there a node for that? No, that's vehicle movement. Falling is falling. He is falling. Okay, that's it. So as long as we're not falling, then we can play this sound. There we go. This is all the monotonous, boring stuff, guys. Yeah, there we go. Okay. That works. I fixed it. What do we think, sounds-wise? Because I think it's- I think it's- it's fine. I don't think we need any other sounds. Oh, we need checkpoint sounds for sure. Let's see, what's a good like you hit the checkpoint sound? Also, maybe like a spawn sound for when you respawn. That's terrible. What are these? No, God, no. I don't know who thought these sounds were good ideas, but no. Power up. Nope. Nope. We're going back to the other one. Interface sounds. Not enough. Nope. Oh, no. 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 Why do these suck so much? These are- some of these are terrible. That could be a checkpoint sound, maybe? Yeah. No. I don't know. That's the that's probably the hardest one so far. Are there sounds in this? No. I thought this part would have been way easier. No. no. After this, I'm going to go get something to eat, and then we will continue from there. Mm -mm. No. It needs to be like a buzz. Some sort of buzzer sound that I don't have. Maybe that one? I don't know. Let's see. When I hit it, let's play sound at location, which is get actor location. It'll be this one. Let's try it. Not bad. Eh. Eh. Not really. What are some of these sounds? That's just an alarm. Those are just all bad sounds. Could be something simple like that. Let's try that. I don't think that'll work, but I can try it. I 
I guess. That actually kind of works better than I thought it would. Let's see. I don't think I'm going to have a respawn sound. Because the that is kind of that. Oh, and it plays it anyway when you reach it. Hmm. We still have to do UI, and we have an entire other room to build, so I have to kind of be done here. I'm good with that. That's fine. It should be a little louder, though. Let's see. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, well, so here's the thing, Andres. I can imagine them working in certain scenarios, but for the most part, they're just so loud and aggressive that it's like, this does not work. No. <laughs> I don't like that it plays the sound every time you step on it, but it also do because then it makes you think, okay, that's what that means. But I feel like it should only happen if that's not the current checkpoint. So I think when you step on it, it's going to check. Get current. Nope, not current. Uh, get, get spawn point. And then if this is equal to self, then don't play the sound. And we'll, we'll just have it play automatically on respawn as well. So this right here is the one I want it to play. Okay, and then if it's not the same, then it'll do this. If it is the same, then we'll do this on respawn. Or on spawn, whatever it is. Spawn here. We're gonna play it like here. There we go. There. Okay, so now. It's not doing it. Cool. It did play it twice there. Is it playing it twice? Or is it just really loud? It is playing it twice, isn't it? And then when I enable this... It's not playing it twice, it's just loud. That's better. Okay, I doubled the volume, but I didn't need to. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Use this Lunar. A game refuses to open on your laptop. I have no idea why. I have no idea what it is about this game that is causing problems on your guys' laptops. This sh game is tiny and should run on anything. There's got to be something in here that's like... DirectX 11. DirectX Mobile Emulation? I don't know what that is. It's using... SM5, which is the lowest I can go. I literally can't go lower than this. Does it run on integrated? It should. It should be fine. I'm going to pull... You know, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a test on my laptop. Let, let me... Okay, we, we've done sound effects. If there's anything else that you guys think of, let me know. Um, but I'm going to let you... I'm going to leave you guys with the music for a minute. I'm going to go get something to eat real quick. Uh, and then I will come back, I will bring my laptop, and we will test it on my old garbage laptop from, like, ten years ago. Alright? I'll be back. I need to eat. Uh, give me, give me a moment. Enjoy the music.
I have eaten. Now let's take a look and see, first of all, will my laptop turn on? <laughs> hey, look at that. Nice. So, for context, oh hey, you can see everything. There we go. That'll be easier for you. Let's see how long this takes to load. I'm just curious. That was pretty quick. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> so, this is a very old laptop. This is my first game development PC. Compared to today's standards, this has some of the worst specs possible. Uh, it does not have integrated graphics. It does have its own graphics card. But it is not a good one. It was a very old, outdated one. It is, as you can see, it is still loading. Still trying to let me in. <clears throat> Yours probably does still have worse specs, Waffles. But for context, this is a garbage PC now. So, I tried to run, for context, I tried to run Bean Game on this. It wouldn't open. It wouldn't open. Uh, so, that just goes to show... Because I was going to use that, I was like, So, you should try Bean Game anyway, because it might... It, it, it'll probably run on low-end software. And then I tried it, and it turns out, nope, no it won't. So this one should. This one should run just fine on this. Let's so there you go. There's your proof. The fact that it still hasn't even loaded yet. That this is a garbage old laptop. Okay? Thank this game wouldn't load either. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense, because that one was also uh, pretty high fidelity. It wouldn't play it wouldn't play on this one either, for sure. Um None of my games currently Bark runs on the or used to at least. Bark was able to run on this at like 20 FPS max. If you turned everything down, you might get up to like 40 FPS, but it was still, at least it ran. But this game should run on anything, basically. And if it can't, then it's a fault of the engine, not of me. Do I have Discord on here? It doesn't matter, I can just get it from my actual Google Drive, what am I doing? It's It loaded in, it let me in, and now nothing's loaded, so I still can't do anything yet. So that's something. Where do you find specs? Uh, I think it's just about this PC, right? About... About your PC will give you everything except the graphics card specs. So... Yeah. Yeah, about your PC. And then for graphics card specs, you have to right-click on your desktop and go to, like, video settings or something like that. Whenever, any day now, I'd like to be able to test this, because I have to get it to download, and then I have to go from there. Alright, let's set this off to the side, let it continue to load, and I will get back to that. Oh, Jesus, there's no good spot for this right here. Okay, it's just gonna... Nope, that's not gonna work. Oh my god, this is... this is bad. Okay, that's fine. Uh, if you guys could see that, uh, you would be cringing. Hardcore right now. Alright. Anyways, now... Let's see, okay, so... We've got music and sound effects. Let me get a refresher here of what we have. Okay. Nice. Why does your laptop insist my game is a virus? Because it hasn't been downloaded enough. That's one of the worst things about any Windows software. Is that if the game isn't downloaded often enough, like, if it, has, if it doesn't have, like, 100,000 downloads, every antivirus is like, We don't trust it! Must be bad! Must be dangerous! So, until it's been downloaded, like, 100 times, it's gonna be, like, a huge concern to every antivirus software. And I hate that, because that goes for every single game. The only exception is Steam games, for some reason. Like, if it's up the- or, like, Epic Games games, for whatever reason, no matter how small the game is, or how few times it's been downloaded, Steam, like, overwrites your- uh, your antivirus or something. I don't know. It's weird. Cool. The click sound effect happened there. Click sound effect happens when I respawn, too. So, yeah, that'll happen with, like, any Itch.io game. If you download a game from Game Jolt or Itch.io, more than likely, if it's- at least if it's a new game, you will for sure have to fight your antivirus to install it. Okay. Progress. 
Oh, this opened. Do I have Discord on here? I do have Discord on here. Nice. Will it let me in, please? I don't know. Trying to get a Twitch streamer named Swole to play Bark. Swole. Never heard of them. You should get them to play uh, Bean Game. Streams a lot of horror games. Makes sense. Makes sense. Makes sense why you would choose Bark. A lot of streamers have played... Uh, a lot of horror streamers played Bark. The problem is a lot of them ran into a lot of issues, especially since a lot of them played it early on. So there have been a lot of streamers who like tore the game apart because of that. So it always scares me when people, when, when streamers play Bark, because I know that was my first horror game. It's my first game in general that I've fully released. So it's always scary because it's like, please treat my baby boys nicely. <laughs> Can I open Discord, please? My laptop hates me so much. I did not mean to restart entirely. Okay, but this, this this is good. Okay, I'm good with the music and sound effects, even though I wish I had more variety in music, but it's just it's just better without for right now. So player, let's go to here and let's carry on. Oh, this put me here. That's not where I want to be. Put me at the end so we can carry on and build the next section because it's time for that now. Finally, we've spent so much time doing everything else, we can finally start working on this next section. Okay, cool. My laptop is still not loading Discord. Someone keep track. So we, I, we this started like five minutes ago. Okay, so... So I'm gonna start a timer and keep track of how long it's gonna take for my laptop to be able to install this game in the first place. Just for context, so you guys don't think that my laptop is actually a good laptop, because it's not. Uh, I'm realizing now that this is moving way too quickly. This is homing. Excuse me. This is homing in way too quickly. Homing with a cert homing speed of like ten. Maybe more than that. Yeah, more than that. Definitely more than that. 25. Okay. Yeah, that's better. Because then it's more threatening than actually dangerous. Oh, it's loading. It's about to load Discord, finally, almost. Okay, so the next save point... I don't know how I feel about this area. Let's let's set our spawn back to that previous checkpoint and let's test it that way. Okay. So every time right now this is the latest spawn. This music definitely fits this area best. But I think everybody will be kind of sick of it by the time we get here. That being said, the smooth jazz of Bean Game looped uh, for like 20 minutes for most people. And that wasn't that bad. 20, 30 minutes. But that, w that song also is just a good song and that platformer isn't a rage game, so... Okay, that's not so bad. That's not that bad. You just have to pay attention and not get sniped before you jump in. What are you doing, dog? Oh, dog. Okay. Uh, so then the next save could be right here. This section is weirdly, like, easy. I feel like I can't have a checkpoint yet. Because that was not that hard to do. I kind of blindly jumped into that. Being game was just a calm walk around the coffee shop so the music fit. And so here, this, like, mysterious escape the facility type thing fits as well. 
you know? And hopefully that means it won't get annoying, because it does, it just fits the whole time. Andreas, I think every time you speak, Lunar's just gonna redeem a chip for you. So I think maybe it's just because I am so used to this section that this isn't that bad. Maybe I add a new checkpoint after this. I don't know. It's, it, it's hard for me to determine that. Also, I can make this section harder again. <gasps> I forgot. I could do this now. Wait, no. That was the wrong way. That was the wrong way. Uh, here? Yeah. Maybe. Because there's a save right there, so I don't feel as bad about it. Okay, well, it's not... That made it significantly harder. But that's better. Yep. <laughs> Why are you the way that you are? I just want to give first a challenge is all. That's it. And potentially you. Probably. That is significantly harder. <laughs> Whoops. Will the jump... Jump sound works while I'm dead. I need to fix that. Okay, so that's still... That's still possible. We're good. Okay, let's fix the jump sound not working. So I will add a checkpoint after this, though. So, okay, I need to also check... So it's, are we falling or, um, move mode, get movement mode equal to none. This is falling or movement equal to none. If either of those are true, then, okay. Perfect. Yeah, that makes this section a lot harder because then you'll just end up respawning here a lot. Unless you find a good method to it, like uh, like this. Oh my god, Discord's finally opening on my laptop. How many minutes has it been? Who knows anymore? Oh. That's a good method right there. Cross it. Nice. These are surprisingly easy. And I landed on the spike. Yikes. That's not that bad though. So I think after that there will be a check one. Oh my god it opened. It's a miracle. Discord opened and it's not responding. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay. This one. We're going to copy and we're going to paste it over here. Nice. It's gonna go right here. Maybe. I like that, but I don't like that. I don't know. We're gonna have to figure- I don't know what this room is gonna be yet. It might be double the length. Alright, Discord is still loading. Cool. Player at checkpoint 6. Then we'll spawn here. The final room. Okay, can I go to announcements now, please? Download the point seven version. Visit the site. Okay, now it's got to load my browser. Oh boy. All right. Check void. Windows eight. That's fine. Windows eight doesn't really matter that much. The RAM being four is a little worrying. Um, that's. Not really enough information for me to be able to tell you. I need to know what like your CPU is and that kind of thing. Hold on a second. Doug left. Sag. Hey, Avalora, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. It's been a little while. I swear to find the specs. Yeah, that's where that should show up. Maybe it's different on Windows 11 or Windows 8. Hey, Valora, it's been a while. Welcome in, welcome in. We are stressing right now. I have 
let's just say I have seven hours to finish this game. It's not super far from being done, but this room is not done. And I still have to set up the freeze laser, which shouldn't be too bad. And then the invisa spikes, which we might not end up doing. Okay, it's downloading the game on my laptop. Finally, some progress. Jesus. All right. Oh, let's figure out the lasers real quick. We can get out of all these now, finally. Let's go camera and place that one right there. Okay, and this one I have freeze is enabled. Why is freeze enabled by default? No. Freeze should not be enabled by default. There we go. This one is going to be a freeze laser. Uh, it's not going to be a homing freeze laser, it's just going to be a regular freeze laser. Okay. And... Let's see, how do I want to program this? Okay, so here's... Here, here's the deal. I want it to, when it hits us, instead of killing us, freeze us. So, I'll go down here and add a new thing. Which we'll need a sound effect for this now. Great. Uh, freeze. Which is going to stop us in midair. So it's going to... Here's all it's going to do. It's literally it. Just set our movement mode for a second. Set it to none. Retriggerable delay. For one second. Actually, there will be a duration. Freeze duration. And then set it back to walk. Easy enough, should be. Of getting off work and seeing my stream. I uh, I am definitely the best way for you to wind down after stream. Not chaotic at all. There's no there's no shot that your your work you're coming home trying to de-stress from work life is is going to be uh, calmed heavily by by this. There's no way. That wouldn't be the case, you know. Go back my music. All right, where is I'm I'm losing my mind. I'm I'm also not really awake yet. Oh Jesus, waffles, there's your problem most likely. I don't know if your laptop would be able to run any game. I think your phone would be better off than your laptop. Yikes. Yikes. <laughs> All right, I play Minecraft fine. That's there's no way that's true. There's no way that's true. There's no way you can play Minecraft fine, but my game that has zero lighting can't even open. There's no shot. That's either just a lie or you're doing something wrong when you try to play my game. <laughs> Because Minecraft barely even runs fine on my PC. And this thing is a beast. Unless you're playing Minecraft at like one render distance, you know? Alright. Uh, when is this getting called? This will get called if it is... Okay, we hit something. Wait, how does... Okay, if we hit something... Where... Wait, where's that... Oh, it's the line trace. There we go. If the line trace hits us, then we need to check something. Fine equals 30 FPS at 8 render distance with mods. Okay, yeah, so no. It does not run fine. Minecraft does not run fine. You've just done a lot of extra work that you haven't done for a game like mine. Alright, uh, this case we're gonna check, is it a freeze laser? Because if it's a freeze laser, then we don't want to kill the player. We just want to freeze the player. If it's not, we are going to kill the player. If it is, then we're going to freeze the player. For a duration of, uh, let's add a variable for that. Freeze duration. To be public, it'll be a float. Uh, by default, it'll be one. I want to make the player shiver, too. I think that'd be funny. Also, I want in construction script... Nope, not in construction. In the camera construction script, we're going to have another one that is, is it a freeze laser? 
And this is another problem, because we have to select... If it's a freeze laser... If it's not a freeze laser, then we do this. If it is a freeze laser, then we need to determine, is it a homing freeze laser? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Because if it is a homing freeze laser, then it'll be slightly different shade. Uh, so if it's not a homing freeze laser, it's going to be like a light blue. If it is a homing freeze laser, it'll be like a dark blue. Maybe that's good enough? Let's see. Oh, that only did that for that one. Whoops. Why not? What? Oh, because this isn't attached to here. Whoops. There we go. Okay. So now that is just a regular freeze laser. Oh, it stops us in midair. Not what I was hoping for. So not setting movement mode to none. We just need to stop active movement. <laughs> Pretty color. Pretty blues must touch them. I don't think that's going to help you, Andres. I hate to break it to you. Okay, so not none. It is going to be walking no matter what. We just need to stop. I guess we'll have can move as a boolean. Can move. This will be false and then true here. It will be true by default. But here we're going to set it to false and then we'll retrig it. Okay. And then here, when we go to move... Oh, Jesus. I gotta start moving things out of the way. Add some extra space. Okay. We're gonna check before we move every time. Can we move? So if we can, then perfect. If we can't, don't do anything. Sweet. Easy fix. Easy fix. Alright. Cool. Hit the laser. Oh. I can still jump. Okay. Need to do the same thing for jumping. Uh, here. Can we move when we jump? Okay. Jump is called... Can we... Oh my god. The jump functionality is chaos. Alright. Can we move? If we can. If we can't, then we're not jumping. Cool. Hit it. Okay, yep, I froze for one second. I feel like one second isn't enough. Yeah, one second definitely isn't enough. We're getting coconut mauled. Congratulations, gamers. Two is a better default. At least. Yep. Oh, that's that's much better. That is, that is a death laser, even though it doesn't actually get you. Okay, so now if we have another one next to it, that is a homing laser. Not a freeze laser, just a homing laser. Let's see how this interacts with it. Oh, it just killed me right away. It's just killing me right away. Okay, let's... I have to dodge this just to test it, and now I'm frozen, and it kills me. Cool. Although the homing laser is significantly faster and better at catching me, so let's make this one also a homing laser. This is just a homing freeze laser. Oh, I didn't give it positioning. Should turn the bean a darker shade to signify the frozen status? I don't know. I think I want to make it shake. Or like partially blue or something. I don't know. We'll see. Or maybe I'll like add a camera effect. Oh, hey, look. It downloaded finally. I'm going to open this up and we're going to see what happens here in a minute. Whenever that loads. Yeah, I'll figure something out to let you know that it's... Frozen? I just don't know what yet. Okay, so this... There we go. Now they're both chasing me. It freezes me. I die. And now I just can't respawn. So that's, uh... That's a bad one to have there. I'll have to have some sort of wall or something blocking you in so this doesn't happen. But whatever, because we're not going to have these here anyway. I just wanted that... I want to make sure that works. So, freeze laser. Freezes you. 
and now I can't do anything. I don't want to soft lock you. Oh, and now it's permanently on me. Okay, so once it hits you, it needs to stop homing for a second. So when it freezes you, we're going to set homing to fall. Well, okay, we're going to check. Is it a homing laser? Because if it is a homing laser, then we're going to set it to not be a homing laser for a second. Delay. Um, actually, yeah, retriggerable delay for this amount of time. And then set it to a homing laser again. So it does that, it goes back to just its regular search, and then it comes back to this, and then that. Uh, which actually means it'll be that plus of, like, half of it, or something. Plus, I don't know, let's just say one second, so that way you have a second to escape. After it lets go. Wait, what? It didn't do it at all. It was, it did fine a second ago. Really? Why did that- why did that change? That was fine a second ago. Yeah, it's not going back to what it was- Really? This is a homing laser. Yes. It's because re-triggerable. Alright. Delay. Actually, that shouldn't have mattered. I don't know what's happening there. I guess this is a do once. Maybe that's why. Because this also isn't just do once. This needs to be do once. Do once, uh, which actually wouldn't be done here. It would be done here. So this will be a do once, and then it resets when something else happens. Do once, uh, which is actually, yeah, yeah. So then it's going to reset here. Okay. Cool. That works. Hello? It doesn't work. Never mind, I'm a liar. What is happening with this? It's homing, it's freeze, and the... It's a freeze laser. Do once, freeze. Retriggerable delay. Maybe that's the... I don't know why that's suddenly not... It worked for one time. Okay, now it's working again. And now it's stuck on me. It worked once. Why? What? Whoa. That doesn't make any sense. Maybe it's this. Just delay. Hello. Delay. That doesn't make any sense to me. Okay, now it's back to that. Now it catches me again. And it's stuck. It just freezes itself. How does that make any sense? Oh, I hate things like this. It doesn't make any sense. Alright. Oh, okay. Wait, no, it does make sense. If it's not homing, then go back and reset it anyways. I think that might have been it. Okay. Why does it go- oh, because I'm leaving the zone. Okay. Nope, it's frozen. Oh, and now I'm unfrozen. So is it just not working at all? Oh, it's just not working at all. Once it hits me, and it's a freeze laser, print string, and do something. What is- what is this doing? Do it. It does it once. It's just infinitely doing it over and over and over again. Why? That doesn't make any sense. Because it's checking, is it homing? If it is, if it's not, if it is, then it's this, and it's not doing it. It's not, it skips it. So why is it why? Why would it 
what about that makes any sense? Okay, we need it to tell me when it's done, when it lets go of me. Thank you, Delfino Plaza. Delfino Plaza. Okay, it let go of me, and it got me again immediately. And it's just constantly doing that. Because for whatever reason, it's telling me that it's doing... I just don't... I don't get it. I don't get that. Why would it... It's... I'm telling it, it is homing, so stop homing. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, hey, look, now I can extract this uh, folder any day now. I'd love to right-click it. Okay, now it's loading. Oh, man, this P this uh, this laptop. Now let's go to the PC. This laptop does not work at all like it used to. Okay, what is wrong with this? Tell it that it's not homing for a small period of time. Just a, re a regular delay. E. e. We're, we're eing for safety. I don't get it. That should work. That should be working. There's nothing about this that's telling me that this shouldn't be working. It's It's gotta be this. It's gotta be this. So... That's what it is. We need to start scanning when that happens. That's so stupid. Okay. There we go. So instead of telling it that it's not homing, just tell it that the player's not in range. There we go. Uh, actually, no. It does need to be homing and then just start scanning. Oh, that's so stupid. Okay. Can it be expected that to be E sound from Rush E? No, R E is a reference to a stream that happened uh, like a week ago now. Okay, it hit me, it froze me, and then now it's back. It does that, it goes back to scanning, and now it's working. It needs to do that for longer. It needs to sit on me for longer before it actually does that, though. So we need a small delay. After it freezes me, delay for like a half a second, and then it can let go of me. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. So it freezes me, and then it lets go of me, catches me, and then it lets go of me. Cool. It got me. Okay. Interesting. Okay, it opened on my laptop. Let's take a look at this. Okay, here's Alpha 2. Let's, we'll, we'll go into full screen for this. All right. Here's my laptop opening the game for the first time. I did not test this. Let's see what it does. It should pop up and say Windows is trying to protect this, whatever. Windows thinks this is a virus or whatever. Um, any day now, whenever it decides to load. It's going to take its sweet time because this laptop sucks. Jeez. This is just me proving to you guys that this should run on basically any old hardware. Unless it's Waffle's laptop. Which is terrible. Did it- did I actually open it? I don't know if I actually started it. Oh god, what did I just disconnect from my actual PC? Or was that one of you guys with a blurp? I don't even know anymore. Alright, uh, can you see that? No, you can't. Okay. Well, you can see it opening. Oh, there we go. Yeah, Windows Defender is trying to protect it. Um, allow it. It's fine. Okay, here it goes. It's opening it. It's loading it. There's no loading screen, so it's loading it. I should add a loading screen, probably. If we have time. And there we go. And we're in. And uh, just for testing sake, you can see it's very low resolution. You can't see that. It's very low resolution. Um, I'm going to drop all my settings except for the post-process, and we're going to see how it runs. Low. Low. Because the only thing... Oh, I'll leave the effects, too. View distance, too. Okay, never mind. I'm a liar. Only a couple things. Uh, and then max FPS, I'll put it 60, because I know this thing can't run any more than that. There we go. Play. 
And there we go. Look at that. Smooth as butter. This is a garbage old laptop. It's running smooth as butter. Yeah, that runs perfectly fine. The fan isn't even... Okay, the fan's going a little bit. But nothing more than normal. So there you go. This should run on any old PC. Yeah, it's it's fine. It's This is fine. This is running well for this. It is lag spiking occasionally, which is to be expected. This is an extremely old PC. Oh, I landed. Uh-oh. I landed. Okay, it took a while before I could explode, so that might be a little... That might, that might make you guys struggle a bit, but yeah, if I do it again... Okay, once you do it once, it's fine. So, there you go. Now you have it. You guys, even if it's on a really, really old laptop, unless it's some piece of garbage that Waffles is somehow running on, you should be able to play it just fine. Should. Theoretically. So there you go. Now you have it. Now you know. Just put that there. <laughs> fine okay back to work cool uh, now the other thing that I need to do also if I make this not homing it's a freeze laser it's a regular old freeze laser if it hits me I'm frozen but it keeps going ignore the double music all right and let's jump into it yep and now I'm frozen all right, so we need like an ice sound effect. Still at it. Oh, you thought I was gonna be done by now? <laughs> no, I expect to be going until like 9 p.m. my time, so another four hours. If not longer, we'll see. Cause there's still a lot of things I have to do. Okay, so we have to fill this room out now. Um, But first, these commercial messages. Okay, no, let's um, let's look for a ice break sound effect free. All right, let's see what we can get here. What? That's a song. That's closer to what I was looking for. Kinda? Nope. 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 Maybe. Nope. 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 What? What don't I get to do? Apparently play the game, because I tested on my laptop and it ran perfectly fine. It took a long time to get it to run. Like, it took a long time to get it to download and then open. But once I was in, perfectly fine. Somebody clip it. Or highlight it or something. That's a- that- nope. 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 None of these are none of these are hitting, right? It's not just me. What is that? No. Nope. Just get a black sp a black screen and a non-responding program. So it's a black screen when it starts. Cause normally that would be a loading screen, but I don't have a loading screen, so it's just a black screen. If it ever does start responding, it'll be fine. But if not, then sorry, it's not going to run on your old PC, probably because of your CPU and your integrated graphics. Why are none of these loading now? None of these even fit anyway, so it's fine. Ice break. Started responding and kept on a black screen. Well, yeah, it still has to load. Even once it starts responding, it still has to load, Waffles. You have to give it some time. In fact, on an old PC like that, you might have to give it like 20 minutes. Welcome in, Josh. That's better, but still no. 
Today was the day I fell asleep watching a Vano stream. Let's go. I'm officially... Well, I mean, it's happened before. There have been a few people who have slept with me in the background. But there you go. It's, uh... It's official. I am background noise. Jesus Christ. I don't know how you fell asleep with all these noises. There was chaos going on today. Nope. There was a lot of, uh, there was a lot of weird beeps and sounds like that. That was just intense. Because they're at night. That doesn't matter, Waffles. It, it, it's the fact that we were playing... Okay, I'm going to pull up these sounds again. It's the fact that we were playing things like this. At full volume, by the way. People can sleep through that? That was, that was chaos earlier. Maybe it's just like, it reminds you of your childhood or something. That's the best one so far, weirdly. Hmm. Nope. Recording ice crunches, presume H4N, January 2014. Record level set to uh, 50. Thanks, bro. Uh, just horizon. sound effect, please. Really good. Surprisingly really good. Not good. Maybe glass breaking is a more effective sound effect? No. Glass break, let's see. <laughs> Jesus Christ! That's the sound effect of when our player explodes. Nope. Okay, not glass. Not gonna work with glass. Okay, but I can definitely do with one of the other ones that we have now. Can I go to downloads, please? Bring in this one. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Why? It's not a good sound effect. I take it back. This one where the dude talks for 20 minutes is good. Recording ice crunches. With Thank the you, buddy. For N, January. I think that's the spot right there. Start it right there. Gotta cut out all his voice. There we go. No, that didn't sound good. Will those blend? Not really, but I can crossfade that. I'm sure this is the most entertaining stuff ever for you guys to be watching. Where's crossfade? I know this has crossfade. Unreal Engine doesn't have crossfade. There it is. Crossfade. Yes, that's fine. And then I'll just fade this out. And then we'll just... Nope. We'll use this and it'll, it'll, it'll only go as long as the actual freeze duration. I don't know. Maybe it needs to start there. Probably better. All right, this will be freeze. SFX. In the same spot. Export and import it. Okay. SFX. Let's bring that in. Freeze. Cool. Uh, and then we'll make a queue out of that. It'll be the exact same thing, basically, as this. There we go. Modulate it, and then here, one, save. Okay. Cool. And now, well, not done yet. When we do this, when we freeze, 
play sound at location get actor location man there we go uh, and it's gonna be this sound nope I don't have it selected uh, this sound there we go okay here we go Excuse me? Why is this so quiet? Oh, right. Right. My bad. No, wait. Okay, we gotta normalize it. Normalize, please. I didn't do that much. Can I normalize this then? Can I just do this? Because if I normalize this... There we go. And then I can blend this. Effect. Crossfade. Cool. There we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Export as this one. Save it. Export it. Yes. Okay. And re-import. Freeze. Re-import. Thank you. It's so quiet. I don't get why it's so quiet. I just can't understand why it's so quiet. There. It's not even playing the sound. Hello? Why? What? Hello? Player? Oh, it's waiting until the end. Whoops. There we go. Uh, actually, it needs to create sound. Create sound 2D. Spawn sound. Spawn sound at location. And then... This is going to be the sound at this location, and then it's going to delay, and then at the end, we're going to check is valid. Because if it is, then we're going to fade it out. Fade out over the duration of like a half second. Sine wave curve. Cool. There we go. Better. Nice. Kind of. Eh. Not as great. It needs to cut off way quicker than a half second, so maybe like 0.1. And also, that is not the greatest uh, modulator here. I need it to be 1 to like 1.5. Better. That's, that's good-ish, I guess. I don't know. What do you guys think about that? I'll add a sound effect on top of it. Or not a sound effect. A, a visual effect on top of it. In fact, I should be able to do that pretty easily because of the post-processing thing I'm using in this. Um, post. Nope. Uh, this thing. There is a thing in here called freeze, I think. No, uh, ice, snow, snow, not snow, that's snow, uh, cold, all right, we're gonna scroll through it and we're gonna find it, never mind, I will find it, we're gonna bring, that, bring back the music for this, distance fog, what's this one, distortion, oh Jesus, there it is, frost, okay, frost amount, there we go, so what we'll do is in the player when this happens we're going to get actor of class this will be chameleon I know I'm not pronouncing that correctly I don't care and if it is valid if it's not valid we'll skip it but it should always be valid so it doesn't matter uh, and then we are going to set frost I guess frost should always be active, just set frost amount. What would it be? So if it's always active. Distortion strength. Oh no, okay, so it can't always be active. Visible area one advanced then. 
whoa, nope. Blending opacity. So it'd be zero to one. Okay. So it'll always be active, but it'll be zero right now. Cool. Okay. UE4 has stopped working. A problem caused the program to stop working correctly. Windows will close the program. Well, Waffles, there's your answer. Unfortunately, unless you get a better PC, you are not going to be able to play basically any Unreal Engine game ever because this is the most baseline Unreal Engine game possible. Hate to break it to you. Sorry, buddy. Alright, um... We're gonna set... No, get Frost Advanced and set members in. Set members in advanced effects. This is going to be blending opacity. We're going to do a timeline here, actually. Okay. And it's going to... We're going to do a sequence. Because we're also going to start this delay. So this will be play from start. This is going to be frost timeline. It'll be... A half second, if that. What did I just do? No. A half second. And it'll be this and this. This will be zero and zero. And this will be one and one. Not one. Uh, 0.5 and one. Like this. And this will be flattened. There we go. Cool. This is going to be frost timeline. Okay, and then as we update it, this is going to be the blending opacity. And there we go. Cool. We're gonna play from start, and then at the end, it will reverse from end. Actually, it'll just reverse. So we'll have it play, and then at the end here, reverse. Cool. Have a good laptop, but the screen got a little broke. Well, that's okay. Play it on that. That's, I mean, if you can see it all, unless it's completely broken. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's cool. I should also make the FOV zoom in on you. That's cool. Put it in rice. That's a really cool effect. I like that. Doesn't seem very prototypey, but it's cool either way. Um, maybe I lerp this to be half of what it is. Oops, this is the alpha, so it's 0 to 0.5. see that. Hello. No, it needs to go up to 1. Okay, I'm cool with that. Uh, and then... What was I just gonna do? Um... I completely forgot what I was gonna do. Oh, the FOV change, right. So I want to limit its FOV movement, because right now when we sprint... Where's the sprint functionality? Sprinting. When we sprint right now... That's happening here. We are telling it to, in, to change the FOV, and this is only going to happen if we can move. If we can't move, we're going to control the FOV elsewhere. If not, that's fine. Okay. Now... We're gonna set the FOV right here of this uh, over here at the frost here. Perfect. Cool. We're gonna do this, and then this is going to be lerp. We're gonna lerp between our current FOV. Get FOV. Sorry. Get field of view. And lerp to, let's just say, like 60. I don't know. Let's see. That's gonna really look different, but... Oh, it lerps way too quickly. Oh, it's because it's lerping from... Nothing. Oh, okay, I know what to do. It'll lerp from whatever the current one is, which would be, like, let's just say 100. And then we'll just take this and we will interp. So, uh, get field of view... Interp to F interp to the current to the targets Delta seconds of Delta seconds interp speed of like five Uh 
Okay, kinda. Now that looks weird now though. So I guess I would still have to do this. Nope, that still looks the exact same. Okay, so it's gonna have to just be this. And then maybe like 70 instead of 60, I don't know. That's, that's fine. I'm okay with that. I don't know, what do you guys think? I love the double music. This is, this is great. This is really helping. That looks good. I'm cool with that. We're spending way more time on this feature than I thought we would. Looks very cool, though. Alright. Sweet. Now the Invisa Spikes. Which are the last two gimmicks we're going to add, and then we just have to fill out this room and go from there. Okay. So, each of these spikes... Would it just be a material? I guess it could just be a material. Um... So if we go into here, materials, this is the one that we're using. So I'll duplicate this. And in here, in this, we're going to have a select, no, a uh, boolean static bool parameter. This is going to be um, invis... invis... In, invis... In, 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 invisible. Sure. I Wow, that was so hard to spell. Default is going to be not true. I'm going to select. No, what is... What's the switch? Switch. Static switch. This is the value. If it's true, then we need to... How do I do this? How do I do this? Because I want it to be, like, on movement nearby. I don't think we're going to get invisible spikes today. I think that'll be something we save for the full game later on. I don't think... Yeah, no. I'll, I'll leave this here. I don't think we're going to do that this time. I'm thinking through what it's going to take to make it happen, and, uh, yeah, no. That's not going to... I'm not going to bother with that. We need to get this done, so... Let's focus doing that and building this final stage. Okay, so here's the question, gamers. This is the ending right here, up top. I could change the way this is. I could make this different, uh, and I might do that where I make it like the end of the tunnel. In fact, I'm going to do that. Screw it. We're doing it. So I don't like this like tower thing. It's weird. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take... Did I do it at the beginning? No, I did something else at the beginning. Uh, what I will do is I will take this room, because it'll be about the size of this room. There we go. Okay. Let's just take this over here, and then we'll go from there. Cool. Put this right there. We'll put this up at the top. Right there. And center it that and then take this and flip it cool and then the only other thing we have to do is replace this with this and then it's wall time I'll do this because I could do that do as much space for this room as possible and then take this up top Right there. Kind of. Mm -hmm. I mean, I guess I can make this taller. It doesn't matter. It doesn't. It doesn't matter because I'm gonna do this differently anyway. So this is gonna come up. This can be a tiny little room right here. So it literally just needs to be what, like four by four, and that's it. I will group these. No, I won't. But I just want it to be, like, there. That's it. That's the size of the room. So this can be, what, like, two by two? Four by four? Yeah. 
Four by four. Okay, cool. I can delete these now. That's perfectly fine with me. Easy enough for me. Cool. There we go. There's our little ending room. Um, maybe that's. Oh, that's definitely too much. This could be like. Is that two? This could literally be like that. Okay, well, there we go. Changing some things. Nope. Okay, it's fine. Once this is done, it'll be more enjoyable, I'm sure. Two? Nope. Okay, it's all just the x axis. Great. Alright. Nice little exit room there. Uh, and then these don't need to be here. None of this needs to be here. Sweet. Easy. There's the exit right there. That's it. That's how we leave. Cool. I'm good with that. All right. I think a blurps may regret this. I mean, just set the prices reasonably and you won't regret it. Set the prices like I did and you'll regret it. Okay. What is this room going to be? Like, how are we going to get you up here? I think it, it has to be a combination of everything. In fact, we might want to end up pushing this room out even further. Just because of that. This might end up being a double long room. In fact, I'm going to prep for that just in case and we'll move it back. Unless I want to squeeze everything into this tiny space, but I don't think I want to do that. So I think I'll do this. I got to lock in for this, so we're going to we're going to really focus here in a second. Let's go out by like 5,000. Or 2,000? 2,000, okay. And just bam, bam, okay. Perfect. Nice. All right, double long room. This is the final room. And you have to get up to there. And uh, yeah, I, he, I asked last night what first favorite color was. Uh, he said black, so the ending is black. Perfect. Andres chip, <laughs> I would not recommend, I would recommend adding a chip redeem in your channel, but I would not recommend setting it to a low amount, unless you plan to stream very infrequently. Very e-frequently. Okay, what do we do here? What is our, what is our goal here? Because I want to do, I definitely want to incorporate the freeze lasers. But I, that means I have to introduce it, so we might end up doing two extra rooms. That is a very cool effect. I love that effect. I think that's the best way to do this. Oh, oh I'm, I'm giving myself so much extra work right now, but I think that's the best way to do this. Just add like a tutorial room and then add this next one. So we'll go over by 2000. Oh, I didn't bring this with it. Whoops. What do you guys think about the design of the pod? I know it's extremely simple, but that was like... I'm, I'm not a blender guy, so I had to look up a lot of stuff to make that happen. So I'm not going to change it, but I think it looks okay. There we go. Okay, so now we have an extra room, so we can do this now. I will do... This. And I think this is going to be a sort of... I don't know. I think this will be another lava floor room, maybe. Hmm. Want to stream more frequently, but when I move, uh, but for now, you'll see. See what I do. So, uh, people aren't going to get that many points then if you're not going to be streaming too frequently. So, you might want to set prices low to start. But, I mean, you saw how quickly inflation happened with the hydration. So, it's 
It's always possible. I do kind of want to make this another lava floor room. I don't know. Let's see. If I do this and give it the death uh, material, then I would have to move this in one, which is fine. It's no big deal. But now we have to find a position for the saving. Right. Because I don't want it to just be here. That looks weird. It's like a random freeze carpet. Oh, I'm still frozen when I restart. That's good. I want to freeze over the lava and see what happens. Okay, well, didn't matter. Come back. I love this double music. It's wonderful. Okay, cool. I'm cool with that. Nice. That's what I wanted, actually. Perfect. Alright. Um... Alright. Because I could just set this up, like, in a different spot. I could literally... I could make you do more, and then let you save. Like, th like this is kind of what I was thinking, is a platform like that. So I can take... Where's my cubes? Do I have a random cube? I don't have a single... I don't just have a one cube. Alright, I'm taking this one cube. Cool. Alright, it's game dev focus time, boys. We gotta make this happen. Let's move you over here. Okay. This is not fitting music. We need our game dev playlist. Give me this. That's what I'm talking about. Let's boost that a bit. Here we go. Alright. So, what I think I'll do is I'll add a save, like, corner right here. I'm also going to put this out here so I can grab it easier. Cool. All right. One, two, three, four. It's too much. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. And then this can be on this point. Actually, that might... Yeah, that's fine. And then I can have a moving platform here. That I think... I think I know what to do with this one. Let's add a moving platform first. Alright. I'm back in the zone. I'm back in the zone. I'm, what I, I learned that I really enjoy making challenge levels. Like, I, I learned that maybe I'm just a terrible person. That's probably the solution, or the answer here. So I just make... I just like making people suffer. Which is probably very concerning. Alright, so it's gonna go this way, and then it's gonna go back. I could make this a two one though. Again, kind of want to make that like that. Go there, and then the next one. Okay, first of all, both of these need to be linear. Okay, all three of them need to be linear. Okay, but instead of going that way, it's gonna go back now. But I think you can reach that without. Uh, is this gonna be a jump on, please? Uh, not infinite cycles. Activate on land. Cool. Oh, I started here. Whoops. Start me here. Me player, please. Right here. Cool. Oops. Okay. I don't think you can make that, actually. Oh, and I'm frozen. Good God. Oh, you might be able to make that. That's very unlikely, though. Oh, started moving without me. Yeah, I don't think you can make that. <laughs> well, not with the freeze laser. And I'm dead. I don't think you can make that. I could also just block that off. With something else. Okay. Well, good. So that puts you here. <laughs> could get frozen there. Um, this is kind of mean. It's also way too slow.
Okay, it's gonna go this way. There'll be some sort of platforming section here. And then what I think I'll do is I'll have nothing over here. So the next platform will be like here. So I can do this. Like that. Oh my god, welcome hey. Jin Codes. Thank you for the raid. Let's go. Welcome in. <laughs> Everybody panic. Yeah, I forgot that's my it's my raid notification. Everybody panic. Start screaming. Freak out. How's it going? Welcome in. Uh, th th thanks for raiding. Appreciate you. Uh, I have no idea how you found me. I'm assuming that uh, the software game development thing was a good idea. Thank you, Maker. Uh, welcome in. Let me... I remember that I'm supposed to do this now, or I remember how to do this now. Uh, yeah, okay, well, okay, my Twitch is breaking now. You guys broke my Twitch. There we go. Perfect. Guys, go follow Jin Codes. Alright. Epic. What were you guys doing over there? Lunar, no panic chips. Yeah, Lunar, stop panicking. Don't, don't, don't chip panic. Poor Andreas is never gonna be able to do anything. Boo! Jesus Christ. Oh, that's always active. That's not right. Thank you for following. Uh, thank you, thank, thank you, Jinkos, for following. Appreciate you. Um, let's make this activate on land. Oh wait, that's starting at the worst spot. That's not right. It should be there. We're currently finishing up uh, this game that I had to make. That I'm making in a week. How do you even do a game in one week? I'm one month in and can't even call my game a game. Well, here's the thing, right? This is. All of these prototype materials, right, this is, this is as simplistic as you can possibly get, really. So, you know, it, I didn't say it was a good game. <laughs> it's just, it's a game. And hey, you know what? I, it's a challenge. I've done 48 hour, I've done a 48 hour game jam before. I've done a 4 hour game jam before, which is something you guys never saw because I never uploaded that to YouTube. But, it's something that I will do again in a different format. It was a very cool format. There was a reason it was only four hours long, and you guys will see that eventually, so. That is a thing upcoming at some point. But, usually I spend unreasonable amounts of time, right? Uh, Bean Game, everybody's favorite of mine. Uh, I made a game called I Am Bean for Jacksepticeye. Um, and I made that in two months. I made a game for Lixian, Mark Player's editor. Uh, I made that in eight months. Uh, my first official Steam release took me eight months or more, so usually it's not this quick, but this was my challenge, so hopefully I can do something with it afterwards, turn it into a full release, you know. Maybe if I help enough, you'll be able to finish it quicker. <laughs> yeah, 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 there you go. Just uh, push harder. Start uh, screaming and, and, and pushing out your, your best efforts to, to help everybody program. That's what my chat tries to do, and they just end up distracting me, you know. Dope is a very experienced uh, game developer. Ask him anything. Give him your toughest problem. My toughest problem. Oh boy. Um, let me think. We had a problem earlier with uh, with audio that we just didn't end up even using, so it doesn't matter anymore. But the thing about the, th the thing about being a professional is it, it makes you really good at debugging issues, you know? Dude's taking it seriously. Hey, I was gonna try to think of something. I was gonna try to think of something to get you to, to test your professionalism. I figured it was sarcastic. Don't worry. I don't have anything off the top of my head. So it doesn't matter. Okay. What are we gonna do in this section? We need, uh... Oh my god, it's a nightmare over here. We need... I thought these were linked. Hello? Really? Did I not group those? Okay, I swore I grouped these. I guess we're gonna just- I'll group this one. Alright. This is a rage game, so don't mind all the million spikes everywhere. Is that all of them? Okay. Select this- nope, that's- okay, we're gonna redo that. Three. Two. Nope, that's the floor. Let's not group the floor into this. There we go. Group it, please. Thank you. Cool. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so I, Andres, I get what you were saying last night about looking in this direction and just seeing pure chaos. Alright, can I copy this now, please? Hello? Can I... Thank you. There we go. Alright. 
Do I just want to block off this corner? I guess I could just do that. That's not that intimidating, though. Maybe... Like that. Let's see. That's not that bad. I'll have to have something else there. This is a test of his skill at this point. So this has to be... Dangerous. <laughs> okay, well. And we're frozen? Okay. Yeah, I think that'll be a good point to test, like, to show off the laser as well. Okay, well. <laughs> well, that was bad. You saw what? Something you said? Uh, last night, uh, you said you looked in this direction, it was pure chaos, because I just, like, zoomed through here over the top, and, like, oh my god, it's just horrific over here. Good lord. That's all. <laughs> uh, okay. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'll take these as well. These are only two, though. That's annoying. All right, fine. I'll do this. Whoa. Oh, they're grouped now. Of course. Lunar will not stop giving you chips. You should... I don't know if you should appreciate it or be angry, but... It's not stopping anytime soon. Can I ungroup this, please? Ungroup. There we go. Uh, and then I'll do this. I guess this doesn't need to be the full... Yeah, I guess that's not necessary. I'll just take this. Alright, there, and then... Well, actually, I guess I could do like that now. Just give it more chaos. That's what we need. That's what this needs, is more chaos. There we go. Because he's going to get out of here, he's going to be in panic mode. And we're frozen. <laughs> oh, that's such a mean spot for the freeze laser. I'm going to move it a little bit, but it's a good, like, tutorial for the freeze laser. Because the save is over here, and you can just get back over here. Uh, I think we will add another one of these, though. Like, right there, maybe? No, that's mean. That's just impossible. And that does nothing. Other than scare you. For context, I'm making this game in one week so my friend can play it live on stream at the end of the week. So he'll be playing it tomorrow or Sunday. We haven't decided yet because he's got stuff going on. Um... So I decided, I, I told him first, I did warn him initially, hey, this is going to be a rage game, and he said, okay. So I have a feeling we may lose our friendship after this. I could do, I could do that. That's just mean. That's just too much. That's just intimidating. Oh, yeah, and it goes this way. Okay, well... I don't know why it starts without me sometimes. I don't know what it's seeing that's doing that. Don't mind the double music. Animated. Okay, this is just this is just a mean area. This is just really mean. I wouldn't be surprised if he hates me at the end of this, which is kind of the point, but I don't know why I did this to myself, because I, I did this to myself. This is... Why am I doing this? Right, we can do that. That's fine. That's better. We can do that for sure. Oh my god, no. Okay, that's... no. But if I... I can't put it here... Yeah, okay, this one's just not gonna go here. We could have another wall. Another wall of these like this. Uh, I think I'll just... I'll, I think I will do that, actually. Okay. But this is the final stretch. This is literally... We're in the last few hours here, so I have to fish this up quick. Uh, and then this can extend out, too. So we'll... This can go to, like, here. Wherever the front of that is. So, here? No, it'll go to here. Okay. Cool. That works. Yeah, that works. Uh, I can also do this. I could add trick spikes there, but that's just mean. I don't want to do that. That's too much. Maybe just like that. That's fine.
Yeah, we're gonna have to change the way this laser works. Oh, and you have to sprint jump that too. Uh, maybe I don't add those. Maybe I do this, actually. It's probably the way to go. Do that. Block and make him do a jump around. So I could get rid of these then, as well. Yeah, eh. It's okay. I'm caring way too much about how this looks visually. It's, it's just a bunch of spikes. Like, there's no part of this that's visually appealing. Other than the fact that it's kind of grid-based and that looks nice to me. And I'm gonna freeze? Uh-oh, uh-oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh! Why did it slide me? That was weird. I don't know why it slid me like that. I mean, that's fine. That also works. If I want that to be a jump around, it has to happen earlier. Which means it would have to be here. Then I could do this if I really wanted to. Right there. That's fine. And he'll think he has to go that way, but re in, in reality, there's a save over here. So, that works. Okay, this double music is messing with me. I would want to add, like, an arrow. Okay, now we're frozen, and we're dead. Okay. I love that freeze effect. That's really cool. I need to change the position of that, though, for sure. But, okay, so there we go. We get the save point, and then from here... Like, assuming we actually do get the save point, because I would assume that he's probably not going to get the save point. Let's... Okay. The music is messing with me. Okay. Let's do spawn six. Cool. Wait, is this spawn seven now? No, this is spawn six. Okay. So we start here. Oh, and then we have to get back. Problem. That I did not consider. I guess I got to add part of the floor there. Like, I could do this, and then just have it a simple jump around. And it's a harder jump around once you get going. So I could do, like, this. Problem is, if I do that, then it'll be clipping through- oh, it would be clipping through it anyway, so that doesn't matter. So I guess I could do that. Could you jump that normally? I don't think so. I think you'd have to jump around like that. I could just do this. Or even, like, I could do... Whoops. I could do this. No, that doesn't look good. Let's try that. Let's see what happens. Oh, this needs to face me. Is that gonna work if I face this way? Can I rotate that, please? Thank you. Okay. Nope, I'm through the wall. <laughs> okay. Not preferable. I guess I could have it facing... Nope. This way? That works. <laughs> Jesus. And I'm frozen. I don't know about jumping around there. That's, that's a bit much. Looking pretty cool, by the way. Thank you. It's uh, not as cool to play. If you guys would like to play the earlier builds of it, uh, or play it when it comes out, you can join the Discord. We have it posted there. Uh, what I can also do, actually... Dog? No. <laughs> what I can also do... I should do this. Here is the link. Can I just open the link, please? Here is the download link for anybody who wants to check it out. I should pin that. There you go. This is early build. There we go. That is version 0 0.7, even though it's actually like 0 0.2, because uh, people liked the idea of being 0 0.69, so that was the first version. It doesn't have any music or sound effects, but it is an early build if you'd like to check it out. There's no ending. You just kind of get to the end and it's over, but 
If you were interested in playing an early build, go for it and give me your feedback if you do, please. I would love to hear it, even though I'm kind of out of time to change anything, so... Uh, but for the, for the full build, you know. Alright. That looks kind of dumb, but at least then we can get back. Yeah, I did not consider that we have to get back on the platform. Unless I just want to get rid of that, those spikes up top, which I could do. I could just do that. To then let you get back. Instead, so I can get rid of that. Whoa. So I could start you here. Yeah, because you, you could make that for sure. I love the freeze laser. Freeze me! <laughs> Alright, I got you, John. Here you go. Cheers. Uh, I should hydrate it with just regular water, shouldn't I? Uh, cheers! Everybody hydrate with me, by the way, remember? I should have turned on some epic music for that. I hope that was worth your 1,500 points. <laughs> yeah, thick water bottle. This is my gallon jug. I'm supposed to drink a gallon of water every day. Um, I don't, usually. I usually drink a lot of my huh, hashtag dubby uh, or sodas and stuff that I shouldn't be drinking. John's just got a super hydrate, by the way. I just hydrated like 12 times. But yeah, if you guys aren't already in the Discord, consider joining. We love having more people in this community. This community is extremely supportive. So if you guys stream as well, consider joining the Discord because a lot of times, like the just the past, the past week, we've gotten two more people affiliated because of it. So yeah, if you guys are streamers or just if you enjoy what we're doing here, hop in. We'd love to have you guys. Uh, I could do this actually. All right, I got I got to lock back in because we're it's 6:30 and I need to this this needs to get done. That's better. That works. All right, then we're gonna jump to here and then we need more stuff over here. Uh, I can actually start with these are grouped, right? Yeah. Okay. I'll start with one of these. Oh, these are grouped. I'm an idiot. <laughs> These ones are grouped. All right, sure. Are these all grouped? Yeah, all these are grouped. All right, let's go back to the ones that aren't grouped. Uh, and let's just do this. There we go. That works. Oh my god. All right. Uh, do I want this one here? Yes. That's really mean. Again. <laughs> I promise you guys, I love Israel to death, alright? I really do. I swear, I promise. I, pr I promise I don't hate this man. I do, I, I, I really do, I swear. Okay, that's just, no, that's impossible. It's just a lot of the same ones at that point. This music is very fitting. Oh. I just I just hope he doesn't think uh, that he has to go the whole way. Welcome in, Willow. How you doing? All right, we need to we need to pause the music when I play test. All right. You can tell how much you love him from the amount of times you've said that's just mean. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I do it anyway. Is the problem? That's the real, the biggest, the worst part of it is that's just mean, but I do it anyway. <laughs> and I feel very little remorse. Hello, dog. Jesus. Dog is terrifying. Alright, no. no. <laughs> Stupid freeze laser. Okay, it's possible, but no, I'm not going to make him do that. We can do that. There we go. Much more reasonable. But also I have to consider at this point he's gotten more skilled at the game. So maybe a challenge is in place at this point, you know? Maybe a challenge is reasonable. I'm doing good. I'm a little stressed. I'm, I'm, I'm a little stressed. Okay, no, it's not the end of stream. Guys, this is... No, it's not the end. I know this is... 
This is this is like this is my stream trying to shut me down. No, it's not goodbye time. Why are we in this playlist? I just realized wrong playlist. This is the one we were playing before. Let's uh let's 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 here. There we go. Okay. Uh. Pfft. Okay. I'm. This part's gonna be tough because I I want to do more things other than just these because I want this to be a section about the lasers more so a section more than a section about the moving platforms because we've already done that and we're gonna do more of that over here so this I don't know I guess I could I could move like this and put this over here and then that'll be there and okay so then this will be out a little bit Come on, give me that. No, okay, okay we're going to go back to full screen. There, and then back into the corner. Cool. I also could just put the save over there, but I also feel like that's extra mean and not necessary. Now this music's kind of fitting, and we're dead. <laughs> okay, the double music is not fitting, but... We'll add something else there, but we need to get to here, and then we'll go from there. The doorway I'll move over to, like, here or something. That works. Now it's extra mean. <laughs> hey, you know what? I care about him a little bit. Clearly. At least a little bit. Maybe not. Maybe it's not so clear, but, you know, I'm trying. <laughs> um, Because hmm. here's the thing. I just, I want him to endure a challenge. He accepted the challenge, so I'm just, I'm giving him the challenge that he accepted. He doesn't know what he accepted. He's purposely been avoiding stream, so he doesn't get spoiled. Uh, and I'm sure we will we'll remain friends for a long, long time after this. Definitely. It's the thought that counts. I don't know if there's a whole lot of thought going into this other than how do I ruin this man's day, but you know what, I'll take it. <laughs> can do like this. Is that off? It is. It's off by 50 now. Uh, lame. There. Uh, I could do this. Maybe? Okay, that doesn't really fit. I think I'll just do it as a one by one. Can I please? Thank you. Okay. That looks really stupid, but you know what? I'll take it. I don't know why it's moving by 30. It should be moving by 90, but whatever. 90, please. Thank you. That's kind of mean, but also it's not that hard to avoid. That's not what I copied. That's what I copied. I can do that. I don't know. Let's see. There's a little open space here, which is going to get covered, so it's fine. That is a terrible jump. And we're frozen. Oh, I don't know how I slid off of that. I don't understand how that's working. It shouldn't be doing that. Double music again. Here we go. Oh, that's harder than I thought it was. Maybe not that, then. Because it doesn't move fast enough to do that. Uh, let's... let's not do that. I just need something here. Hmm. I could also just move this over slightly. Because the idea is to make these progressively harder. Not, you know, have a break here. Which it kind of feels like it is. What did I just do? Oh, I moved it up. Whoops. I could do that. That's really not. Unless I want to make those flying spikes. I could absolutely make those flying spikes. 
Maybe I will. Maybe that's what I'll do. Let's do that. Uh, these? No. Uh, these. It's a good one to copy. Cool. Let's take this over here. We. All right. Let's make a sign that says "Made with Love." Yeah, that'll be in the credits. Don't worry. In the credits, I'll say, um, w w or like at the beginning, at the very beginning of the game when it launches, it's like, "This is a rage game. Beware." Made with love. Much love, Vano. Okay, and then this will be back. Can this flip, please. Spin around. There we go. And then back more. No, right there. Perfect. That's that's nice. That's safe. Yeah, XOXO. Oh, I forgot that I put the... I, I literally forgot about the thing that I just put there. That's great. Okay, well, you just have to run past that. That's not that bad. It is pretty close, but... Well, if I did that... Can I not have this music? This music doesn't fit at all. This does. There we go. Yeah, that's not that bad. Okay, that works. Okay. And once we're here, now comes the question of how do I introduce these lasers? Because this one needs to move. This one's fine, but it needs to... Also, it needs to... I need to just reset it in general because that's been changed. Uh, do I have another one here? No, okay, good. Let's just place a new camera. Uh, let's put it over here, actually. Above the entryway door, I think, is the best way to go about it. Put it, like, there. Uh, and it can search kind of down. I'll actually give it a very specific path. So it'll, it'll search over here, starting over here. At, like, the save point, the center of the save. Or actually, like, at the back of the save. And then it'll stretch over to here... Problem is, it might not hit. Okay, so I'll do like this then. That way, it's forced to search really far. So, this will be a freeze laser, not a homing laser. Let's see. How's that look? Okay, it's, it's hitting the save. It's not perfectly hitting me, but that's fine. Oh, it's mostly just looking down. Yeah, no. Okay, so I'll, de I'll definitely add another one in here. So, we'll do. Like this. This will kind of be its padding. Can I make this linear? Well, actually, that's fine with a curve. Kind of curve out like that. It'll start hitting this point, which it doesn't quite reach fully. It needs to reach further over here. So back to, like, the corner. Yep, that's better. Okay, because now it'll reach out. It'll be searching... And then it curves around into that corner, which is devious beyond anything. Uh, is that going too far into the corner? No. That's perfect. The only problem is that it doesn't... Okay, so here's what we'll do. We'll make it a closed loop then. Um, but if it's closed loop, then it's... Okay, let's, let's see. Because if it's a closed loop, then it'll at least come back down and around. And try to, like, hit the front search area. Okay, the closed loop portion of it needs it to, uh, whoops. Hello? Can I grab that, please? Because with it being a closed loop, there's another problem of it being in the, uh, like, of it only going in one direction, which is annoying. Okay, so it comes around, it comes back into the center-ish. Wait, it doesn't super freak out there. That's better. It will hit me there. Yep. Freezes me. 
and it scans around, and then it just goes back around its path, which I guess is fine. That's also fine. I do need this to come back out further, though. Okay, so it's going around. It's doing its search. It's then searching there, which is kind of perfect. And then it can hit me here. It's not likely to, though, so that I went too far. Great. Right there. The lasers are definitely one of the hardest parts about designing the challenges. It is doing its job. It's doing exactly what I wanted it to do. It's just... Yeah, that works. And then you can learn that the laser freezes you. I just want it to be likely that you learn early. Can we go back to placing me at this point? So, okay, now we get out of here. And now, okay, it's... L I froze even after I died. Okay. So if I jump through, depending... Oh, you can skip it now. Oh, I just realized. If he knows to do that... Which he won't know to go there. I'm frozen now. And I'm dead. Yep. Oh, I'm permadead. I'm permadead here. I won't be in-game because you can't actually spawn there. This is just for testing's sake. Okay. So yeah, you could skip to there. Theoretically. Unless I want to make that not possible, which I could do. I could just do this. And then make him ride the thing. But also, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should leave it so that if he figures it out, he can skip. And save. Because the idea... Let's, let's go back to the previous section and try it out and see... Should I just let you save immediately? Because I feel like that th this might be too too much in one go. Okay, so this is the previous save. We just finished the laser maze section. And now we're up top over the laser maze. Also, I just realized that this is still going. So there's going to be some lag. There we go. Now there's not. Cool. So this section right here is the jump arounds. Also, I made this much harder now. I realize that now. So that might make this... <laughs> Jesus. Nope. There we go. There we go. So I do have to consider heavily his skill with platforming. Not the best. So making him do these precision, precision jumps many times over. Maybe not the nicest thing a friend could do. A little cheeky work around. I mean, if he figures it out, if he recognizes that that's what he's supposed to do, because he might not even look in that direction because the, of the fact that the moving platform just starts moving the other way. So he might be able to take the little cheeky uh, shortcut, which we'll call the Vano skip, because Andres has the Andres skip that has already been patched out. Uh, I have, I now have the Vano skip. Actually, I already have a Vano skip earlier on. So this is the Vano skip 2.0. I'm the developer. I don't get to have a skip. That's just called dev cheats at that point. Why did I reset there? It was dumb of me. All right. Your skip was patched out twice because I didn't think about the camera. The first time, so the the platform, the whole platform was moved the first time because you were right. Yes, it was it was literally right there. Uh, the second time, it was because I forgot that the cam that you can stand on the cameras. So, you know. Not my fault. That's 100% my fault. It's my game. And dead. <laughs> yeah, this might be really mean to not leave that as an option. Because I realize now that there are a lot of platforms here that you have to be pretty skilled about getting to to progress. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Good god. Jumping on the outside is necessary, because you do get that little bit of extra space. Whoop. Okay. That jump sound effect is good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that. I wasn't as good with it earlier. Also, the breaking sound effect is perfectly fine. 
It's clunky, just the way that I want it to sound. Nope. I'm not restarting that again. What do you guys think about yellow being the color for the checkpoints? I'm not a huge fan of it, but I don't know what else to make it. Other than, like, green when you land on it. Which I was considering doing, and I might still do. No, oh, what am I doing? <laughs> Wrong way. I do love that he's gonna have no idea where to go. Or what to do. I don't know why I love that. Andres called me a sadist last night and he's probably not wrong. Because why else would I enjoy creating things like this? I've always enjoyed rage games. I don't know why. Not like necessarily enjoyed the action of playing them, but I've enjoyed watching people play them and I've always enjoyed making them even though I've never made a full one. So this will be my first like fully finished rage game. Even if it was only made in a week. That was bad. So something about me, definitely the sadist nature. I love pain, but I don't love enduring pain. I'm not a masochist. I'm a, I'm a cross between Markiplier and Rubber Ross. 100%. Okay. And Gerard the Completionist. The Finishist. The Finish Man. The Done Man. Marcus. Marcus. I'm Marcus. That's my new nickname. We found it. It's Marcus, but it's more pronounced Marcos. You know, I'm dead. This is not going well. I am not progressing anymore. So, yeah, I think I think the answer is that okay, first of all, this is mean. Like this is incredibly mean. I should make these faster so that he has more opportunities to move. Searching speed will be 50. And then let's put this up here and test it and just see. Okay. Player quick spawn. Thank you. Yeah, that's better cuz then they're not perfectly synced up, but they have a higher chance of letting you down. And by letting you down, I mean letting you get down. There we go. Yeah, there's no way he's going to make that. There's no way he's going to get down here and take his time from there. But you can stand on this. Which is definitely the best solution. Is to just jump here. Yeah, there's, there's no shot he goes for that. So I think he, he might not even go back that way. He might not even do this. Also, that freeze laser is not moving fast enough. I think I might want to flip it the other way. I think I might want to just make him go this way first. So we'll go... Not forward. I landed into that. Oh! That's not right. Okay, ugh, that's annoying. Whatever. Uh, forward, but... Just delete that, and then we'll start it. Here. No. That was necessary. It's just flipped. So this one is gonna be here, and this one is gonna be... Here. See, I'm a nice guy. I'm a nice guy. I do nice things sometimes. In this mean game. I'm choosing to make. Yeah. That's just more reasonable. That way, he doesn't completely obliterate me. Oh, that needs to go all the way. There we go. Okay. So I make it here. Yep. Oh, and then you have to jump. You still have to jump around that, though. So in that case, I will. Wait, no, I have to leave that open. I mean, you could skip. 
You could do that. In fact, I might do that anyway. I might just close it off. Force you to do that. That'd be funny. <laughs> I guess you could jump over it, theoretically. I would do this instead. There you go. Do that. Mmm. Yeah. Yeah, maybe this. And then this. And then this one will be up. Like that. That works, I guess. Get chomping. Poor Andres. Oh, that's messed up. Oh, wow. That's actually harder than I thought it was going to be. I thought that was going to be incredibly easy. I guess it isn't that bad. Interesting. Let's put me down there and see... not that bad. I don't really like that one as much. Yeah, I like it better just as like, you could jump around or you could jump over if you catch it in time. But either way, it's a trick jump. Yeah, I like that more. Thought it was okay. It's okay, but I think it's just... Because he's going to be scared no matter what coming in from this section. Yeah, I, I think I'll... Yeah. Like, it's it's fine, but I think it's better the other way. Alright, let's put me back here at spawn six. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Willow! This is not a horror game! Why do you guys do this when it's not horror game time? Jesus... Uh, okay, let's put back it. Nope, spawn six, please. Good lord. Alright. We go here. Oh, and then it's gonna do this every time. That's also annoying. Because now he has to wait for this to happen. That's not that bad, though. Unless you freeze like that. Frozen again. And I'm frozen again. <laughs> Alright. I guess I could also just have this always going, but then that's really mean for the previous section. But what I could do... I could get rid of these, at least these two. So you can stand there. And then I can make this one an always active one instead of what it is currently. So, this. It's always active, that way it's always moving, you don't really have to wait too long for it, and that way when you get down here, you can just stay here. The lasers can get you, but it's not super likely. And then that way, when you respawn, it's already coming over to you. That's not that bad. In which case, I will also do this to block off that cheat way. Because then you don't need it to activate it. Andres, I hope you're prepared because I do have just like the slightest desire to see you test this. I know you're not paying super close attention to streams, so... You know, it'd be nice to get a... Is that one infinite cycles? It is, isn't it? Yep, let's not do that. It's one cycle once you land on it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Great start. Yeah, because then at least you can orient yourself and then it's already on its way. Okay. There we go. 
Whoop. Nope. Yeah, some of the spikes fly. We can make the spikes fly. It's very funny. I enjoy it. This is... Uh, I don't know if you know of the game... I, I keep mentioning this every time the flying spikes come up, but I don't know if you've heard of the game I Want to Be the Guy. But in that game, there are flying spikes, and that is exactly where I stole that idea from. And by stole that idea, I mean it's flying spikes, right? It's nothing crazy, but still. <laughs> well, that was stupid. Okay. Yeah, this section's hard. Turns out, turns out this rage game section of a rage game, really hard. That laser's good, too. I like the positioning of that laser. Well, man, one tiny tap and you're dead. It's, it's aggressive. I didn't realize how aggressive it actually is because I'm barely, barely tapping it. Okay, there we go. Then we're here. And once we're here... What do we do? Because I want this to be a general platforming section, so I think we'll bring back some normal platforms. Okay. Let's get some more from, like, the beginning section in here. Oops. Do this. No, can I stop grabbing the floor, please? This, this, this. This. And then I'll bring in some other ones from other areas. Okay. Cool. So then that way we can go from here to something here. But I have to go left more so because the exit's right there and that's going to be easy to skip to. I may want to do something like this and then use an inch oh you know an interesting thing to do could be forcing him to jump up top here but that's no that's not anything groundbreaking can i put myself over there please let's try that There. Cool. Okay. Yeah, that's nothing crazy. Could you make it to that? I don't know if you could make it to that. I'm just messing this up horribly. Dexter, please! <laughs> yeah, let's see. Could you make that? No, you couldn't. Okay. I could also do, like, I could do this, and then I could take, oh, those are, uh, grouped. Let's ungroup that. And I could do something like that. Instead of having this. So then I can have platforming over there. You can make that. <laughs> there goes the spikes. Um, interesting. Hmm. Or I could make these pillars taller and then have platforming on top of that because this room is kind of tall, but I don't necessarily need to fill the room. This is the, like, introduction area to the freeze laser, so that's why I'm like... I don't want to do too much here, necessarily. This one has a custom pattern, so I'll just bring in a new, a new one here. i put it, like, here, maybe. Put it in the center, actually. There we go. Rotate this. There we go. It's not going anywhere yet. I could have it do this, maybe. So then this freeze. Oh, that's not a. That's a homing laser. Homing off, freeze on. It's trying to freeze the lava, quote-unquote, which is funny. Huh. Yeah, so that's just gonna do its back-and-forth pattern, which isn't anything crazy. I should honestly have more freeze lasers around in this entry, like, T 
teaching section. I could also put the save in that cor in this corner instead, but I don't think I want to do that. Cuz I want enough for the I want enough in this room for the next room to to warrant a save. So I think I will have to go up and kind of spiral around maybe. I don't know. I'm indecisive. We could bring back pipes for the upper area. It would really tie everything back together. Because this is a totally new mechanic now. Oh, Dexter. Okay, I think I could add... I'll definitely add a laser... Freeze laser above the door. So, I can definitely do this. Back here. I can definitely do that. I may even be able to bring it down a little bit. Oops. Jesus Christ, that's loud. Alright. So there's those. So then whatever's happening over there, there can definitely be some sort of section over there. Because right now I'm pretty sure if I get to that top platform, I can just leave. Oops. Okay. Nope. Jump. See, right now if I do... Okay, well I didn't jump, but I'm pretty sure you can make that. So we'll, we'll... This won't be the platforming here. I'll definitely do something different. I can't, I can't even make that jump anymore, apparently. There we go. Yeah, you can definitely make that. That's easy. It's an easy jump in comparison to all the other ones. So we'll, we'll make this different. I think I want this to go... I like the idea of making you go over here. That's funny that the spikes go flying. Um, and then do some platforming here, maybe go up. Or, like I was saying, we could have another section of moving platforms above these with, like, pillars higher. What am I trying to do right now? Just kind of figure out, like, what the layout of this room is going to be. Because here, here's the deal. Um, I don't know how much of this you've seen. I, I think this is, this is new to you. So, currently we have... This is like the start area, and then this is like the teaching you how to how to move. This is what I'm calling pipes. It's a lot of jump around type jumps. Then we have this section, which is the first like moving platform over lava section, which is extremely difficult, probably the hardest section of the entire game right here. Then we have the introduction to lasers, and then the test with lasers with all the platforming, which goes way all over the place. And then we drop through here, and then we get into this area, which is introducing freeze lasers. And after this introduction to freeze lasers is the final room, which I don't know if it's going to be too wide. Right now it's too wide, but uh, this right here up top at the end, that's the ending. So I'm trying to figure out like what is this room here going to be to be a good like tutorial into the freeze lasers, putting it to good use, and then applying everything together in one like finale room. And I have five hours to do so. <laughs> so yeah. Oh, I need to let my dog out. Give me a moment. I'll be right back. Enjoy some music. And then I still, what I didn't consider is that I also still, I forgot to mention this before I came back. I also still have to make some sort of ending sequence for this, which I think is literally just going to be a fade to black. I don't think we have enough time for more than that. Um, but yeah. Or like a fade to white, maybe, because he won. Had an emergency pop-up, so he might, be, uh, might not be on stream today. Alright, that's alright. Hope for things going well over there. Sorry to hear you ran into an emergency, that sucks best of luck um but don't worry about stream don't worry about streaming streaming is not your top priority all right let's 
so okay I kind of want I think this room might need to be a little smaller I think I might need to shrink the room slightly because this is the freeze laser teaching zone you know and the entryway there doesn't really teach it all that much, so this area needs to teach it. And it's not quite teaching it yet. So I think what I'll do is I'll start with a wall here instead of these platforms. So I'll move these platforms over. I'll start with a wall blocking this area so you have to go like in. And then I can have a small little laser zone, I guess you can call it. I also probably should do this. Let's let's change the way this works and just do this instead. Also snap back to 100 please. There we go. And then this, whoops. Up like that. And then I'll put spikes on top as well, of course, cuz you can never have too many spikes. Cool. Then I'll take this wall and I'll move this over and use it here as well. It's just gonna be taller. Cause this will be a nice little. Can I? Can I please? Can I? Why? Why does this? Some, why? Cause box brushes in Unreal Engine are the worst thing ever. I swear. Sometimes you just cannot edit them. Sometimes it's just not an option. There we go. Can I grab the top? I can't grab the top of this. Why? There we go. Now I can. Sure, that makes sense. Uh, I will go up like this. Not a good top point. I should go higher than that. I guess I should just go to the ceiling. Yeah, that feels weird. Maybe this will be the start of the next area instead. <sighs> and then I could attach this... Like as a corner piece, maybe? Yeah, I don't like that. I'd rather keep it like this. This is the difficult part because, like I've said many times, I'm not good at level design. I try my best, not my thing. In this case, it's a lot easier. But, that doesn't make it, that doesn't make me good at it suddenly. Uh, I will add a moving platform here that is just going to be this way. And it is going to be activate on land, not infinite cycles, forward, 200 speed, that's fine. And it's going to take me to he maybe here? No, here. And then it will... Can I make both of these uh, linear, please? Linear? Cool. Uh, and then I'll take this and I'll go this way. Yep, and then I'll go this way. So maybe this entire area will be a moving platform section. Because I could do like this, have it come over here like this. And then end like th like like this drop you off there I guess let's, let's see it so it'll go through this section nope you have potential I have my scouts watching this stream well thank you I appreciate it oh this is th this is not this this is like a terrifying section here because uh, once again okay uh, mods can we change the title from one day remains to five hours remain because <laughs> that's a whole lot more accurate uh, I don't like that okay, if I do this and then join watching and good luck with the rest because it's been getting very late need to sleep all right well thank you for stopping it I appreciate you have a good night all right if we go this do I just zigzag here I guess I could
I need it to stop like here and then go to here. That's fine, I guess. I don't know. Let's see. And I'm frozen because I tabbed out for a second. Okay. And this is only activated on land, so you're never going to be able to skip to this. So that's nice. We can have other stuff going on here. We'll have the lasers going here for sure. The lasers are going to be the main part of this challenge for sure. These other platforms probably won't even be here. And then we're here, and then we can go to here. I think I'm okay with that. There's nothing going on up top, though. Which is my only concern. Not that it needs to. It doesn't need to. I need to remember. Like, okay, it's fine. There's nothing going on up top here. There's nothing going on up top here, really. There's nothing going on at all in here, really. So, it's fine that there's not that much going on up top here. It's okay. I need to remember that. It is okay for these things to be kind of empty. Okay. It's In fact, it's better for, like, teaching these laser portions. That's a nice little tunnel there. And then we'll zigzag our way this way. Nice. We'll have other stuff going on in here. Okay, I think I need to fill this area without, out with lasers, and we can go from there. So, freeze lasers, lots of freeze lasers here, maybe even some homing lasers. I don't know if that'll work on a moving platform, but we can try it. So, let's do that there, and then one there. And then I can do the exact same thing on the lower wall here. This will be a lot of lasers here, but it'll be good for tutorial sake. And there's no benefit to jumping on those walls, so it's fine that there are cameras here. The only thing is the spline is too low now. It's this, right? Or wait. It would be this. Yeah, that's way too low. Let's go up like that. Okay. Then I can adjust those as necessary. Cool. Okay, let's see. That is a lot more lasers. And they're all there just to freeze you, so it's gonna be- it's gonna rely heavily on knocking you into spikes. Yeah, so there's a lot of lasers to dodge here, there's a lot of other things to dodge as well. And frozen, yep. And then we make it to here. Not that bad. Not that bad. Okay. Uh, I can also add another one of these right here, probably. Let's see. See, so yeah, that one's checking this area out. Let's try again. Let's see. They need to be different speeds, too. I need to remember that. Alright, uh, this will be like 500. This one's fine. This one can be 300. These should each be like. 800. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, this one's scanning back and forth like that. Nice. It needs to scan the area better. It needs to be more like a... I'll, I'll change the scanning of that. These are all scanning in sync, which doesn't look great. It works fine, it just doesn't look as good. Hmm, that needs to be a retriggerable delay. Okay, can we get that, please? Um, this is happening here, this is a regular delay, this needs to be a re retriggerable delay. Cool. Why is that doing that twice? Oh, that's why. Okay, and then in here, when we do this, this needs to be retriggerable delays as well. Um... Retriggerable delay of 0.5. And then... I mean, this shouldn't happen anyway because of this. It's do once. But if a different laser hits you, it should do it again. So this really probably won't do anything. But we're out of time to make it do something. So, oh well. It's fine. Okay. So if I get hit twice, I should... Technically freeze twice, but I don't think it's going to. That's fine. Maybe it did? I think it did. It is. It is. It's, com it's keeping me frozen. 
Oh, that's great. Okay. I don't think that's what... Uh, maybe that did fix it. I don't even know. Okay. These need to be different speeds. This needs to be like 400 and reversed. Actually, this should be like 450. Keep it offset. Let's see. I need to stop turning the music back off. I'm going to do testing like this. This one, I'll, I'll change the scanning pattern. These ones, too. <clears throat> nice, nice. Progress. Yep, that looks better. Oh my god, there's so many lasers here. And in this area, we can add, like, the homing lasers and things like that, too. I keep saying we can, but we are running out of time. This needs, we need to work faster here. Okay. So this one's pattern is going to be very specific. Where's the start of this? Is it here? Okay. So let's make it. Let's make it search like this. Kind of going in a square and we'll close the loop. And I will move them all down. Like that. Okay. And they will this will go in a circle. So closed loop. Thank you. Cool. Scanning the area. Generally it's that's not gonna work. Okay, but this this can come in inward and then it'll be fine. Okay. That's and then in there and there we go. That's better for the center. Then it can do that. That needs to go back way further. Why is that stopping there? That's weird. I'll have it go all the way back. Yeah, that's way better. Then it's trying to scan the entire area. I will actually have it come out and up more, I guess. Because if it's scanning all the way to over here and up like that, then maybe that's better. Oh, that's going way too far back now. Never mind. Maybe actually I'll just do this. Whoops, not the whole thing. What are you doing? This, up. Okay, well now it's like that, which is not exactly what I was trying to do. This should be linear, please. Thank you. And like this, which is now all over the... I don't know why it moves it like that. That's so annoying. Linear. Doesn't have to be perfect, though. But at least there, it will go over and up. Which kind of works, but also kind of doesn't. That works. Enough. It should go higher, maybe? Eh, maybe not. Here's what I'll do. I'll make it come to a point. Up like that. That's its search pattern now. Which goes all the way over there, which is too far. So, down a bit. Maybe like that. Yeah, that's better. Okay, that works. Good enough. Okay. This one, I kind of want it to scan in a circle-ish, which I guess I could just do a triangle. Uh, and this one won't be closed. It'll just go back and forth. It'll just look like it's being closed. Nope, that sucks. Let's not do that. Let's make it go the opposite way. So like this. Okay. It's going to go that way. I mean, in all honesty, it should just go there. and So it should... This one shouldn't exist. It should just be these two going like this, back and forth. That's fine. And maybe this one should be a homing freeze to show you that that can exist. Needs to be closer. 
So maybe here it'll come into the center. Like this. That's fine to be like that. Curved. <clears throat> hey, would you look at that? My voice is starting to go again. Nice. Means we're actually getting stuff done. Okay, that is not far back enough. Maybe back to like here. And then can I auto the curve, please? Uh, no. Alright, fine then. I'll just do it myself. Okay. Works for me. Now it's scanning. Goes way too far that way. So this should just be linear. Let's see. Because it goes over there into the corner for way too long. And my playlist just stopped. It just decided it just decides not to do that sometimes. Alright, you know what? Let's just go back to this. Why not? It's mysterious. Fits kind of. It spends too much time in that corner. Where's it going? Oh, that's why. Okay. So I'll do this instead. Maybe. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, kinda, except I'd rather it go this way. Like that. Okay, so it comes down. This one should also probably be faster, maybe? I'm not sure. Okay, nice. That's good. Because then there's a freeze in that area as well, and it'll come back. Cool. Okay, that works. And then I will make this a homing laser here. So let's take the root, move it down, over, offset by 50 apparently, and then scale it up. When we're in this little box here, in fact, actually, when we're in this area in general, I will just scan the whole thing. So right here, if you're in this area, it's going to look for you. Sweet. Actually, we'll just go to like there. There we go. Okay. And it will be a homing laser. A homing freeze laser. I'm in here, it freezes me. And it leaves me until it realizes that I'm back. And it freezes me again. It leaves me, realizes I'm back, and I go here. It's weird that it was like... It wasn't tracking me there. So it is tracking me. Oh, Jesus. Okay, it's tracking me. I go over here. It's not, why is it not tracking me there? What? That's part of the area. That is part of the area. That's weird that it's not. Okay, whatever, it doesn't matter that much. Um, I also, ooh, this could be an interesting one. We can add one of these small ones on this wall to track as a homing laser here in this area. That way you always have to be moving. It doesn't have to be a good track, but that'd be interesting. So it'll scan normally, but then when you're in this area, we'll just grab the trigger root and we'll move this down and over to here. So then whenever you're in this area, it'll start homing on you. Or trying to, at least. There we go. And this will be a homing freeze laser. laser. Or just a homing regular laser? No, homing freeze. That's the whole point of this area. And I can make the other ones regular lasers. We can start to combine it at that point. Because there are so many lasers over there. Jesus. Oh, I'm frozen. And we're in range now. It's homing on me. Okay. I'm frozen again. Jesus again. Oh my god, yeah, all these other lasers need to not be freeze lasers. 
Maybe that last one is, but this, the all of these are just gonna be regular lasers, not freeze. And we're here. Oh my god, the colors. Oh my god, so many colors. And I'm dead. Oh, that is a rough area. Also, I keep getting frozen. I need to not get frozen if I'm dead. <laughs> that might be too many lasers. I think this is a little too much going on here. Let's remove this one, remove this one, and then we'll center these. That's more reasonable. Then we have to place the obstacles and we have to move on and actually start making some progress. Also, this is offset by 50, I realize now. There we go. I'm frozen. Okay. Why are those lasers... Why is that one orange? Oh, it's, it is red. It's just orange in the water here. The water? Frozen again. Oh my god. Infinitely frozen. Okay, this needs to be a much more relaxed follow. So, homing speed, 20. And search speed needs to be 50. Okay. It's trying to home enemy, and it did. It succeeded. There's a lot of lasers here. Oh my god, and they're death lasers too. Oh, that's 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 much. That's a bit much. Maybe not this one. Cuz I want to add other spike things as well. The freeze laser is a very interesting addition. And I'm frozen. Well, and it's still homing on me. Okay, well, I'll let go that time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, I'm dead. Oh, that's a freeze laser. I got scared over nothing. This is difficult. This part is tough. Building this area is going to be really tough. Okay, we're going to rely a lot on these, for sure. We'll start with one here. Hundred. We'll put some other things there. This is going to block mm, some of the homing laser. Do that, and then have another one there. Like that. Maybe? Or like that, potentially, as well. And then have another one here. That works. Have one last one like this in the dead center of it. No, that doesn't fit. But I can have more of these types, like against walls and stuff. That'll be helpful. Okay. And this one over here. All right. Flip this. Okay. Put this like here. Okay, that's good. And then I'll have a few more of these. Because I want this to mostly be open for the lasers. So the lasers are the real challenge here. But these are still good to have. It's like that is fine. And then maybe one right here. Can I grab it please? Thank you. Or I could center the exit with this room. No, I don't think I will. Let's do this. Make it look like you could end up going that way, but you don't. Alright, let's see. I think after this, I'll end stream a little early. Just to leave you guys with a final surprise, right? So that way, when first plays the game, you won't exactly know the ending. And we're frozen. And we're dead. <laughs> So I think that might be a better a better way to go about this because I was just gonna go until I finish the game but I think maybe I will I will leave this for you guys 
to be surprised by how it ends. These freeze lasers are no joke. Ignore the double music. You can't escape the homing freeze laser. I don't think we're going to use a homing freeze laser. Yeah, that's too much. That's just too much. Trying to escape that the whole time? Yeah, no. You froze immediately. Right. This one can be homing, though. I still need to add things in this tunnel here as well. Oh, Jesus. Let me go. Thank you. And we're frozen. Yeah, because that homing freeze laser there is deadly enough. Freezes me. Freezes me many times over. Oh, because it was still following its path, right. Okay, we're going to turn this off and we're just going to go here. We're frozen. Sweet. Because I still have to add the death counter and stuff like that. Which will be very, very easy. That's nothing crazy. Oh my god. Oh. Okay, and it killed me. Man, these freeze lasers are no joke. Oh, we need to make it so that you can't zoom when you can mo when you can't move. Let's do that real quick. And I think that's where we'll end. I think that's where we'll end. Okay, because I I've been going for a while. I need to cool off. I need to lock in and not talk. I need to just kind of go. Whoops, where am I going? No, come back. So the last thing I'll do here is just one very quick adjustment in the spring arm control. With zooming, wait no, not here, uh, in the scroll wheel, scroll wheel, zoom, there we go, where if we can move, then we can do this, if not, then I'm not going to do a thing, okay, cool, that'll fix that. Yep. Okay. Sweet. Yeah, freeze freeze bay freeze beams are working now. Welcome back, Rose. Uh we're gonna end. We're gonna end so I can leave you guys in the dark about how the actual game is gonna end. Cause I think it'll be more interesting if you guys get surprised. Also, I need to lock in and stop talking about everything. I need to just I need to freeze myself and focus. That one is moving way too quickly. Uh, but yeah, okay, we're we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna end it here. We're gonna end it here. I need to lock in, finish this thing out. And we will we will go from here. All right. Let's end it with some epic music. Also, my voice is dying, so this gives me a reason to to not be talking at all times. Okay, we are going to end things out here. I am going to finish this in the next five four and a half hours, whatever it is, and uh, yeah. Another very long stream, another seven and a half hour stream, which, I mean, that's not too terrible, but yeah. So thank you guys for being here. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out. Uh, thank you for your suggestions and um, on all your support while watching this. Hope you guys enjoyed. I sure did. Uh, I'm a little stressed, but other than that, still enjoyed this process, and I can't wait to see what First says about it. So yeah, I will see you guys uh, tomorrow for something. Don't know what, yeah, or, uh, well, no, tomorrow we're supposed to do, okay, so if tomorrow doesn't work out, we'll do something else, if it does work out, then I'll see you guys tomorrow to see first reaction, so uh, get ready for that, because, uh, if it doesn't happen tomorrow, it happens Sunday anyway, so close enough, one of the next two upcoming days, he's gonna play it, so until then, I'll see you guys next time, <laughs> bye bye, that was good timing, <laughs> see you guys, bye. I, I muted myself. Bye, everybody. Bye, bye, bye. Goodbye, goodbye. Everybody dance away. See ya.